<laughs> right. Thank you. Thank you. I just uh, took a moment. I was going grabbing things. I've got my drinks, which is good. Uh, I just need to make sure everything was set. Okay. <clears throat> uh, hello, everybody. We are going to be playing Tale of Two Wastelands today. For those who missed the previous stream, it was 38 minutes of us trying to make it work. Because it turned out I had an outdated version of Benny Steals Your Stuff that, that's unselected now. Point is, I'm going to go over the mod list really quick. We are using Tale of Two Wastelands. That means when you go to the Tale of Two Wastelands website, you're going to want to download all of the plugins listed and install all of the plugins listed. You do not want to mess up any of them, or you don't want to miss any of them, I mean. Then there's a, um, a video, not a video, sorry, a guide. It's by the Viva New Vegas guy, and you want to follow that as well. So, um, you you also want to get the two tail of two wastelands hot fix from the Viva New Vegas guide. It's, it's actually called the uh, Best of Times guide, but it's on the same website, right? Uh, then Stewie's tweaks adds a it changes a bunch of things in the background. Uh, that includes all kinds of um, uh, like like just oh uh, well, c can you sleep under this condition or can you fast travel under this condition? You know, it, it like it allows you to customize how the game functions. And that includes, like, uh, configuring hardcore mode and things like that. It, it basically replaces part of Project Nevada's tweaks. Um, uh, the uh, Stewie's Tweaks Essentials INI is an, it's a file for Stewie's Tweaks that basically automatically checks all of the bug fixes that, that to give you a good experience in the game. Uh, Benny humbles you and steals your stuff is when you leave Fallout 3, when you're done with the Fallout 3 game, uh, and you travel to the um, uh, to the Nevada Wasteland, you're going to be overpowered. You're going to be like level 20. You're going to have in-game gear because you just finished Fallout 3 and all of its DLCs, right? Well, Benny shoots you in the head and steals all your shit. You're reduced to level 1, although you get to keep all the perks you've gotten from completing quests. So you'll be a little stronger than a normal New Vegas character, but you'll still be a, nor a mostly normal New Vegas character. And you uh, you have to earn your levels back just by playing the game. You earn your stuff back by um, getting it from Benny's suite. So, um, it, yes. Now, um, it, the, uh, the Benny humbles you, steals your stuff, and locks you out of DC is on my mod list. It's at the very bottom. It's an optional plugin for people who cannot resist the temptation to go back. Yes. Um, anyway. Let me see here. Ain't that a kick in the head is a fix about 10 to 20% of the time. You when you transition over to the new wasteland, you'll just end up dead and you'll feel like why why am I dead? Anyway, this this fixes it. There it, it's not a consistent bug that happens, but it happens sometimes. And this is the Benny humbles you and steals your stuff patch that makes ain't that a kick in the head patch work cuz the the Benny humbles you and steals your stuff breaks that uh that fix basically. Anyway, um, what's it called? Um, new, new Vegas interiors adds a lot of new indoor locations to New Vegas. Um, note that it is buggy, glitchy, and broken. That is to say it has, it has way too much stuff. Okay. Like the, the sheer number of objects that are scattered around it bloat your save. So the remastered version of it not only fixes up some issues here and there, uh, it patches some bugs, but it also removes a lot of the extra clutter that would otherwise uh, bloat your save. Speaking of bloating your save, a world of pain for Fallout 3 is probably going to do that because it adds a ton of new locations to the Fallout 3 wasteland. And, um, you know, another interior mod adds more locations to the Fallout 3 wasteland. So we basically have uh, one New Vegas uh, um, new wasteland area and two uh, Fallout 3 new wasteland areas. Like, just just... Bunch of new locations scattered everywhere. It's going to be great. Uh, the only the only graphical mod we are using is Two Wastelands Redesigned. That's it. Nothing else. 
Two Wastelands redesigned simply like fixes everyone's faces up, makes them makes ugly people look more ugly, makes less ugly people look less ugly. You know, it generally just touches up everyone's faces in one way or another. So, but but there are no other graphics mods. Everything else is mostly vanilla graphics. Uh, Trail of Crumbs is a quest mod that isn't uh, like uh, that will lead you through uh, Fallout Three content. But it's important to know that um, you get a bunker, like a, like a player home at the end, and this makes the bunker better. Uh, cyberware is something that used to be part of Project Nevada. You could get basically get cyber enhancements for your body, and um, certain NPCs would install them. This is the TTW version that um, you know the patch, so it it adds the cyberware to the Capital Wasteland as well. Um, in theory, don't know about practice, but in theory, the cyberware should still be in you when Benny shoots you. So whatever, um, but when you get reduced to level one at the beginning of New Vegas, you should be able to, um, you should be able to take advantage of cyberware to have a little bit of a leg up on, on the re rest of the game. Um, the mod configuration menu is, it just, it only exists for one mod and that's the just assorted mods. All the other features of um, uh, of Project Nevada um, got kind of folded into just assorted mods. So the ability to sprint or do other things are all um, are all in just assorted mods. Um, that that's and so you'll be able to configure them with the mod configuration menu. Uh, Cyber Jam just allows the um, it's a compatibility patch between the cyberware and the just assorted mods. Uh, delay DLC stops all the DLCs from popping up all at once when you uh, get started. I think the only exception is Mothership Zeta because we're using an additional plugin for it. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. So Root and Loot takes all of the containers around the wasteland, specifically the um, like table, like like sorry, like desks and other things like fallen over vending machines. Things that would should be containers, but for whatever reason aren't, and makes them containers, and it'll it'll dynamically populate their loot based on the 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 area it's in, basically. And supplemental ammo crafting basically says, hey, uh, all of the uh like most of the guns in the game have craftable ammo. What about these specific guns in Fallout Three in New Vegas? Why why do they not have craftable ammo? And it adds those, so you'll be able to craft ammo uh, for every gun basically. Uh, a hardcore perk every level. In hardcore mode, you only get a perk every other level. In regular mode, you get a perk every level. So uh, this just makes it so you get a, a perk every level on a hardcore mode. Because I don't see hardcore mode as hardcore. I see hardcore mode as a um, as a way to get a hunger, thirst, and fatigue system in the game. That That's what I see it for. Essential caravan merchants is part of that as well. Um, in hardcore mode, they are the caravan merchants are quite killable, and per permanently killable. They do not respawn. So literally you lose a feature of the game at that point. And that is sad. So um, we were just making sure they can't die. Immersive primary needs audio notifications just basically says, oh, I'm hungry and your stomach growls. It's n not nothing special. That's it. Um, harder Mothership Zeta. To, if, when, when you get beamed up to Mothership Zeta, your stuff gets stolen. And it usually gets put in a place where you can get it pretty easily. Well, in this, your stuff gets distributed around the ship in like a, a further off location. Makes it you, may, you have to rely on the alien stuff for a lot longer if you're going to do Mothership Zeta. Uh, eat the baby. So uh, long ago, um, the pit, you, you know, the, the pit DLC has a baby that is immune to radiation. She is the future. At least that's what they said. So um, in the the meme scene, you'll you'll see these pictures where it says eat cannibal, eat the baby. That was not a feature of Fallout 3, but it was a mod. Well, this is the Tale of Two Wastelands equivalent version of eat the baby. And so, um, you know, you, we, if, if we want to go cannibal and we want to eat the baby, we can. It's for, for the memes and the immunity to radiation. Now. Um, the, the Some Guy series is a series of, um, what, what do you call them? Um, a, a, a series of, um, 
quests that are, as, as someone said, loosely based off of the author's favorite movies. Anyway, um, point is, we've got Las Vegas Killer, Bounties 1, and then the Tale of Two Wasteland Patches. Finally, <clears throat> finally, we've got the Living Desert. Living Desert adds choices. In, uh, well, New Vegas already has choices, but the Living Desert adds consequences. That That is to say... Um, say you decided to ally, um, you decided to, um, side with the NCR and the Brotherhood in the ending, you know, using like Yes Men or whatever, uh, you can actually get, um, you can actually see, um, the results of that. And now the Brotherhood and the NCR will patrol together or whatever, you know, whatever you, whatever the ending text says in the game. You'll be able to, through functional post-game ending, continue to play after the ending, and then it will, um, like you, you'll see the results of your your actions. Same thing in game. Like if you were to piss off a certain faction too much, they'll send assassins after you, specifically that faction. You know, like or, or those settlements, whatever. Um, quest quests and things like that are. Um, <laughs> Uh, are a absolutely uh, functional in that way. So, otherwise, we are good to go. E everything should be great. We should be playing New Vegas in, uh, you know, about six to eight months whenever we get around to it because we're actually just going to be playing Fallout 3 at the moment. So, um, we aren't going to do any of the anything of the sort. Um, we, we are not... Uh, the, it, the slider mod is uh, invalidated by Stewie's tweaks. If we wanted to tweak it there, we could. We're not going to. But if we wanted to, we could, like, um, we could do it there. Mm. Anyway, let's go. We are launching the game. Yes, indeed. It's going to take just a moment. I do like that... Uh, logo though very good mm -hmm. hey John you want to have a look at my discord server under uh, Zarek's nonsense at the very top look at uh, twitch it's like two paragraphs long it's pretty big mm. okay Give me a second, I'm alt tab. I need to like move my uh, game around. So there we go, we're set. Okay, let's get started. New game, everybody. Very good. So, start in the Mojave Wasteland or start in the Capital Wasteland. The Capital Wasteland is recommended. Yes, indeed, recommended. Let's do it. Unfortunately, as nice as that is, I'm gonna have to, oh boy, I'm gonna have to mute it because that is copyrighted music. Yes, indeed. I have to mute the copyrighted music that is playing. True, it's true. Um, my goodness. All right. Why recommended? Because the storyline is built that way. Because Benny's supposed to humble you and steal your stuff. That's why. Yes. All right. We should be good. Absolutely good. Yes. Anyway. Um. Yeah. Uh, Harold linked the um the mod list for you guys. Absolutely. Uh, so the radio has to be turned off. Correct. Copyright infringement. Yes. Uh, we we are going to have the radio turned off. That's right. Uh, whether or not it is this specific copyright or not, um. Uh, sorry, whether this specific version of the song is copyright, We can have music on. The, the, the game has music, which is different to it. Benny steals the radio, yes. <laughs> exactly. That is a pretty cool scene, though. I like that. Yeah, we could have the Enclave radio on. But um, here's the real issue. A lot of people do covers of um, 
the big songs, and that's that's where we have issues. Yes. Are there mods with copyright free music? I mean, that'd be cool, wouldn't it? That that'd, that'd be really cool. But um, yes. Yeah, so, um, why not see it? The bones of our wasteland. We're gonna skip now. And then I'm going to turn the sound back on. I just wanted to have that nice little shot of the wasteland. Let's go. We are born. Okay. We aren't playing New Vegas yet. We're currently in the uh, capital wasteland. So you're, you guys are going to have to wait for your, uh, your amazing experience, okay? D just wait for it, okay? Let's see. Are you a boy or a girl? That's a complicated answer. <laughs> are you a boy or a girl? Uh, no, the answer is we are a boy. You know what I mean? Oh, boy. We, we haven't gotten to New Vegas yet, so we are very much a boy. We, we, we are currently doing the uh, the, the Fallout 3 um, uh, content. So uh, we, we are firmly on the, the boy side there. Yes, yes, indeed. <laughs> boy. It's a boy. Mm -hmm. A boy. We've got a son, Catherine. A beautiful, healthy baby boy. That's right. Oh, oh James. We did it. A son. A beautiful son. You've got a bright future ahead of you, son. Well, I'm, sure. I'm sure of it. <laughs> I'm sure we have a Look bright future. At you. Look at you. Hi there. I'm your daddy, little guy. Daddy. You're going to need a name, aren't you? Your mother and I have been talking. What do you think about... <laughs> what do you think about player name? Um... Ahem. Ro Ro Robert. With, with the two Bs. Uh, Ro Robert is his name. Get ready for the adventures of Robert. The boy. That's a good name, don't you think? Fits you perfectly. Looks like they've finished the gene projection. Let's see what you'll look like when you're all grown up. <laughs> Definitely not that. Uh, let's go. Oh, uh, g g g g uh, 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 by the way, it changes his race. Uh, I remember once I, I made a, a female character, uh, set her as African American, changed her skin so she was white, so I um, and it, it was the most amazing shit ever to watch the um, uh, the because the, the, then the father and and mother were both uh, it, you know it had a white skinned kid and it was it was very interesting, like you you can you can do all kinds of like configurations you can do Hispanic and then you can change the face details to uh, to to make yourself look African American and vice versa like you you can you can change all of that stuff yes. Uh, yeah, DB, it's, 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 it's kind of, it, it's really funny because, like, you can have parents that do not match your character at all, basically. Anyway, uh, I, I think Caucasian is fine. Like, I, I don't usually play self-inserts, believe it or not. Um, you know, it, Bobby BB was a, a fucking amazing, uh, hilarity, but no, we're not doing that. So, um... Uh, yes, as, as far as um, as far as that goes, my goodness. Mm hmm. Okay, this this is starting to look good. Uh, ho hold on. Okay, there are twenty presets and they are all genuinely awful. I I I, I am uh, I I'm definitely. Okay, let's let's use this as a base and customize, shall we? Yeah. Yeah, let's use this as a base and customize. So, yeah, that, that'll be good. Hmm. Yeah. So, we we could be... Yeah, it, we could. We could get that double chin. You're right. Uh, no, we're, we're going light. And we're going thin. Jeez, it literally just makes you wider or not. Oh, no. Oh, boy. Okay. Ahem. <clears throat> So, brows. Uh, oh, no. Like that. Yeah, th this this could go very bad. N nothing. Uh, none of these are uh, are great, to be honest. 
All right, let's just give us the eyes. Yeah, yeah there, there's uh together. We go yeah, I am creating an abomination. <laughs> it's glorious, glorious. Okay. Uh so yeah, the 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 the, the tiniest nose. The, the the tiniest nose. Absolutely. Let's go. Oh wow. That that widened is bad. Yeah. Looking good so far. Um mouth. Yeah, mount mouth is fine. Okay. Um do I intend on doing the Fallout 3 main quests? Probably. Although after, you know, some exploration and things. Yeah, absolutely. Ahem. Yeah, it's best not to do too much unless you want to mess. Correct. Absolutely correct. Yeah. It is really funny. Regardless. Okay. I think we're good. I think we got our shape. Yes! <laughs> oh my god. That is glorious. Yeah, I, I'm fine with this. Eyeliner, you bet. You, we need all the eyeliner we can get. Let's go lips. Uh, dark, yeah, darken those lips. Um, yep, yep. That, that's fine. Uh, geez, less, less of a beard, thanks. Okay. Holy crap. Eye color is ghoul. Raider. Blue. I like how raiders all have red eyes. That's fine. Okay. Uh, make sure we mi didn't miss anything. Uh, forehead, brow, jaw. I could have sworn I missed something with the uh, hair specifically. Is it? Yeah. I mean, we, we, yeah. We, we've got. Um, I, I, is there no way to change the? Um, oh. The hair is its own tab. Well, that explains everything. Okay, swept back. Oh, God. <laughs> We're just looking at this insanity. Okay, balding, burgund, buzz cut, center, combed. Yeah. Uh, fallen hair. Oh, jeez. <laughs> the feathered. Let's see. Combed, flat down, framed. Okay, full brushed is probably going to be the way we go. Like, we're probably going to go with the full brushed. Uh, but I'm, I'm still looking. Se Sephiroth! Oh, no! Oh, no! Sephiroth! Fucking <laughs> Sephiroth! Uh, shaggy long, shaggy suave, short. Let's see. Oh, Sonya hair. That Sonya hair looks pretty good. But, uh, let's see. Y yeah, I, 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 I'd be stupid not to pick Sephiroth. Uh, be because, like, it's just so dumb. Alright, let's go with facial hair and, um, Daddy-O. No, 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 I don't think so. I, I, I think we're gonna go with, uh, uh, just no facial hair whatsoever. Yeah, yeah. A swashbuckler, though? No. No, 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 no. We're we're go we're going with uh, with no facial hair, and then uh... <laughs> all right. So hair color. Uh, let's go look at these presets. Yeah, I'll, I'll, auburn. Yeah, we'll, we'll go with the auburn. I think. Uh, wait, what, what's this one? Black. Uh, rosewood. Yeah, we'll go with rosewood. There we go. <laughs> Final Fantasy 16 at home. <laughs> Yeah, I think so. I, th I think this is what we're gonna be. Yeah, no, no, not no silver. We're going with this. So, this is our this is our future. You said uh, leave the goatee, love the hair. Yeah. Oh boy, Final Fantasy VII remake looking good. Something like that. Yeah, we're we're done. Yes, yeah, so this I want to be this character. You're going to look a lot like your dad. Oh, I'm sure. See that, Catherine? <laughs> oh, oh, very strapping. <laughs> It's a big world out there, son, full of all sorts of people. 
What about you? What kind of person are you going to be? Uh oh. What kind of person are you going to be? <laughs> uh, you said society has degraded. Holy shit! I, I had no idea, man. Like that's that's fucking nuts. Like now now that you presented the evidence to me, like yeah, I pr probably like our society's fucked. Holy shit. Okay. Uh, what do we got? So. <laughs> uh geez i have to drag this window somewhere else there we go we got it okay so first of all first of all we need to go down and we need to select wild wasteland you'll notice that uh uh you notice that wild wasteland does not consume a trait two traits left wild wasteland is free okay so knowing that wild wasteland is free what else we got are we a hoarder I, I I think we might be a hoarder. Let's see. You gain 25 pounds carry capacity, but uh, but suffer minus one to all attributes when you're not carrying it uh, below 160 pounds. It's true. We're definitely a hoarder. There's no question about it. Yeah, we're definitely a hoarder. Now, what else? Okay. Um, Hot-blooded... Yes, Logan's Logan's loophole. Uh, let's see, skilled. We are skilled. Uh, my goodness. Uh, I, I like how the the text is corrupted a bit. One agility, but your limbs are more easily crippled while using guns and energy weapons. We fire more slowly, but are more accurate. I don't think so. I don't think we need to be accurate. I think we need to be stupid. So uh, four eyes, fast shot is uh, less accurate. That's pretty good. Um, yeah, but again, Wild Wasteland no no longer takes up a trait due to Stewie's tweaks. So we're um yeah uh, we're, we're like built to destroy Flamer, uh, fear of enclosed spaces, early bird, uh, fast shot. Yeah, I I don't know. I like I'm I'm looking at all this and I'm thinking just hoarder. I'm I'm, th I'm thinking that that's our character. That's our only trait is we. I mean we're a hoarder. That that's it. <laughs> <laughs> it's our only trait, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <clears throat> okay, so that's it. Wild Wasteland and Hoarder, I suppose. And I, I don't see a reason to use any of the other ones right now. Um, yeah. yeah I, I, I don't think so. My goodness. Okay, we're going. We're go we're gonna be a hoarder. You're just James? A Catherine. James. Catherine. She's in cardiac James. arrest. Start compression. Get the baby out of here. Move, move. One, one thousand. Two, one thousand. No, we're not Come that on. skilled. We're Hang smart on, though. Catherine. Hang on. Okay. One year later. Don't look straight into the light, pal. It'll hurt your eyes. It's just something you could use to down here. Come on over here, son. Motherless. Come yes. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Uh, it, we're, we're already motherless. Keep that in mind, okay? Uh, like, that that's that's serious business here. Yep. Mm. Okay, so, we're going. Walk to daddy. Sorry, I'm, I need to jump up here. Daddy. Yes. Come to daddy. Yes, I'm, I'm busy. I need to get inside this toy chest. You can do it. Okay. Very good. You can make it. There you go. My goodness. Just a year old and already walking like a pro. Your mother would have been so proud. Listen, kiddo. I know you don't like it when daddy leaves you alone. But I need you to take care of yourself for a minute. You just stay here while daddy runs to his office. You'll okay. be okay, pal. I'll be back in a Goodbye. bit. Goodbye. Yeah. Don't know what they were thinking doing this intro the way they did. It's uh not great. Yep. Okay. Dada. Yes. Exit the playpen. Very good. Dada. You're special. S stands for strength. P stands for perception. 
E stands for endurance. C stands for charisma. I stands for intelligence. A is for agility. L is for my live streams. Okay, let's see here. Hmm. E. Uh, C. Yes. Okay. We are we are smart. We can talk to people, and we aren't very lucky. There we go. <clears throat> See, we did it. Let's review. We, we are smirt, and we're a little bit personable, but we have shit luck. <laughs> That's it. We're all done. <clears throat> yes. Indeed. I need that Nuka truck. Give me the Nuka truck. How the hell did I reach that thing? I have super arms. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. <laughs> you are quite the little explorer, aren't okay, you? Okay, okay, okay. Serves me right for trying to pin you in. True. Come on over here. I want to show you something. Uh, all right. See that? All right, fine. It was your mother's oh, favorite on. passage. It's from the Bible. Revelation 21.6. Right. I am Alpha and Omega. The beginning and the end. Hey, at least it isn't, um, <clears throat> uh, let, let women remain silent in churches, so they shall not speak, it must remain in submission, so saith the law. Uh, th 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 at least it's not that, that one. This, this one's a little more politically correct, I, th I think. I will give unto him that is a thirst of the fountain of the water of life freely. He always loved that. Mm. All right, come on. Let's go right. see if your little friend Amada wants to play. Holy shit. Ahem. Yeah, yeah. I was gonna say there. There's a lot of lot of quotes they could have said, which were not good. They, yeah, yeah. There were a lot of quotes they could have said that that, that would have been bad for for the game. Mm hmm. Okay. Do, do, do. What do we got? Uh, how do speech checks? Uh, I have not. There's a mod that turns the speak checks into, um, uh, what do you call it, uh, Fallout New Vegas, but I have not installed it. Yes. Okay. Let's go! It, of course Xenogears starts with that. Uh, no, uh, you shall be as gods, uh, yeah. Okay, where was that? Why are there hearts coming up from the side of my freaking chat window? It's terrifying, scaring me. Yes, it's just, but but yeah, yeah. So what I'm trying to say is that um, uh, do, do not uh, uh, do do not look for 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 a deep story here. We're we're gonna we're gonna reference these uh, really quick, like yes. Not great. We're, this is not, this ain't a religious stream. This ain't a politico stream. This is um, this is a rattle the thing and occasionally make snarky comments that I'll regret later. That that's that's what I actually mean. Okay, J -j just a heads up. Like, jeez, I can't even squeeze through here. The ba the baby is too wide. Okay, everyone, <laughs> the baby is too wide. <laughs> that is that is the. Uh, the, the phrase for today. Holy crap. <laughs> what the hell? I can't even get on the table. This this is terrible. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. These experiments Don't be a damn fool. The experiment to prepare. To prepare to survive. Surprise! 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 Surprise. Turn the lights on too fast. Stay. You blinded the poor kid. Happy, Happy birthday. birthday! Happy birthday! Can you believe it? He is growing up so fast. Happy birthday, pal. I can't believe you're already ten. I'm so proud of you. Oh boy. Congratulations, mother. young man. I don't have to tell you how special this day is, do I? Mm -hmm. Down here in Vault 101, when you turn ten, well, 
Are you ready to take on your first official vault responsibilities? I see. So here you are. As overseer, I hereby present to you your very own Pip Boy 3000. Get used to it. You will be getting your first work assignment tomorrow. <laughs> she doesn't have a Pip Boy. Enjoy your party. You're only ten once, so have fun. I will. I will have fun. But let me look at my Pip Boy first. Oh boy, my stats are all low. My, my stats are all really low because I don't have enough stuff. I'm a hoarder. I, I, I suffer from... Uh, I suffer from extreme anxiety when I'm not carrying at least 160 pounds of crap. <laughs> glorious. Absolutely glorious. Uh, we need more strength, right? Uh, strength is how much you can carry. Yeah, we need more of that. Uh, let's go. Happy birthday! We really surprised you, didn't we? We did! <laughs> Your dad was afraid you were on yes. to us. But I told him not to worry. You're so easy to fool. Mm-hmm. Very good. Very good. Uh, let me see here. Uh, <clears throat> I was going to say, uh, great party. Thank you. You're welcome. But really, your dad did most of it. I just help with the decorations and stuff. Hey, I bet you can't guess what I got you for your birthday. I have no idea. A date? Uh, just give me... The, you know, I had no idea. Ha! I knew I surprised you. Who's your favorite barbarian? That's right, Grognak. Issue 14, and with no missing pages. Grognak. I found this in a box of my father's old things. Believe it or not, imagine him reading comic books. I guess everybody was ten once. Well, I better let you get back to mingling with your guests. Mm -hmm. We'll talk later, okay? Right. Happy birthday. Find yourself. Okay. Behold. Oh, man, you got a pit boy. I wish I was ten. I wish I was ten. <laughs> <laughs> Oh no. Ahem. Enjoying yourself? Happy birthday, Sonny. Indeed. We have, it's a very happy birthday. Uh, we are going to need to fix some things, though. Give me a second. Audio. Radio needs to be turned off. Ra radio needs to be off because of uh, unfortunate reasons. Yes. In the meantime. I hope you appreciate the effort Amata put into this party. Mm -hmm. She really seems to like you for some reason. Mm hmm. Of course she likes me. I'm a charming guy. She did a great job, but couldn't you have helped? Eh, she, I'm a really charming guy. Ah, ah. Don't presume too much on her friendship, young man. I'm still the overseer, and I'm still in charge of this vault and everyone in it. Right. Next. Enjoying yourself? Uh, yes. Nice party. Yes. Uh, the booth cannot be sat in. Happy birthday! Happy birthday! Hey, uh, thanks for inviting me. Really cool party and everything. I know that, uh, Butch and I give you a hard time, but you don't take that seriously, right? Yeah. Anyway, uh, happy birthday and everything. I better get back to, you know. You know, just sitting there. What, are you two best friends now? Hey, Wally, I think Paul's gone soft on us. Uh -oh. Yeah, Paul. Why don't you introduce us to your new best friend? Who do you mean, Dorkface nice here? Happy birthday, Dorkface. <laughs> wow, Dorkface. That's right. This party's pretty good, I guess, for a little kid. Balloons, party hats. Not as cool as my party, though. Remember how my dad got Andy to do magic tricks? And we all played Hunt the Mutant in the atrium? Oh, right. You weren't invited to my party. Too bad, man. It was really fun. Attention, everyone. It's time to cut the cake. Andy, wait. How's it going, pal? Damn. That sucks. Let us immediately equip the hat. Oh, no. I am mortified about the cake in his hat. Simply mortified. <laughs> the terrifying look there. Go on, mingle. Mingle! You first. Having a good time? It wasn't easy keeping Come this on, a secret. I told now go on. I'm sure so everyone official. else would like a chance yeah. to talk to you. I know you were joking, but I'm not sure. The man else is super cool, no, right? Nice. People Jeez, always Wally. enjoy Just my day. You or me? The no way. That friend of yours could use so, a reminder that life is not all fun and games. What do you think we should call our game? How you doing? How do you like that Pip Boy, son? Fit all right and everything? Yeah. It's really cool. Did you fix it up for me? As a matter of fact, I did. I'm glad you like it. 
Some may think the A-Series a bit basic, but I've always preferred them for their reliability. Uh, thanks, Stanley. Um... Don't mention it. Oh, yes, I almost forgot. Happy birthday! Not much, but I hope you like it. Hey, how about the Volt Dwellers? You gotta say Butch, yes. Or not, who knows? You should go around all day being called You should try it sometime, Daddy. Sometimes I think you really are as dumb as you look. Happy okay. birthday. That dude should have a broken <laughs> neck. <laughs> yeah, yes, he should. He absolutely should. Now go okay, on. let's see. Ahem. Um. They, they did something you disagreed with in TTW? You mean, like, if you sacrifice yourself, it doesn't do broken steel or something? And eh, I'm fine with that. I don't mind. I mean, after all, we we have a we have a super mutant we can uh, shove into the uh, into the exit instead. Remember, remember, he's like, I will not spit. Like, I will not. Sorry, everyone's destiny has a destiny. Yours accumulates here. I will not deny you that. <laughs> remember that shit? Like the the pre patch uh, uh, ending. Oh, that was great. Before that, yeah, before they patched the ending of this game. Um, the, the super mutant who was immune to radiation would, uh, would refuse to go and, um, <clears throat> and actually, get, you know, save the day. Like, instead he was insisting that you sacrifice yourself because of destiny. That's, that's it. Yes. <laughs> yeah, I will not do it. Go die. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. <laughs> it was pretty fucking funny. It is your destiny to die here. Yes, and, and th if you don't, if you convince someone else to sacrifice themselves, like he shirked at the last moment and was a coward, was a, a piece of shit coward. I'm like, I don't, I don't care. It's fine. It's fine. We we, we can sacrifice someone else and they'll wake up later. Yep. <clears throat> yep. And enjoy yourself. They patched it and shamed nice you for time? doing it, yes. Thanks for coming, Stanley. Another I know you were <laughs> yeah, 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 Fox literally says you should, uh, you should do the thing. Yeah, yeah, holy crap. Give me a sec, I have to alt-tab and do something in a different window. There's always things happening in different windows. Oh my god. Why, why, why? Alright, I think we're good. <clears throat> yeah, so this should, this should work. Thank you for waiting. We're done. We're, we're going. We're going. To becoming a productive. Are you having a nice party? Ten years old. My, my, my. Seems like only yesterday that your daddy came. Goodness, listen to me ramble. You're waiting for your present, aren't you? <laughs> uh huh. Okay. Um. Hmm. Yep. I, I don't know. I don't know. Um, yes, ma'am. Oh, you didn't have to get me a present. Fiddlesticks. What ten-year-old doesn't like presents? I was ten once, believe it or not. My goodness, the vault was practically crowded back then. Not like today. So few young people now. But here I am rambling on again, and you listening so politely. Here you go. A nice sweet roll that I baked for you just this morning. Mm -hmm. And it's all for you. All nope. for me. Everything's Old fine, I hope. Okay, I need I need that I need to eat that sweet roll right now. Num. It was delicious. Oh, sure, nothing to worry about. Me and Anne. I'm hungry, and that stupid robot destroyed the cake. Give me that sweet roll you got from old lady Palmer. Uh, let's see. Ahem. <clears throat> it was sure good when I ate it a few minutes ago. Miss Palmer said I didn't have to share. You look hungry. What, mom drank up all your ration coupons again? Don't you talk about my mom, you little punk. <laughs> and I got her all fixed up again last night. Good as new. I wasn't worried. Oh. You can fix anything, right? <laughs> <laughs> Butch, Happy birthday. what do you think you're doing? Leave him alone. How are you enjoying the party, Mrs. Palmer? You all right, son? I help with the decorations. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, really? They're lovely. You did such a splendid job. Jonas? What's Butch's problem, anyway? I can't believe he tried to start a fight at your own birthday party. What a jerk. Mm. 
Right, right. <clears throat> so, uh, he's lucky. Uh, that, that jerk tried to st steal my sweet roll. Eh, it was kind of at fault. You know how easy it is to make book Butch mad. You never learn, do you? You can't help shooting your mouth off even when you know it's gonna get you a bloody nose. Uh-oh. Your dad is giving me a look. I better let everybody else have a turn with the birthday boy. Uh-oh. Hey, Doc. Run! We're all set down here. Run! <laughs> Thanks. We're gonna hide, we're hide right in the down. corner. We're Hello, hide in the corner. Officer Gomez. I'm glad oh. you could make it. Okay. I'm glad to be here. Let's I think go. It's important to keep in touch with the young people. You know, hey, Paul, it's part of my job. Plus... Hey, that was Jonas on the intercom. He and I have been cooking up a little surprise present. Cooking? Okay. Jonas is waiting for you downstairs on the reactor level. I see. Go ahead. I don't think anyone will mind if you slip out for a few minutes. That's that's okay. Well, well, let's go. Like that's your hobby? <laughs> We're going to slip out. Give me an idea. Enjoy yourself. Well, okay. We're nice running. You. Who are you? Uh-oh. Happy birthday, dearie. My goodness. I hope I didn't miss the party. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see here. Yeah, they. they, they so I, I'm not a girl. I'm not five. Stop calling me dearie. Uh, can I have my present now? No, 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 no. Um, <clears throat> yeah, they threw me a great party, didn't they? They sure did. My, my. Ten years old already? Mm -hmm. Why, I can remember helping your dad change your diapers. And now look at you. A great big grown-up ten-year-old with your very own Pip-Boy. Since this was such a special occasion, do you know what I did? I wrote you a poem just for you. I hope you like it. I... <clears throat> no, she's a sycophant. She, uh... Like, if you read the actual, like, logs about her, she's, uh... She's one of them there, uh, predators, yes. Um... Anyway... <clears throat> Thank you. I will treasure it always. Is that all? Of course. Run along now, dearie, and have yourself a wonderful birthday. Yes. Coming. A birthday poem. Yes. So, there we go. Uh, gray walls of impenetrable steel. Suffocation. Condemnation. Little hands groping. Subterranean certainty. Mommy, Daddy, am I dead? Nay, nay, reborn. Uh, yes. Uh, d d d d uh, yeah, it's eternal slumber. <clears throat> Paul, you yep. really are as dumb as you look, aren't you? Yeah, she's like she's crazy. Yeah. I hope ourselves. you're having a nice time. G Here's give it one. to the children. Oh my Wally, goodness! I wouldn't have missed it for the world. That dear boy is like a nice son try, to me. Okay. I'm going this way. It's it's it's, it's the reactor. Wait, was it, where's he going? I thought we were going to the reactor level. Why is he going up here? I I don't understand. What, what why why are you going up? Oh, he's the overseer. Enjoy the party, sir. Another you. Bah! I only showed up because Amata's friends with the brat. Give them a few more minutes, and then I want that place cleaned up and everybody back to work. Holy sure thing, shit. Sir. You hear that? Oh. <laughs> that, that's, that's nice. That's, yeah, yeah, that's, that's lovely. <laughs> Did you have a nice party, sir? Like, oh boy. Not great. Oh no, Jonas is after me. Hem. What are you doing down here, young man? I thought kids weren't allowed down on the reactor level. Mm -hmm. I'm not a kid. I'm ten years old. <laughs> you sure are. Pip boy and everything. Look at that. If you can wait just one more minute, I think your dad will want to give you the surprise himself. Uh -huh. No, we're not going to play an optimal build. We're going to screw up. We're, we're gonna we're gonna not play very well. Let's put it like that. We we are intentionally. Are you ready for your surprise? We're intentionally screwing a, a lot of this up. Yes. <clears throat> anyway, uh, what kind of surprise? The overseer gave you your pit boy, and you're old enough to do some work. So, I figure you're old enough for this. Your own BB gun. It's a little old, but it should work perfectly. Jonas found it down here. Mm -hmm. It was in pretty rough shape. Took us a good three months to find the parts to get it working again. You know how tough it is to find a spring that small? 
Good thing Butch misplaced that switchblade of his. <laughs> so, what do you think? Wait, Butch had a switchblade? He tried to punch me. If he had a switchblade, he would... Oh, no. It, it, good thing we got rid of Butch, Butch's switchblade, because, yikes, he, he was going to stab us. Wow. Terrifying. Okay, we can't shoot a gun in here. We sure can't, unless we want the overseer beating down our door. Jonas and I have found a place, though. Come on. All right, Robert and his BB gun. Ready to go. <clears throat> now we can do this. Excellent. This is how normal people walk. Oh, jeez, that gives me a headache. Happy birthday, buddy. I hope you have fun with it. Thanks a lot. It's really cool. Hey, you don't turn 10 every day. Now go on and let me see you shoot something. Yeah. Well, what do you think? You can come down here and shoot anytime you want. It's great. Thanks. Couldn't have done it without Jonas's help. You make sure to thank him. Mm -hmm. Go on, shoot something for me. All right. Ahem. Uh, one, two, three. Careful, it's a rad roach. Think you can take care of that with your BB gun? Yes. Just aim and shoot. You'll be fine. All right. Here we go. The vault assisted. Yes. BB time. Good work. That's one less round roads to deal with. Damn Let's right. get a picture together. Capture the moment. Hey, Jonas, get a picture of me with a big game hunter. Let's do it. Smile. Still proceeding. Six years later. Let's do it. I'm Alpha and Omega. We're getting there. As far as I can tell, you're a perfectly healthy 16-year-old boy. So mm -hmm. yes, you have to go to class to take your GOAT exam. Go on now. You've got a GOAT to take. Oh, yes. We, we, we have to take that GOAT. Oh, no. Oh, no. Um, anything I need to know about the GOAT? The Generalized Occupational Aptitude Test. Goat. Everyone here in the vault takes it when they're 16. Helps to figure out what sort of a job you'll have here in Vault 101 when you get a bit older. So, pay attention and try not to fall asleep. You know what the overseer says? We are born in the vault, we die in the vault. Each is tested to determine their abilities that they may work for the betterment of all vault residents. Right. Huh. Sound familiar? It does sound familiar. If you say so, Dad. Uh, let's see. Uh, do we have to die in the vault? Um, can we ever leave? That's not the way it works. And it won't do to go around asking questions like that. Ooh. Especially not around the overseer. I want to tell you something now. It's important. Okay. So listen closely. Mm -hmm. This place, this vault, it's not perfect, I know. But it is your home. Mm -hmm. You're safe here. Stay on the Overseer's good side, and you always will be. You understand? You need to appreciate all you have. Because what's up there, on the outside, that's not the life I want for you. And it's not what your mother wanted for you either. I see, I see. Is it true that everyone was born in the vault? That's what the Overseer says, isn't it? Mm -hmm. He's not about to let anyone else in, so I guess that's how it'll have to be. You're here now. And it's a hell of a lot better than being up there. Mm -hmm. All your mother and I ever wanted was for you to be safe. And you're safe here. Yeah, it makes perfect sense. Uh, can we talk about Mom? Your mother, she... She was beautiful. But beyond the beauty you've seen. Oh, no. There's just so much those old photos can never show. I and mean... she was passionate. Yeah. About life. About love. But passionate. most of all... Most of all, she was passionate about you. When she became pregnant, it was the happiest I had ever seen her. Mm -hmm. uh, she had great things in mind for you. Yeah. And so, 
Time for you to stop stalling and get to class. Please, son, please, take these achievement tests seriously. The last thing I need is your mother's ghost haunting me because her only child became a, a garbage burner. A garbage burner? That sounds like a job for me. Oh no, future imperfect. Wait, what? Future imperfect? What is that supposed to mean? I don't understand. Huh. Okay. My goodness. Take care, son. Yes, the, the goat. We need to pass... Everyone here needs to pass the goat. What's this? A medicine bobblehead. You are now 10% less likely to get addicted to chems. That is one out of the 20 collectible bobbleheads. Absolutely. That is great. Good morning. Stopped in to see the old man before class, eh? True. Hey, 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 sport. It's been a while since you stopped in here to see us. It's the big goat day today, right? It's the big goat day. We're going to take the goat. Morning, Jonas. Morning, Doc. Uh -huh. How's things? Get Have out of my way, you stupid tunnel results? snakes. I was just going tunnel to snakes to rule. What is it now, sir? I'm trying to go this way. Why don't you just leave no me alone? I'll have my report ready. Just show it to her, Butch. Amata. Go run and Get tell your away daddy from on me. Mm -hmm. You think you're special because your daddy is the overseer? Tell her, Butch. Stay away from me. Did you know that um, uh, the overseer is considering getting rid of them permanently? It's true. It's true. All right. Ahem. <clears throat> Yes. Don't mess with the tunnel snakes. Mm-hmm. Uh, should I have a problem with the tunnel snakes? What? You mouthing off, Spaz? Everyone knows the tunnel snakes. We rule this vault, and we don't take shit from nobody. Not you, not her, and not her daddy, the overseer. I see. Uh, bye, Wally. Get out of here, kid. I can show you a real tunnel snake, Amada. Daddy. Tunnel snakes rule. I see. What's this about the tunnel snakes? That's us. And we rule. No one messes with the tunnel snakes. Or they have to answer to Butch and Wally. You don't want to be on their bad sides. Trust me. Butch and Wally. I see. I, I get that. Why are you picking on Amada? None of your business. Because Butch said so. And what Butch says goes... Tunnel snakes rule. Uh huh huh. Hold on a second. Uh, you're in the tunnel snakes. You guys really rule. No. Uh, why do you listen to Butch? Because he's my pal, my brother. All us tunnel snakes are brothers. Birth to earth, womb to tomb. Mostly because tunnel snakes rule. Yeah, that's really bad. No, it's it's hilarious because if you think about it, um. Uh, you know, this is actually a really bad, um, uh, bad situation. But let me, let me tell you something else. Hey, there, there, there's a, there's a little secret to this, okay? Ahem. There, there, there's, there's something that, that they didn't tell you about. And it's right here. In this spot. Right there, yeah. So, ahem. This is what, this is what it says in the background. What do you, what do you think about that? Like, you see what I'm saying? Like, this is all very, very uncomfortable here. Yes. Yes, indeed. Um, as you can see, I mean, it's, it's true. There, there you go. Like, yeah, this is great game. Great, great, great game here. The, the vault is toxic. This girl, Sorry. daddy's girl. Later, Paul. What seems to she be thinks she's today? better than us. I've got okay. this headache that just What's won't go away. Daddy's Even with the pills you gave me last week, it's the lights. I think. The pills. They hurt my eyes. The lights. So they hurt my eyes. The pills. Well, the pills. The lights. The pills. You like? Yes, I think I'd like that. <laughs> show it to her, Butch. Oh, Sh show it long. to her. I can show I just, you a real thing. Tunnel snakes rule. But uh, yeah, I was gonna say you're picking on Amada because Butch told you to. Right, but um, don't you have something better to do? Can't think of anything. Butch says this little bitch is blabbing to her daddy about us tunnel snakes. We can't have that. Because we're the tunnel snakes, and we rule. I see. Tunnel well, snake. 
Don't mess with the. T Hold on a second. Yeah, problem with her? Stay out of this. It Me and Butch were just having some fun with this chick. I see. I see. So Butch is a leader, and you're just a follower. I don't follow anyone. Wally Mac is his own man, and the Tunnel Snakes is where I belong. W why? You think Butch is in charge? Is that what people are saying? Because it's a load of shit if that's what they're saying. Mm hmm. So, uh, I heard you do anything he tells you, and I mean anything. Nice try, but what? Just, okay. Fun. Don't mess with the tunnel. Can I do that again? Can I do a second speech check? So, uh, problem with Amada. If you say so. Yeah, she thinks fine. she's better. Oh. Look, I'm not looking to rumble with you. How about we just stay out of each other's business, like usual? <laughs> that, that's fun. Uh, looks like you're having fun. Um, <clears throat> what's going on here? None of your business, kid. Get out of here before you get hurt. If you mess with the tunnel snakes, you're asking for it. Got me? Yeah, yep. Yeah. If you keep messing with her, the overseer is going to come down on your gang. Maybe you're right. We can deal with her later. With you, as come on, as tunnel can. snakes. This little bitch isn't worth our time. Holy Whatever shit. Whatever you say, Butch. You're the boss. Holy hey, shit. Tunnel snakes What's rule. new? Fine. Let's oh, go. Not much. Thanks for getting rid of them. <sighs> Assholes. I don't know why they won't leave me alone. Just because my father is the overseer, I guess? Idiots. Our heater's on the fritz again. You're kidding me. Um, Didn't you just get new parts for it last week? Have you taken week? your medication today, everyone? Yeah, sure did. But the yes. thing is so old, my grandpa had trouble with it when he was uh, my age. Right. Well, I hope it's working again soon for you. Very Thanks. good. Say, you want to grab some lunch later on? Oh, boy. Sure thing. How about we head down to the Ooh. diner after class? Great. Nice. All right. Ahem. <clears throat> Good luck yes, on the yes. You too. What are we doing here? I don't know. The time has come. Let's. Well, you made it. Oh. All set for the goat? Yes. Trust me, it really isn't that bad. Just something everybody has to go through. Mm hmm. Yeah, yep, yep. Let's see here. Uh, all right. Uh, I'll ace it. I'm sure you will. Especially since it's multiple choice with no wrong answers. There we go. We'll start as soon as everyone's found a seat. Good luck. Uh, I don't know. Let's go, people. The overseer's patience is limited. Yes. We'll talk to your little friend later. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for getting rid of them. I don't know why they won't leave me alone. Just because my father's the overseer, I guess? Idiots. Thanks for getting rid of them. Same, same line. Okay. Next. You nervous? I'm not. You're not? Back what? off. What do you want, nerd? Look, Square, I already told you. We got nothing to say to each other. We're not friends. We're never going to be friends. Got it? I hope you weren't just talking to me. I hope you weren't just talking to me. Oh, hi. Why are you talking to me? Oh, hi. Hi. Why are you talking to me? Yeah, there's there's no dialogue whatsoever there. Yeah, uh, punch him. I they won't let me. It won't I've let got me punch. Other to do. It's a chemistry set. There's a clipboard. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> uh, Butch. Yeah, we'll sit down. We're fine. I said we'll sit down. Oh yeah, I have to hold the E button to sit. I have that. I have that Take set up so I don't accidentally sit. Well. Yes. Managed to find the classroom. We can yes. finally get started. The goat. No talking. And keep your eyes to yourselves. <laughs> yes, I'm talking to you, Mr. Deloria. Sure thing, Mr. Brach. Unless anyone else has an insightful comment, let's get started. Okay. Question one. A frenzied vault scientist runs up to you and yells, "I'm going to put my quantum harmonizer in your photonic resonation chamber." Ooh la la. What's your response? Well, uh, let's see. But, okay, up, up yours too, buddy. Or, uh, <clears throat> let's see. Grab a pipe and knock him out. Uh, slip out before the scientist can continue his rant. Uh, doctor, wouldn't that cause parabolic destabilization of the fission, singu fission singularity? Question two. While working as an intern in the clinic, a patient with a strange infection in his foot stumbles through the door. The infection is spreading at an alarming rate. 
but the doctor stepped out for a while. What do you do? Mm-hmm. Uh, let's see here. Amputate the foot, scream for help, medicate the infected area to the best of my abilities. Or restrain the patient and observe as the infection spreads. Nah, medicate. Question three. You discover a young boy lost in the lower levels of the vault. He's hungry and frightened, but also appears to be in possession of stolen property. What do you do? Let's see. Give the boy a hug, tell him everything will be okay, confiscate the stolen property, and leave the boy there as a punishment. Pick the boy's pocket for the stolen property for yourself and leave him to his fate. Uh, lead the boy to safety and turn him into the overseer. Uh, overseer. Question four. Congratulations. You've made one of the Vault 101 baseball teams. Which position do you prefer? That would be awesome if there was a... Um, yeah, no, no, that'd be, that'd be really cool if there was, like, a big uh, atrium someplace where we could, you know, play baseball. But, uh, you know, at, at the end of the day... Um, you know, I, 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 I like being either a designated hitter or a catcher, depending on the situation. However, um, I'm going to go for the purposes of this playthrough. I'm going to be a designated hitter. Question five. Your grandmother invites you to tea, but you're surprised when she gives you a pistol and orders you to kill another vault resident. What do you do? Yes. What's innuendo? All right. Let me see here. Uh, <clears throat> obey your elder and kill the uh, person. Uh, let's see. Uh, offer your most prized possession for the resident's life. Gr offer. Uh, g g ask Granny for some cyanide. Uh, throw your tea in the in Granny's face. Yep. Question six. Old Mr. Abernathy has locked himself in his quarters again, and you've been ordered to get him out. How do you proceed? Let's see. Use a bobby pin to pick the lock. Trade uh, hoodlum for a che uh, cherry bomb. Uh, go to the armory, retrieve a laser pistol, walk away, and let the old coot rot. Let's let's go with the uh, the lock pick. Question seven. Oh no, you've been exposed to radiation, mm -hmm. and a mutated hand has grown out of your stomach. What's the best course of treatment? I see. I see. Well then. Uh, let's see here. Uh, bullet to the brain. Ah, ah, large dose of mutagen, prayer. Maybe God will spare you in exchange for a life of post, uh, a pious devotion. Oh, boy. Uh, removal of the mutated, uh, tissue with a precision laser. <laughs> but, yeah. Prayer, obviously. Question eight. A fellow Vault 101 resident is in possession of a Grognak the Barbarian comic book. Issue number one. You want it. What's the best way to obtain it? Uh, trade it, obviously. Steal it at gunpoint. Sneak into the residence. Uh, uh, knock out drops. No, let's go with the uh, trade it. Question nine. You decide it would be fun to play a prank on your father. You enter his private restroom when no one is looking and... Uh-huh. Loosen the bolts on the pipes... Put a firecracker in the toilet, break into the medicine cabinet, replace his blood pressure medication with sugar pills. That's, oh my God, that one is, uh, that one is especially bad. Holy shit. Manipulate the wattage on his razor. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, loosen the bolts on the pipes. Question 10. Who is indisputably the most important person in Vault 101? He who shelters us from the harshness of the atomic wasteland, and to whom we owe everything we have, including our lives. Uh, I'd say the fourth one. Yeah. Pencils down, people. That's it. The infamous goat. I'm sure most of you didn't find it so bad. Others, well, there are always openings in the maintenance department. Don't forget to hand in your test before you leave. You don't want to know what happens to people who fail the goat. I see. You can have the rest of the day off to celebrate or I'm to thinking pray of going as with the situation was. The last one. Mm -hmm. What did you put? Uh, yeah, I was gonna say. Uh, but but uh, our, our leader is Captain Claw, of the of the pirate crew. Yeah, it's true. There you are, Mr. Brach. I hope I did okay. 
Nothing for you to worry about, Miss Almodovar. Let's see. Very well done. Looks like it's the supervisory track for you. Cool. Thanks. See you tomorrow. Supervisory track? Yo, teach. I'm done. Ah, Butch. Can I admit that I've been waiting for this day for a long, long time? Allow me to savor the moment. Now then, let's see. Hmm. Really? Interesting. You surprised me, Butch. I didn't think you had it in you. Hairdresser! Who would have thunk it? You're so full of it. That isn't true. I've got other things to do. Hairdresser. Okay. I'm all done, Mr. Brotch. I guess. Uh, wait a second. Can I have it back? I think I need to change one of my answers. Hairdresser. Just calm down a minute, Paul. I'm sure you have nothing to worry about. Let's see. Hmm. Hmm. Yep, just as I thought. You're slated for the engineering track. Congratulations, Mr. Hannon. You've passed the GOAT. Oh, gee. That's not so bad. Engineering, all right. All right. By the way, um, yeah, definitely. We're, we're all going to get fancy hair, um, thanks to uh, Butch being uh, in, in the... Uh, the hairdresser. Yeah, it's, it's going to be great. It's going to be great. Mother can't wait to find out if I'll be going into science or home economics. Science. Uh, well, perhaps. Let's see what the goat says. Oh. Well, well, maintenance department. I hope your mother will be pleased. I'm sure Stanley will be. What? That's impossible. I'm telling father. He won't let you get away with this. Here. What's the stupid test say I'm going to be doing for the rest of my life? Now, now, Susie. Is that any way to talk about the infallible goat? You will be... <clears throat> you'll be going into teaching. No doubt due to your gift for communication. Don't worry. It isn't as bad as it sounds. About what I figured... I guess I'll see you around, Edwin. Edwin. Wow, that that energy. It th this this okay. this this is Fallout Three in a nutshell, right there. Yep. Let's go. I'm finished here. Don't you want to find out what you got? Now nah, I already know what it says. Hardly takes a rocket scientist to crack that joke of a test. Wow. Okay, and you? Hey, what did you put for number 10? Uh, no. Alrighty then. They say the goat never lies. According to this, you're slated to be the next vault chaplain. God help us all. us <laughs> all oh, that's great uh let's see oh wow that's always what i that's what i always wanted to be my dreams are coming true yes um it's refreshing to see such uh youthful enthusiasm good to know that the goat occasionally gets it right you know what they say about monkeys and typewriters yes well i'm glad things turned out so well for you i hope your classmates find their results half as satisfying Okay, so we we, uh, uh, we we absolutely are gonna not do that. <laughs> Barter's good, speech is good, and um, guns are good. But what about your intelligence? Ah ah ah! Uh, yeah, we kind of want energy pistols, I believe. It was something like uh, uh, energy weapons, boy. Guns, energy weapons. I guess, yeah, I'm not sure. Because speech and barter are what we're going with. Um, <clears throat> but but not melee. We we gotta we gotta choose between um, 
Like guns are fun, and uh, yeah, let's go with guns. We, we're we're gonna we're gonna get a skill loadout that is actively against our stat spread. It's gonna be great. It's gonna be great. We're done. So that's it. We picked our tag skills. We are done. Snake life see you forever. Tomorrow, bright and early. Anything is possible, even an Three years later. Hey, but because Butch became the hairdresser, wake up! Come on, wake up! Everything has changed. Everything has changed. Come on, you've got to wake up. Yes. Oh my goodness. Uh, weird. I was just dreaming about you. Don't be a smart mouth. This is serious. My father's men are looking for you. They've already killed Jonas. Mm -hmm. You've got to get out of here. Wait, Jonas is dead? What the hell's going on? It's your dad. He's left the vault. My father thinks Jonas helped him escape. So he had his men. My God, they killed him. They just beat him and beat him and wouldn't stop. That's sad. Uh, my God, are you okay? Yeah, don't worry about me. I'm just sorry you had to find out like this. Yeah. I know Jonas was your friend. But we've got to go now. My father's men will be here any minute. I see. Uh, let's see here. Um, how'd you get here first? I need to escape the vault. Can you help me? That's exactly what I had in mind. Okay. Listen, there's a secret tunnel that leads directly from my father's office to the exit. You'll have to hack the computer in his office to open it. Mm -hmm. Use these to get into his office. That's how I always get in. Got it. Bobby pins. Sounds good to me. Let's get out of here. Oh, one more thing. I stole my father's pistol. I hope you won't need it, but you'd better take it just in case. Okay, th thanks, Amada. I only use his last resort. Yep, yep. Okay, I'll try to meet you at the exit. Mm -hmm. Watch out for security. Good luck. But I told you, I told you, Butch you at the vault is can, but don't wait the vault me. hairdresser. Yes, <laughs> this is correct. Absolutely correct. Okay. Let's grab a bit of everything. Yeah, yes. I told you. I told you. It's the truth. Dragon the Barbarian. Get our jumpsuits. Sure. Yeah, yes, indeed. I, 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 I told you. It's absolutely true. It's absolutely true. <laughs> All right. Now you got to save his mom. Uh, yeah, I've got to get myself uh, ready to go. Get my, uh, I was about to use a baseball, base, baseball bat, I believe. It did. Okay, hold on a second. First, first things first. Uh, we need, we need to set things up. Uh, yes. Ahem. So first of all, settings. Tweaks. All right. So, uh, do, 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 do. hold on. Adjustable zoom. Just looking down the, yeah, auto continue game. Don't care about that. Let me uh, scroll down really quick. Make sure I miss, didn't miss anything. No exit hacking. Yep. D don't allow exiting. If an attempt has been made, no exit game confirmation. Don't care about any of that. Um, Cannot fast travel if your legs are crippled. No, that, that's that's not, none of those things I care about. It, it was the other one. It was the other one. So we got to go to mod configuration. We got to use uh, just mods. Yes. <clears throat> Give me my weapon wheel. So weapon wheel, we're going to tie that to Q. And that's fine. <clears throat> what else? Uh, do, 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 do. Yeah, everything else can stay the way it is. I don't have to worry about that. Yeah, crosshair. Hit marker, indicator objective, sprint, hold breath, bullet time. That's that's all good. Um, let me see. So I just need to go into... Yeah, there we go. Now we got a weapon wheel. So uh, we just access this and we, we assign the, um, the weapons. Did we get the baseball bat? Yeah, we got the baseball bat. Good. So we, we assign the baseball bat to... Whoops. Uh, that's, that's me being stupid. Uh, yeah, there we go. And then, uh, the, 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 the pistol to there. So now I can do one or two. Cool. So yeah, we're, we're, we're set. We got, we got our baseball bat. We got our pistol. We're, we're good to go. Okay. Uh, yeah. There he is. Hold it right there. Hold it right there. Crimity, more roaches. More roaches. Filthy little monsters. 
Sorry, but I have to I have to go over me. here. Yeah. Okay. You got to help me. My oh, mom's no. trapped in there with the rat roaches. Yes. Yes, yes. I, I I was I was in training to be the vault chaplain. It's true. This is insane. All right. Uh, come on. We can help her. No. I can't go back in there. It's it's dark and there's rat roaches. I see. I see. Don't worry, Butch. I'll get her out of there. Oh my god. Thank you. I didn't know what to do. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh my god. Someone help me. She's going to die. Help. Ah! Yep. Get them away from me. Get yep. them away from me. I got them all. I got them all. All the red roaches are dead. All the red roaches are dead. Okay, I need I need uh We did it. My mom's going to be Oof. okay. You're the best friend okay. I ever had, man. Hey, I know it isn't much, but I want you to have my tunnel snakes jacket. Right. Go ahead, take it. Okay. Well, let's put on our tunnel snakes jacket. We, we we are now truly, truly special. Uh, is there anything else uh, I wanted to do? Well, we could, is that a whiskey? Is that whiskey? That's that's vodka. Let's take the vodka on our way out. That that lady just has more. You can't, get out of here, Roach. I'm trying to get trying to get vodka. You you are being a pain. I'm gonna need that vodka. It's gonna increase my strength, my my strength. Okay, I think we're good. I think we're set. Yeah, she, she has the vodka. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Uh, let's go uh, save two. We're gonna be making a lot of saves. Don't worry about it though. We gotta go. We gotta go. Yeah, the, these guys are being a pain. Turn up or later. You know I turn up. Yes, filthy little monsters. We're going to the atrium. Go, 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 go. Where do they keep coming from? Uh, yes. Goodbye. 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 We got to get out of here. We should just go back to our quarters. It's our only chance. Don't you see? We're getting out of here, just like the doctor. Yeah. I'm not going to let anyone stop us. Those guys will shoot you if you... Uh, Tom, be careful! Uh, what do we got? Paint. Uh, paint gun, wonder glue, scrap metal... Most of this stuff is irrelevant, but we're gonna pick it up anyway. Fuck it. Yeah, we're, we're picking it up. Those guys have guns. Do not piss them off. Yep, we're going. <clears throat> oh, shit. That hurt. We got the roach. Okay, we're set. Oh, oh boy. Another roach. I could yep. be dead right now. We're good. Okay, you gotta be extra careful. We're gonna get shot if we don't, uh, if we're not careful. You! This is your fault. You and your stupid father. He had to go and leave, didn't he? He yep. had to mess things up for everybody. Damn. Okay, let's go. We got him. Yep. <laughs> yeah, this is very silly. Taking the electronics. Oh, jeez. Everyone's dead. Everyone's dead. This is terrible. Hey, whoa! I'm looking at the uh, the damage reduction on the, the Tunnel Snake outfit, and it's, it's objectively better than any jumpsuit. It, 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 he, he had armor on him. Butch, I mean. Yeah, Butch had, uh, had armor. Damn. That's crazy. That roach is going that way. We're gonna ignore it. Yes. Stop in the name of the law. Stop in the name of the law. Yeah. It's a damn shame. I have to kill this man. I didn't want to kill this man, but I had no choice. You shouldn't have tried to run. Yeah, I know I shouldn't have tried to run, but here we are. Goodbye, sir. You are dead now. Damn! Hannon had to die. Yep. Uh, yeah, that's it. We we had to. I, I I didn't want it to end this way, but it, it had to. Bobby pins, some jumpsuits. We're gonna sell the we're gonna sell the jumpsuits when we get out of here. But uh, more importantly, uh oh, overseer's office key. Hell yeah. Uh, what else? What else? I think we're good. I think we're, we're, we're set. 
Yeah, these coffee mugs all have one value, so we're going to sell them for caps. Oh, boy. Yep, that's the office key. Let's do it. Uh, I'm painting some Mothership Zeta. It's really stupid and hilarious. You just have to not take anything in this game seriously, and it's a great game. Because it's... It's a, it is a terrible, uh, a terrible storyline. Let's put it like that. Uh, let's see. We got bullets, password, stim pack. Yep. Yes. Let's go. Terminal time. We got the overseer's password. Uh, view the dossier. The tunnel snakes. If Butch and his leather clad delinquents accost, uh, Armada one more time. They'll have more to deal with than their uh, teacher. Uh, their services have come in handy on occasion. I admit they're starting to become unruly. If dogs become feral, they must be put down. All right, Beatrice. Uh, just what uh, Vault um, 101 needs. Uh, uh, an absent-minded, sexually repressed sycophant. Beatrice has served Vault 101 admirably, but her mind is growing feeble. I'll have to speak to our doctor about some long-term pharmaceutical solution. I'm able to keep her comfortable and uh, quiet until she passes on. Jonas. I should have never assigned Jonas as James' assistant. He was always too idealistic for his own good. Now he spends every waking minute with the good doctor, who gleefully fills his ears with even more idealistic nonsense. I have considered reassigning him, but the truth is jo Jonas is a fine medic in his own right. And hiding him down in maintenance would be a terrible waste of resources. Amada. Uh, every time I try to get Amada to open up, she just pushes me further away. Uh, ever since she was a child, I've tried to instill in her the sense of the virtues that make this vault what it is today. Loyalty, honesty, commitment, hard work. She does try. With a lot of guidance, um, she has grown to a fine young woman. That makes it all the sadder that she continues to alienate me. Uh, my goodness. Um, she looks at me and sees the overseer, not the father she's cared for her alone since she was an infant. Uh, do, 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 scouting reports. All right, uh, let's see. The immediate vicinity of the vault no longer dangerously irradiated, although background radiation still above uh, safe levels. We'll need to carry ample supplies of Radex for future surveys. Um, old maps are generally useless. We encountered a group of uh, monstrous ants, which appears to, uh, uh, let's, uh do, 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 do. good news. Human civilization still thrives despite everything. We've discovered a settlement known as Megaton. See Exhibit B. Uh, they welcomed us into their town. We spent a good deal of time in Megaton and learned about the capital wasteland, the area of Washington, D.C. Uh, Megaton is a fortified outpost of civilization, in quotes. Uh, we return to the vault immediately to revise, um, uh, our plans. So we plan to send people, yeah, people as ambassadors. Got it. Any Palmer research team. Okay. Exhibit A, that big ant. Exhibit B, Megaton. Got it. Uh, vault tech instructions. Here we go. Letter from, uh, Dr. Braun, everybody. Dr. Braun. All right. If you're reading this, this is emergency vault uh, internment procedures have been initiated and you and your control group have been sealed in the vault. Congratulations, you are now a vital part of the most ambitious program ever taken undertaken by Vault Tech. Um, let's see, if you've not written the sealed orders, do them now. They will outline the experimental procedures assigned to your control group. Remember that the deviation from these protocols in any way will jeopardize the success of the program. Uh, your vault may or may not have been selected to receive a GEC module. Please see A for details. Um, vault 101 will not receive a GEC and should operate under the guidelines set forth in the overseer's sealed orders. The GEC is quite simply the most advanced piece of technology ever developed by Vault Tech. By the way, by the way, the, the GEC in old Fallout was like a like some soil and seeds. It was basically just just dirt and um, and farming equipment. That's what a geck was in in original Fallout. Bethesda said a terraforming module capable of uh, creating life from complete lifelessness. Thanks, Bethesda. 
after riding out the storm, Nuclear Armageddon, a Vault Tech patented vault, the residents will activate the Gek and create a new paradise. Craters of dust will give way to rolling grasslands and sparkling clear water. Very good. Yes. All right. Overseer's tunnel open. Let's get out of here. Let's go. Thanks, Butch, for the jacket and uh, what's called hairstyle. Butch uh, styled our hair, by the way. The Garden of Eden creation kit. Yes. All right. Kill the rat. The rat? That, yeah, this is... They're, they're rat roaches. They're basically rats. Uh, this, that's it. We're, we're through the overseer's tunnel. Let's hit the button and get out of here. Okay. Checking... We can't open these crates, unfortunately. Not happening. We're opening the door. He's opening the vault door. Get the overseer. We need this door open now. Yep. Oh, my God. You actually opened it. Yes, I did. You did it! You opened the door! Mm -hmm. My god, I almost didn't believe it was possible. Okay. So, um, I couldn't have done it without your help. No, you didn't need me. If anyone can survive out there, it's you. I see. Will you come with me? It's tempting, but my place is here. The vault needs me more than you do. Mm -hmm. I'm the only one who has a chance to talk some sense into my father. Listen, if you do catch up with your dad, tell him I'm sorry for, for you know, Jonas and, and my father and everything. Goodbye. Goodbye. Hold it right there. Uh, oh, he hit me. Excuse me. Excuse me. Stop. Stop Hold it. Hold it right there. Quick. Close the door. Quick, close the door. Dude, don't. Yep, hello. There he is. Yeah, come on in. Close the door. I'll close the door. Goodbye. Goodbye, everybody. Yeah. I knew. Starter terminal. Take nothing. No. You turn up sooner or later. This is the world of pain. I'm not going out there. Thing. I don't care what the overseer. We're not taking anything with us. No, nope. we're we're get, we're getting out of here. That's it. So, our name is Robert, with two Bs. Uh, we are Caucasian, and uh, we have uh, specials traits. We're done. We're done. Uh, hardcore mode. Fallout New Vegas allows you to play in hardcore mode. Well, I've disabled most of the things. It's only the hunger, thirst, fatigue, stuff like that. So, like, yeah, yeah, let's do it. Hardcore mode. Nothing but my tunnel snick jacket, you bet. We've arrived in the capital wasteland. We've discovered Vault 101, and we've completed the opening quest. This is the Wasteland. Can we level up, please? Yes. All right. So, no no Fallout New Vegas packs. Ain't doing it. Nope. Level up. Oh, boy. Okay, we leveled up. So, we're going to go to... Um, we're gonna go pick up some, uh, what do you call it? Uh, just, yeah, uh, we, we could do barter. Actually, guns. Gu guns are where we're going. Yeah, guns, guns, guns. Probably not that many. Pro probably like, what, uh, 30? Then we need uh, to bring survival up to 20. Uh, speech up to 35. And barter up to 35. That's good. And then uh, the other points go into repair, because repair is going to be necessary. All right, that's it. What about lockpick? What about explosives? Don't have that yet. We'll get it eventually. All right, so first things first. Um, we got uh, confirmed bachelor, daddy's boy, gun nut, um, intense training, junk rounds, lady killer, little leaguer, rapid reload, retention, swift learner, and thief. All right, so junk rounds would allow us to uh, take, like, tin cans and shit and make bullets. Um, but uh, gun nut would allow us to uh, uh, have the spread. Yeah, I, I think so. I think gun nut. I think we're a gun nut. I, th I think that's what we are. Um, 
We have a lot of uh, intelligence, which is counterintuitive to a lot of what we're going to be doing, but that doesn't matter. We're a gun nut, everybody. That, that's, that's what we are. It's either that or junk rounds. Damn it. Hold on. No, 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 no. I, th I think I think junk rounds. I think being able to make ammo out of this might be good. Eh, fuck it, fuck it. We're going, we're going gun nut. We, we've already done it. We did, we did. We, we chose gun nut. Following his footsteps, we arrived. So we're gonna hit a save there. I, I vacillated back and forth. Uh, but but yeah yeah we, yeah we we got we we got uh we got gun nut. Oh boy. So. We're, we're gonna follow this road down here. They want us to go to Megaton, but we're going this way. So we're going down the road. Yes. It's very silly. Okay. Let's see what we got. Frag grenades. Jet and Psycho. Nuts. Yes. Okay, nothing in the mailbox. Springvale. This area is wrecked. We are absolutely... Mothership Zeta is the only one that, that starts early. We're going to ignore it. Uh, I was going to say, tin cans are something we can use to make um, to make some junk here. You can see there's a safe. Very easy. Oh, boy. Yep. So it looks like bottle caps, some buff out, psycho steady. We're already getting some good stuff. Just random drugs in the mailbox, just like real life. I mean, they... Oh. Uh, a punching magazine. But yes, they definitely, um, yes. Uh, we're playing Fallout 3. It's not really Fallout 3. That's correct. <laughs> I was going to say, we're playing New Vegas and with Fallout 3 in it. That iBot ain't talking. Okay, let's have a look around. Uh, nothing in that footlocker. We're, we're scavenging Springvale for, a, uh, for anything we can get our hands on. Remember, for those who are unaware, we have a trait to our character. It is a, uh, it is the hoarder trait, okay? Meaning we uh, get more carry capacity, but we're also, uh, we suffer an attribute penalty if we don't have tons of stuff on us. And that is, uh, that is the hoarder trait. That is uh, absolutely core to our character. Now, that said, there's some Nuka-Cola here, you bet. Two Nuka Colas and a Nuka Cola Quantum, yes. So, uh, yeah, we, we we have a minus one to all attributes if we don't have a minimum amount of crap on us. It's uh, it's actually penalizing us right now. It's uh, very important. Yep. Yeah, uh, nothing in the garbage bin. All right, let's go ahead. By the way, this is a signpost. This house will signpost you back to Megaton. Yeah. So we're gonna go in here. Who the hell are you? Where'd you come from? Did Moriarty send you? Uh, Mor who's Moriarty? Colin Moriarty. The owner of Moriarty's Saloon in Megaton. That sack of shit is convinced that I'm some crazy junkie who stole money from him. So that this is what we know. Uh, so hold on. Tell me your side of the story. Look, I used to work for that slob. Doing, you know... Favors for guys. Mm -hmm. Well, I got sick and tired of it. I told Moriarty I'm taking my share of the caps and leaving. Mm -hmm. I even slept with the pig to seal the deal. Next morning, he tells me I couldn't leave. Mm -hmm. So I bolted. I took my money and ran. Now he's branded me a thief and a junkie and sent his cronies to find me. Yes. I guess I need a new hiding place. Makes perfect sense. Now, uh, she fell into the same trap we, we could easily fall into, uh, you know, playing this game. That's for sure. Moriarty is, is an unsavory sort of fellow. And he would definitely uh, try try to do anything he could to uh, get a one-up over other people. You know how that works, right? I mean, uh, serious, serious business. It's a good thing she warned us about, about Moriarty. That's for sure. Uh, yes. Ahem. Okay. Mm. Mm. Well, you know what? I'll tell Moriarty you're gone. You'd do that for me? Yes, I would. I can't believe it. You hardly even know me. Mm -hmm. Thanks, kid. You watch yourself out there. Of course, of course. I need to do a good deed because we turn around and take everything. <laughs> oh, boy. 
Yeah, our, our karma is in the negative now. Oh, boy. Bobby pins there. Uh, yep. That should do it. Okay. Point is, we got some uh, good uh, medicine. Some delicious, delicious medicine. Let's go look at items. And if we really quick... Um, I believe it was uh, Medex would be uh, that. Yeah, there's Medex there. And then there should be like stim packs. There's some stim packs. Yes. Perfect. That, that's, that's perfect. So, uh, if she left, uh, wouldn't be stealing anymore. It's true. It's true. But uh, we, do, we do our good deeds and then turn around and do bad deeds. It's just uh, how things work. Uh, yes. There we go. Got some bobby pins and some whiskey. But it would be nice to be able to fill whiskey bottles somewhere. Uh, but I don't think I can do that. It would be really cool to be able to hit a button to fill bottles of water. Uh, but yeah, we've, we've checked out Springvale. Springvale is an interesting location. For sure. Um, but it seems like a megaton where that Moriarty guy is. We should probably go pay him a visit. Uh, there is a giant ant here. So we're going to hit it. We destroyed the ants, you bet. And we retrieved its ant meat. So that's it. We're good. We may have accidentally gotten shot while we were doing it, but that's just no problem. Yes. All right. So, uh, Megaton is that way. That's, uh, if we check the details in the data section, we can see, uh, Amato was the password. Terrible. Terrible. But no, um, here it is. Investigate the nearby town of Megaton. That's our current objective. So we're going to go do that right now. You bet. No problem. Am I drinking a lot of alcohol? Whenever we need to use melee, we're going to be chugging alcohol to make it work. But yeah. Who are you, sir? Morning. Oh? Ah, fellow student on the path of the wasteland. Right. Welcome to my humble caravan. Mm -hmm. Please relax. For we are in a place of safety. Is that where there's a dead ant the behind you? The type of safety that can only be ensured by an abundance of weaponry, both wicked and awesome, all of which can be yours for the right price. Wow. Okay. Well, um... All right. Tell me about your caravan. See, the world's a dangerous and unbalanced place. Mm -hmm. So I realized... The only way to bring peace was to make sure that everyone could be dangerous. So, with a little bit of help from the mayor of Canterbury Commons, I set up this caravan. Huh. I can't give the weapons away for free, but I come close. I see, I see. Canterbury Commons has been added to my map. That's pretty cool. I'd like to buy. It's my pleasure to offer hot death in a variety of exciting flavors. Hot death in a Take variety of exciting flavors. Makes perfect sense. All right, so if we change types, we go over to these uh, glasses. We're not going to be wearing glasses. That's uh... Actually, I take it back. I take it back. We like That is a good helmet for us that still shows our stuff. But the, like the baseball cap and like these jumpsuits, these, none of this is good for us. So what we're going to do is we're going to keep just one jumpsuit and... Um, Wait, that security armor is way better than the tunnel snake outfit. I'm impressed. Okay, the utility one is lock and pickpocket and is our lock pick and repair. Hmm. All right, let's let's go. We'll sell one of each and just uh, kind of keep everything good. Cause wait, wait, whoa, whoa, whoa! I was selling two by accident. Okay. Um, I need the repair ones. The, yeah, the utility jumpsuits. I need one of each. How do I sell just one? Cause it's oh, it's they're they're caps. Okay, I see. Uh, well, in that case, let's sell the one that's in worse condition. How about that? That's good. That's good. So we're getting 18 caps for our clothing that we're selling. Um, as far as our alcohol goes, I don't see a reason. Yeah, all, all our aid we want to hold on to. But, um, like the baseball, the, the, ba the, the glove, most of this stuff we just need to get rid of. Like the uh, clipboard and the mugs. Yep, we're just gonna sell him all our junk that we can uh, dare to spare. 
And the same thing for the clipboard. Yeah, we should be fine now. Scra scrap electronics we can get rid of. It's not the standard scrap metal. We need standard scrap metal and tin cans. All right. Uh, we're not going to be doing the BB gun. Ain't going to happen. So sorry, father, who gave us the BB gun, but we're not doing that. So we're going to sell, and now we have some caps on us. We have some currency to be able to do things. Probably a terrible idea. Mm -hmm. Another satisfied customer. All right. Empty syringes for bottle caps. You bet. Right, okay, goodbye. Keep your skills sharp and your eyes peeled. All right? Yep. Automatic grenade launcher would be an acceptable weapon. I'm sure that's true. Keep it on the level, and everything will be fine. Everything will be fine, I'm sure. Welcome to Mega Time. Yep. Uh -huh. This is terrible. Seeing like the sparks and shit. Yeah, this thing shouldn't Head be in existence. Okay. I'm gonna talk to uh I'll be dead. Oh hello. Another newcomer. Hello. Name's Lucas Sims, town sheriff, and mayor too, when the need arises. Mm -hmm. I don't know why, but I like you, boy. Something tells me you're alright. So welcome to Megaton. Just holler if you need something. Something tells me you're all right. I've been stealing a lot of stuff. But uh, it's a nice town you got, Sheriff. Friendly and well-mannered. I think we're going to get along just fine. You treat my people nice, and you're welcome to stay as long as you'd like. Mm -hmm. Message received. I'm glad we understand each other. Now, is there something I can help you with? Uh, yeah, I'm looking for my father, a middle-aged guy. Maybe you've seen him? Nope. Sorry. I got enough fires to put out in this place that I don't have time to keep tabs on every visitor. I'd ask around town. I see. What about the bomb? What about it? Uh, shouldn't you disarm the thing? I don't trust any of the locals to tinker with it. Besides, most people don't even realize it's still a threat. And hell, Cromwell and those crazies from the Church of Adam, they worship the damn thing. Why? You think you got the know-how to disarm it? For good? Uh... Do, 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 well... Uh, yep, yep. Uh, I can see about it. Oh, all right. If you get the job done, there'll be 100 caps in it for you. I see, I see. Uh, let me see. I don't have the speech for this. Um... All right, I'll have a look at it. Great. Okay. Uh, let me see here. Directions around town. Uh, yeah, I need some directions around town. Sure thing. Uh, where's the closest clinic? Our clinic is down in the crater, mm -hmm. by the bomb. Doc Church is a little rough around the edges, but the man's got talent and compassion. I see. Uh, weapons dealer? You'll probably want to see Moira at Craterside Supply. Moira! She sells some weapons. Makes some, too, from what I hear. Her place is down by the crater. She's a nice person. Is there a bar in town? Sure is. Moriorities. The entrance is on the top level, opposite the main gate. Just be careful. Moriarty is not your friend, no matter what he may say. Mm -hmm. So don't fall for his lies. And for God's sake, don't trust the man. I mean, you know what'll happen if you trust the man, right? Like, th th there you go. That that's That is exactly it right there. Mm. Okay, so let's let's get going. Um, as I was saying, uh, do, 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 do. we need some equipment there. Uh, do, do, do. Um, yeah, where's the nearest general store? Moira sells all kinds of stuff at her place. Trader side supply. Okay, where can I rent a bed? Up at Moriarty's at the south end of town. Talk to Nova. She'll help you out. Mm-hmm. Okay. Sure thing. Uh, wow. Uh, now that I'm helping you, maybe you can help me look for my dad. Well, come to think of it, I do remember a stranger coming through here. Had a look in his eye. Mm -hmm. You know the kind a man gets when he's got a purpose. Spend some time up in the saloon. Right. Might want to check with Moriarty. Just watch yourself. 
That man's trouble. I believe it. Okay, I'm gonna go now. Good luck. Careful around that bomb. <laughs> absolutely, absolutely. All right, we are going to, uh, we're going to cheat. We're going to TCL up to the top, and I'm going to show you guys this man. This guy watches, uh, he, he's always looking out to try to snipe super mutants. Watch. The more time I spend talking to you, the less I'm spending watching for raiders. How the hell did you get up here anyway? There you go. He always asks that, like, how the hell did you get up here anyway? Because there's no way up there. They're, like... That they, there's there's no way to get up there, so he's just like, wait, what? You cheated? Like, yes, I cheated. Okay, well, let's get going. We're going into the sheriff's house. I'm not even joking. I'm here in the sheriff's house right now. I'm gonna grab a Brahmin steak. We lose karma for doing that, though. We are a bad person. We we, we are basically Satan because we've stolen so much stuff. Uh, there's a sledgehammer there. Yeah, I don't think there's anything else around. Yeah, this is the shack door. Uh, this gets us into the main room. There's a bunch of books here. And a 32 rifle. Yes. I need that rifle. Very good. Yep. Let's go. So. My goodness. Jumping off invisible walls, you say. Here's the plant. What do you need? Yeah, what is it? Hello there. What do you do? Uh, what do you do around here? Uh, sorry, what can I help? Well, it's no secret that the old mm -hmm. water treatment plant is on its last legs. Right. And I'm the only one in town that can keep the damn thing running. Right. I spend so much time up in the plant that I can't take care of the leaks that keep springing up in the pipes around town. Okay. Now, I don't expect much from strangers, but if you've got the know-how, I need someone to hunt down and repair those leaks. Okay. Uh, good. How many? From the pressure in the plant, my guess is that there are three of them scattered around town. Okay. Check along the pipes and the valves, but they might be a bit tricky to spot. Yes, yes, yes. I'll keep my mind. I hope you can help. If folks knew how bad it was getting up here, well, I don't know what would happen. They'd probably help you or, you know, but something like that. So what's the word around town? Well, people have been saying that the water purifier is about to go. Honestly, I'll tell you what I tell them. I've been keeping that wreck going for 35 years, and this is the first time I've ever had a problem I couldn't fix. I see, I see. Well, back to work. That'll probably help, yep. Let's have a look-see. Uh, there's a water fountain yes, there. Yes, that's locked. And yes, I can see you eyeing it. <laughs> I can see you eyeing it. Oh boy, Wonder Glue, Abroxo Cleaner. Let's grab that pre-war money. You bet. Uh, bobby pins. Yeah, we, we're basically gonna be uh, Satan because we've uh, we've stolen too many items. It's true. It's true. The the game just says, "Oh shit, you are evil." Uh, I should have known. Yeah. So uh, that's that's fine. Door to Megaton, sure. Let's keep looking. We, we're we're gonna check each area. Wait, I I hear a I hear a leak. There's a leak over there. Fuck. Fix it. Thirty repair or higher required. So I need to get my repair skill up. I need to level up again to be able to repair this. It's unfortunate, but true. Uh, let's see. I don't recognize you. New in town or something? Uh, yeah, just stopped in to find something. I hope by something to do you mean a job. Otherwise, you want to talk with Nova. I'm looking for someone to make a delivery. Interested? Uh, sure. I'll make a delivery. Great. I'd like you to deliver this message to my family in the Aravu settlement. To Arafu. I haven't heard from them in months. The vampire people, right. As soon as you get there, talk to Davis West. He'll be glad to pay you for the trip. Got it. Her sealed envelope. Uh, tell me more about Arafu. Sure. Be glad to, since you're doing me a big favor and all. Uh-huh. Arafu is northwest of Megaton, on an old overpass over the Potomac. Okay. If you follow what's left of the river, you can't miss it. Mm hmm And, uh, do you suspect your family's in danger? No, not really. Maybe my letters just aren't arriving. 
Whatever you can do to get it there would sure be appreciated. Mm -hmm. And who else lives in Arafu? Well, let's see. There's Evan King. He's like the sheriff of the town or whatever. Mm -hmm. Then there's my family, the Ewer family. And a lady who lives alone named Karen Shenzi. Miss Shenzi. Anything dangerous around there I should know about? What? Apart from the wasteland critters, labor raiding parties, raider hit squads, and occasional landmine? <laughs> no, it's completely safe. If this was easy, I'd go myself, you know. I say, I say. Let's see, what's the word around town? I couldn't tell you, really. I'd talk to Manya if you care that much. She's lived in Megaton longer than anyone. Got it. Thanks. And behold the power, power of, of Atom. Atom. The power of Atom. Let's go check out the Church of Atom. See what we got here. Uh, we are detected. We cannot steal from the Church of Atom, apparently. Let's go to the top bunk. See what we got. Bottle caps. And some leather armor. Uh, bullets. No more bullets. Okay, so what we're going to do now is we're going to equip the uh, leather armor. Yeah, it's, it's definitely better. Oh, okay, it's got a DT of 5 and a DR of 30. So, basically, if you... A damage threshold of 5, meaning if anyone does less than 5 damage, I I won't take any damage. That's what damage threshold does. Uh, we are going to hit repair, and we're going to combine these two. So you can see I've got a, uh, a definitely a good uh, set of armor here now. We are wearing leather armor. That's good. My goodness. What's the biggest flaw of Fallout 76? Uh, that I can't make it better with mods. That's it. That, that's the... Yeah, we're, we're, we're basically going to be the scum of the earth because we've stolen so much. And yet it is so easy to get away with it. Uh, there's nothing here. We're set. Okay, yeah, we, we've got a nice set of uh, armor here. Uh, my goodness. All right, we're done. Let's get out of here, is what I would say. But are they these books? Yeah, these are all scorched books. Why are all the books burned? Damn. Unless this Come area got nuked. And drink the it got nuked. Of the glow. So we're fine. Yeah. A bomb fell it's here. Very symbol of Atom's glory. Let's go check out the brass lantern. All right. How you guys doing? Don't even think of breaking into that. I'm not going to. I want to talk to people. Well, goddamn. You're new, right? Yep. Name's Leo Stahl. It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure. Yeah. Mm hmm. Said fall three without stealing is like resisting the urge to bandage up a gaping wound. <laughs> yes, exactly. Everything's just there for us to take, and it will save us. So, uh, who's in charge around here? Well, Moriarty thinks he is, but Lucas Sims is the law around here, and everyone knows it. I see. Uh, can I see what's on the menu? Sure thing, my man. My man. My boy. Uh, anything else? Brahmin steak. Okay, so let's go ahead and, uh, sell those water bottles. Oh, boy. I, I like how these are fractional amounts. It's great. Bent tin cans. Yeah, we'll, we'll figure this out later. Uh, every cap we can get right now. Uh, vodka. We've got a lot of alcohol, so it's not that big a deal. It's just, um... Yeah, we're keeping the scrap metal for the moment the meat. We have a police baton that we got in the vault, which is good. Paint guns can go. Cigarettes can go. Um, I guess that's it. We've uh, definitely done what we needed to do. So we get 24 caps for our trouble. And we should be good to go. Yep. Come back anytime. Let's go. Talk to you later, buddy. Talk to you later, bud. Alright. This area is huge. Jeez, people live here. That's crazy. Mm-hmm. Pre-war casual wear. Sure. Megaton settlers just kind of moving on through. Generic as he is. Let's see. Nothing else we have to worry about. Mm-hmm. Uh, yep. 
The same karma noise for murdering people is the same as stealing a stim pack from a closet? Yes. It is quite silly. There's a lot of beer here, though. A guan on a stick. A cup. Yep. Not, nothing I want to worry about at the moment. Yeah, Salisbury steak. Don't mind Andy. He's just a busy guy. I see. I see. Give your bodies to Adam, my friend. Yep. Release yourself to his power. Feel his Let's glow. Let's go talk to Moira at Craterside it. Supply. Wait, hold on. This is a uh, this is a clinic. Probably get healed up. That'd be nice. Uh, let's see here. It'd be lovely if we could sleep in this bed. I'm willing to bet we can't. Yep, we can't. Cannot sleep in an owned bed. What a shame. Uh, what else? Hold on. There's a doctor's bag there. Hell yeah, that that will. Yeah, doctor's bag is great. We can use that to uh, cure any limb breakage we get. Absolutely. Okay, cool. We are good to go. We, we've got a lot of uh, great, great medicines. Uh, let's let's read this this tape. We got a tape here. Hold on. Uh, get get ready. We got we got a uh, a tape. Trustworthy surgeon wanted. Hey, Doc. I'm only sharing this with you because you seem like someone we can trust. Mm -hmm. Have you heard about the synthetic men they make up north in the Commonwealth? Well, the yep. rumors are true. They're called androids. They're men like us, just made out of different parts. I know one of these androids. He's looking for a trustworthy doctor to perform some facial surgery. Mm -hmm. Can you do it? Do you know someone who can? Yep. Also, do you know anyone who's really a whiz with computers? Whiz. So, androids in the Commonwealth, the synthetic hey, man. Yep. Shall exist no then they retcon half of this. It's true. It's absolutely true. Because they wanted to do Blade Runner. That's why. They retcon like two thirds of this because they really, really want to do Blade Runner. What's this? Uh, Wasteland recipe book. Wasteland recipe book. Hold on a second. Oh, cool. Yep, we got we got some uh, some good stuff. Hello there, Moira. Hey, I hear you're that stray from the vault. Oh, I haven't seen one of you for years. Good to meet you. I'm Moira Brown. I run Craterside Supply. But what I really do is mostly tinkering and research. Mm -hmm. Say, I'm working on a book about the wasteland. It'd be great to have the foreword by a vault dweller. Help me out, would you? I see, I see. Sure. I, I have plenty to say about life in the vault. How'd you even know I was... like? It, it's kind of like, what's her name? Um, Hyper was like, I'm going to call you blue because the jumpsuits, even though you're not wearing the jumpsuit. I'm wearing leather armor i'm not wearing a jumpsuit she just knew instantly intuited that i was uh, uh that way i don't freaking know that's just crazy uh yeah yeah uh sure uh got plenty to say about life in the vault great oh, just tell me what it's like to live underground all your life or or to come outside for the first time or whatever strikes your fancy mm. so let me see here. Uh, oh, yes, yes. Uh, do, 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 do. She she knows Pip Boys when she sees one. Apparently, she she's got she's got the sense. All right, let me see here. Outside is amazing. I was sent as an ambassador from the Utopia of Vault One Hundred One. How do people live out there? It was cramped, dark, and the food sucked. Uh, let's see. It was paradise until Dad left. A runaway dad, huh? I've seen plenty of them before, but none with the big 101 on their back. It's true. Good luck finding him. Maybe the armored vault suit will help you out there, huh? That'll be good for the book. In fact, want to help me with the research? I can pay you, and it'll be fun. It'll be fun. Let's go. She gave me an armored vault 101 jumpsuit. That's great. But, um, yeah, what kind of book are you working on? 
Well, it's a dangerous place out there in the wastes, right? People could really use a compilation of good advice, like a wasteland survival guide. Oh, boy. For that, I need an assistant to test my theories. I wouldn't want anyone to get hurt because of a mistake. Nobody's ever happy when that happens. No, then they just yell a lot at me with mean, mean words. I see. Sounds like a great idea. I can't wait to help. Good enthusiasm! Now, I think the first chapter will have to be about surviving day-to-day -day dangers. Things like where it is and isn't safe to find food, the dangers of radiation, and how to avoid and even profit from dangerous landmines. Right. Ooh, sounds like fun, doesn't it? Which do you want to do first? Landmines. No, we're going to gather food. What? What? what, what that, that doesn't sound so bad. Well, food and medicine. Everyone needs them once in a while, right? So they need a good place to find them. There's an old Super Duper Mart not far from here. I need to know if a place like that still has any food or medicine left in it. You know, it's funny. Despite the fact that uh, the war was like, you know, over a hundred years ago, th like Fallout 3 plays it as if the war had just happened. As if people had just moved back into this area. It's crazy. Anyway, uh, what's the pay? Hopefully, you'll be finding food and medicine. But I could sweeten the deal by paying more food when you get back, regardless of the results. While you're away, I can at least search through my junk and see if there's anything that'll go with old food to make it more appetizing. Right. Sounds good. Oh, great. Food is most important. But see if you can get medicine, too. Mm -hmm. And if there's nothing to find, then just come back in one piece, okay? Okay. Sounds great. Um, let's see here. We're going to talk about the android from the Commonwealth another day. Uh, anyway. What do you have for sale? What do you need? Uh, yes, I want to know what... So you sell all kinds of ammo. Chase. Sell all kinds of magic bullets. To make the guns... Oh, and a tread dampener implant. Oh, boy. Moira and her implants. Who should have known? All right. Let's see. Can I ask you about uh, your work and how my research fits into it? Sure thing. I'm an open book. What okay. do you want to know? Right. Uh, can't you... Uh, I was going to say, uh, how's the book coming? Uh, what do you do here? Why, I'm an inventor, a tinkerer, mm -hmm. and a general genius of junk. One person's junk is another's treasure, you know. I see. And traders bring in lots of junk, so I get dibs on anything particularly nifty. Sure, I don't have as much to sell, but it's more fun this way. You said 200 years is the expected time for radiation to dissipate. Yeah, but the problem is, is it's acting like people have been here for a long time. And the radiation pools are localized to stupid things like... Um, you know bombs and whatnot it's it's very interesting how uh there are just radiation spots as opposed to you know the whole area being irradiated it doesn't matter let's go i have to go now good luck with that research oh boy so did i start the quest let's find out wasteland survival guide yes super duper marked optional find food just investigate so here's a reloading bench where we can take uh, scrap metal into lead, and then we can make railroad spikes. I guess I don't have the junk, um, but uh, yeah, that's cool. The for a lot of the low end bullets, I uh, th those are breaking breaking stuff down for their casings. Okay, hollow point, uh, five millimeter. So I basically need about forty repair repair for most of these. It looks like a tw I can make twenty gauge rounds if I get all the items. Lead, um, powder, uh, primer. Okay, that, that makes sense. That's crazy. Don't don't touch don't touch those. Don't touch them. I'm just here to make sure nothing goes wrong with you or her. Right. I mouse over it and it explodes into action. Uh, I I like how I'm gonna be the most evil man in the world merely because there's loot everywhere. I, it, yeah. I will uh, commit a, a single atrocity. That isn't nearly as bad as uh, 
stealing 50,000 um, cartons of cigarettes. Okay. Very good. Let's go. We're, we're breaking the the character build is awful intentionally awful yes we, we are we are uh, we are not playing optimally let's put it like that all right we're gonna need more repair skill that's the first thing we need we need 30 repair to be able to fix these pipes and I think 30 repair is a good number to get so the next time we level up we're gonna definitely invest it into repair uh, let's just go see Moriarty's shack uh, Jericho's house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It was, I think more... Oh, wait, what is this place? This is Lucy's house. Yes. So there is some iguana bits there. More importantly, let's check all the metal boxes. Yes. Mm-hmm. Chem addict? Probably. Probably. Mm-hmm. Okay. Uh, cram, you bet. There's nothing here in Lucy's house for us. What a shame. Yep. Hem, let's go. Onwards. Hello there. Ah, look at this. New blood. Tell me, boy, you ever hear of the Enclave? The last remnant of the good old USA they are. Mm -hmm. Now, I don't know you from Adam, but I got you pegged for a patriot. And any patriot worth his salt is going to toss his gun in for the Enclave. Right. Any day now, they're going to roll up here, and then this nightmare will be over for good. But listen to me, Ramble. I'm Nathan. What can I do for you? The Enclave, everybody. Now, it's kind of hilarious the way the Enclave works. Uh, or sorry, how this guy is... I suppose he just heard too much propaganda through the little... Um, uh, through the little... <laughs> uh, iBots or whatever. Because uh, he's... like They're acting like he's an old man from before the war. At least that's how... Um, that's how he's being stereotyped, right? Even though he couldn't possibly have been born before the war, you know? Um, very, very silly. Okay, do you need both mods for this game? Yes, you need both mods. What happens is it, uh, it copies all the files over and then patches them to work in New Vegas. So, um, uh, yeah, as far as that goes, um, you're, like, if you check out my mod list, you will see, um, links to a guide on how to set it up. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, both games with full expansions, true. Why do you support the Enclave? Uh, sorry, who are the Enclave? They're the American government. The Eagle. People, comma, we the. The more perfect union. I see. Um, but you've never seen the Enclave. How do you know about them? They're on the radio. They have been for years. President Eden talks about everything they're doing. They got flying robots all around watching everything so they know what to do when they finally swoop in and clean this place up you'll see people think i'm just a crazy old man things will be different when the enclave gets here makes perfect sense i can't wait to meet the enclave personally uh you said is hideo kojima um hideo kojima is a wannabe filmmaker he doesn't really care about games so much as he cares about like crafting cinematic experiences he just wants to do it in game format but um yeah he, he read Kideo kojima reads a lot and then he wants to make stories about it that's it give me a second mm -hmm. what else Drace. uh yep yep, yep. okay let's go God bless the Enclave. Yeah, I, I can't wait to meet the Enclave. They sound like nice people, really. Uh, no problem there. Okay. Hi, I'm Maggie. I live with Billy, Billy Creel. Do you know him? He's not my dad or anything, but he takes care of me now. Anyway, I should go. Bye. Bye. All right, uh, what else is around town? I don't talk to most of them. Billy says that I have to be careful, even when people seem nice. 
And I'm especially not allowed to talk to Mr. Jericho. Wow. I usually play with Harden most days, when his dad isn't taking him out to learn to shoot or something. I see. Billy says that he's going to teach me to shoot one day, too. I believe it. When did you meet Billy? Billy does. Have you met Billy? Billy Creel? A long, long time ago, he saved me from raiders. Right. They kill my real parents. But Billy showed up before they got me. And now he's like my daddy. Sort of. You said, you asked, does Fallout 3 let you attack children? No, there's a part of the game where children are insufferable and your entire experience would be better if they did let you attack children, but uh, by vanilla standards, at least you can't. Let's go. Bye, mister. Yep. All right, the common house. This is where people hang out. They, they, go, they go take a nap here. Uh, nothing. Nothing. Yeah, there's some bottle caps there. Okay, we're good. Now, uh, let's see here. I mean, Bra Braith is so mean. It was funny. I remember one time, um, I, I, I attacked, I had a killable children mod on, and I uh, assassinated Braith in her sleep. But I, I said, uh, prepare to die, you filthy Nord. And, and people commented in um, uh, in droves saying that she's a red guard. And so what I did is I put her picture up and I said, does this look like a red guard to you? And, and the people were like, oh, no, no. All the children are the same, but uh, she's actually, her parents are red guards. She's adopted, obviously. Uh, they, they, <laughs> but, but they're like, no, no, she's... She's a red guard. It's just uh, Bethesda didn't change their uh, their their appearances. Uh, like, oh, uh, it, you see what I'm saying? Like people, like the the huffing, the uh, it's got it's got to work. It's got to work somehow. Like, don't you see? She's she's actually a red guard. She's not a Nord. Uh, maybe, maybe not. But all all the children, all the children look exactly the same. There is no diversity in them in Skyrim. They're all Nords. Every single one of them. Mm-hmm. Yep. Too much time in X-Edit. Something like that, yes. Absolutely. I'm gonna take all the food. Uh. Oh. It's not stolen goods. The common house looks A-OK -okay to take most of this stuff. So we should be good to go. Yep. Children of Skyrim. Let's go upstairs. La final floor. Everything's tossed around here. Don't care too much. Okay. Let's go. There's like two kid models. They just reused it constantly. That's what I'm saying. That's why I, I, I was memeing. Wow. Okay. Megaton was built on a bomb. The guy explains it. Oh boy. Well. Billy says not to talk to you. Okay. That that, that that's that's fair. My goodness. I have no idea what's going on here. Um, my goodness. The 101 armored suit or leather one's better. We'll find out in a second. So, uh, the armored suit has a DT of 8 and a DR of 12. The leather armor has a DT of 5 and a DR of 24. What that means is... DT is damage threshold, right? Means that damage above that won't... Uh, sorry, damage below that number won't even hurt you at all. It might damage your armor a bit, but it won't actually hit you. So, um... It's interesting that the damage threshold's slightly higher, but then the damage reduction is uh, completely off base. Yep. Yep, yep. Uh, it's true, it's true. Everything's a Fallout 3. It all comes up Fallout 3 until Fallout 4 starts. You bet. Mm hmm. 
Fallout 4? Fallout, uh, what do you call it? Yeah. In New Vegas, it has lower stats. Yeah, yeah. But, I mean, Benny's gonna shoot us and steal all our stuff when we get to New Vegas. So, it's not like any of this is gonna matter. We're gonna start over at level one and all our stuff will be in the penthouse. So, yeah, B Benny, Benny, sh it's called Benny humbles you, which reduces you to level one. And then Benny steals your stuff, which is another mod. Then if you have the, the, the mobile truck base, Benny steals your truck. <laughs> there are all mods where Benny does shit. Any advantage you have, Benny can take it away. There's even one called Benny Clowns on You and uh, and Steals Your Bitches. There, literally, there's a mod called that. Alright, let's repair this. Very good, very good. Yeah, what the hell do you want? How you doing, Moriarty? Colin Moriarty. Always pleased to see a new face. But I'm afraid you've had the misfortune to catch me, well... Mm -hmm. Out of me element. I see. I'm the owner and proprietor of Moriarty's, you see. The saloon? But please, see for yourself. Come mm -hmm. by for a drink or twelve. You and I, oh, we're going to be fast friends. Mm. Fast friends. Yep. Uh, let's see. Uh, Betamuf, uh, Metaful, thank you uh, for the donation. I appreciate it. You wish that they had an alternative to donate, so ha half of it didn't go to the Evil Empire. Uh, less than half of it. This isn't, um, uh, th this isn't, um, Twitch. Twitch is where half of it goes to Amazon. Um, we, we, uh, we have a better, uh, revenue split here. Uh, more importantly than that, I will end up getting a better donation method, um, in the, in the coming weeks or months. Um, I will set one up for sure. But, uh, yeah. Like, we, we have a much better revenue split here. Than, uh, than on Twitch. We used to have a good revenue split on Twitch, and then they fucked that up. Thanks. All right. <clears throat> so, uh, either way, I appreciate the donation. Okay. Uh, looking for my father, middle-aged guy. My God, it's you. The little baby boy all grown up. Persistent little bastard, ain't you? Then and now, it would seem. It's been a long time, kid. Oh, your daddy passed through here all right. Mm-hmm. Here and gone. Got what he came for and then left. I'm assuming you'll do the same, correct? Mm. So you can see, like, little baby boy, all grown up. Oh, boy. Uh, yeah, this is, it's true. It's true. All right. Let me see here. I just want to find my dad. Uh, my father and I were born in Vault 101. Is that what your father told you? Mm -hmm. That you were born in that hole? That he was born there as well? Mm-hmm. Oh, the lies we tell to those we love. Your father brought you to the vault right after you were born. To keep you safe, you see. I remember it well, you stayed in my saloon after all. Mm -hmm. That's right. Your father, his brotherhood a steel friend, and you, the suckling babe with nary a tit to suckle. Sorry about your mom, truly. Ah, but life goes on. Daddy lied. Life's full of little disappointments. And now you're all grown up and wondering where he's gone to. Mm -hmm. So, yeah, he told us we were born in Vault 101. Ah, I see. You know, I heard about the brainwashing that goes on down there. From some other fella, escaped, oh, five years back. All hail the overseer. We're born in the vault, we die in the vault, and all that other assorted lunacy. Kid, you've got better programming than our own deputy weld. You best wise up quick. Wouldn't want anyone taking advantage of you, hmm? Mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I was kidding. Uh, Dad talked about you all the time. Now, really, where is he? You seem like a nice kid, so I'm... Your dad was here, and now he's mm -hmm. not. And yes, I know where he went. But what you're asking me for is information. And mm -hmm. information is a commodity. And like any commodity, it must be sold at a reasonable market price. So, what's reasonable? Let's say, oh, a hundred cops, and Daddy's location's yours. Yeah, I think I'll find out on my own. <laughs> Will you? <laughs> well, good luck with that. So far as I know, I'm the only one your dad told where he was going. Mm -hmm. So, when you change your mind, come see me. I'm usually at the saloon. Right. A hundred cops, 
Daddy wouldn't think twice if it were you out there. No, I see. Daddy wouldn't think twice, would he? He definitely wouldn't. Ah, uh, come on, you piece of junk. Yep. Every day it's the same damn thing. Okay. I told you, Gob, it ain't the ra- Let's see here. Idiot. Uh, we got a new Cola, Moriarty's password. Yep, we oh. got it. The Enclave station comes in fine. Let's it's check out Galaxy Moriarty's New terminal. Uh, what do we got? <clears throat> Motivational phrase of the month. When the chips are down, that means the Brahmin is empty. Terrible. Uh, residence. Okay, Jericho. Jericho's been a bad boy. I, uh, heard all about him in Jenny Saul. Tried to slip her some of the old gun barrel while she's saying no. Uh, he's lucky the gun didn't go off, or that would have been given the little stall clan something. Oh my goodness, that, that that's fucked up. Yeah, Jericho's been a bad boy. No wonder. Holy crap. Uh, my goodness. Hey, yeah, he, he tries to pull sh shit with me. Then the Jenny incident goes public, so he's blackmailing Jericho. That makes sense. Leo Stahl. Wow, this is this is scary shit. Uh, never trust a junkie. Alrighty then. Andy Stahl. Uh, guy's a real piece of work. Uh, opening a fucking bar in my town. What a jackass. Uh, Nova, best refreshment in town. Oh, Nova, right, right. Billy Creel. Uh, let's see. Nucola Swirling Prick. I see. Uh, his little daughter. Uh, let's see. Found her wandering around the wasteland. I'm going to keep my eye on him. Doc Church. Everyone thinks Church is a freaking badass. Oh, sorry, Church thinks he's a freaking badass. Uh, everyone runs to him. Um... Got it. He used to be a medic for the slavers at Paradise Falls. I'll keep that little nugget tucked away for uh, later use. Okay, got it. Visitors. Uh, Miss, uh, Mr. Burke. This guy's a class A weirdo. One day I'm wiping down the bar and that fucker comes out of nowhere. Um, didn't even hear the door open. He tells me he's here to wait for some sort of opportunist to come through. And James... Uh, so out of nowhere, James came back to Megaton. Uh, as I stayed before, before, he asked me uh, where the hell to get the lay of the land. Told him Galaxy News Radio. That's where he's gone. All right. that That's it. So, uh, yep, yep. Never spends enough caps. Okay, tabs. Uh, Jericho, uh, 32 caps, deadbeat bastard. Okay. Yes. Mm. Their signal's been shit Oh lately. my. Oh Why my. Won't you work? Why God won't you radio. work? Come on. So we got information now. Hello. Hi there. I'm Nova. New to Megaton, huh? Do yourself a favor and keep walking. Some of us stay for a few days, and then it's five years later. Mm hmm. Radio. So I'm, uh, I've already found my father. I know where he is now. So, uh,. What were you saying about the radio stations? Huh? Oh, you mean why was Gob banging on that radio? Mm hmm Well, out there in the wastes, there are two stations that broadcast. There's the Enclave station. I don't know who they are, but I think it might just be some pre-war broadcast on a loop or something. Mm hmm And there's Galaxy News Radio. Mm hmm It's run by a guy named Three Dog, somewhere down in D.C. Yep. But the signal went down a while ago. You said, is there a, a goal to this playthrough? We're going to be, um, we're going to be slowly going through all of the content in Fallout 3 and then moving over to the cap, uh, we call it the uh, Nevada Wasteland afterward. And, um, I'm going to mostly discover along the way what new stuff, what new, um, areas are in both wastelands because there's a lot of content that i haven't seen yet due to the uh, mods we're, we're doing um but yeah we're gonna play the entire like main story and and side quests then we're going to go and do the uh, dlcs then we're gonna do um 
the uh what do you call it then we're gonna move over and do uh benny humbles you where he shoots you in the head and it reduces your level to one and all your stuff gets transferred over to the um uh to the casino where he's at so uh basically it's it's almost like starting over but not quite anyway um Basically, we're going to be exploring the area around Megaton for a while and then, you know, eventually making our way over to uh, the Galaxy Radio. But uh, mostly it's just leveling up and looking for um, side quests to do on our way to Galaxy News Radio eventually. The, the actual downtown ruins are going to be a while. So th this is more a long-term playthrough. Um, at present, we are uh, we put a lot of points into intelligence because I thought that'd be hilarious. But we're going to be shifting our focus over more toward uh, other stats as we level up. Let me see here. Um, anyway, um, we'll have to use intensive training for that, most likely. Anyway, so, uh, how much for a room? Well, for you... A room and some company will run you 120 caps up front. No thanks. Okay then. Yes, yeah, uh, sorry. Uh, what's it take to hire you? It takes you renting a room, sleeping it or don't. I don't care. Yeah, I see. Well then, goodbye. Take care of yourself, hun. Yes. Come on, work. There's Mr. Burke. Just give it up, dog. Mr. Burke is the anything. town guard. She's she's crazy. But, um, for the most part, we are running with a pretty basic setup here. Uh, you can see how we're, we're a hoarder, which is why we have, uh, diminished everything. Great. 100 caps to disarm a bomb. 120 to, uh, bed a, uh, working girl. Oh, God. Yeah, it's fucking, it's terrible. Almost like it ain't worth it to stick around this town. We should be uh, heading on out for now. I just wanted to see what's where. So we're, we're going to go past that and out the door. We're going to go check out the areas around. And children of the earth come forth I believe there's more to check out in Springvale than we've seen thus far. Here, hold on. Staying out of trouble, I hope. Mm -hmm. Don't want to have to waste good bullets on your sorry hide. It's true, it's true. Um, do, do you know anything about the area outside of Megaton? It's called the Wasteland for a reason. Mm -hmm. But there are settlements, too, spread all around. The human race is stubborn like that. Mm -hmm. To the south, you've got Rivet City. Right. But don't bother going to D.C. The place is a war zone. A war zone, you say? Wish I could uh, know more about that. Good luck. So we have another area marked on our map. That's pretty cool. Uh, Megaton settlers are just hanging around. No problem. We are doing uh, fairly well for ourselves. But uh, we're going to go uh, check out the ruins a bit more. It's going to say if we go over to our status, specifically under, you can see, radiation, uh, fatigue, hunger, thirst. So we're actually getting pretty high on the thirst there. Uh, we also have a hoarder penalty because we don't have enough junk on us right now. So we gotta go, uh, gotta go find some junk in Springvale to satisfy our, uh, our hoarder's lifestyle. Otherwise, we will be constantly penalized. We have intentionally invested in uh, perks that do not support our playstyle. Sorry, in, in sorry, special stats that do not support our playstyle. We've done that um, in an interesting way that will cause us to have trouble as we progress. It's gonna be great. Though, uh, it'll be less bad if we can uh, do a few other things. Let me see here. Yes. Let's go over to the sewers. So we're gonna see the, the sewers beneath Springvale. The so first things first, we place a save at the beginning, just in case. And it looks like we get a lead pipe from the beginning. And some water. That's good. My goodness, get the junk gun. Perhaps, at some point. But uh, we need to turn our Pip-Boy light. We're checking out the sewers beneath um, beneath Springvale. There's nothing in that crate. Damn shame. Uh, anything else? That's water. I, I don't really... Yeah, there's nothing down there. I can see into the water. There is absolutely nothing. 
So you can see burning trash. This, it, this burning trash would be filling up the whole area, by the way. We'd be suffocating if this were. Okay, we got some bullets. There's a sledgehammer there. I hear, like, scraping claws and stuff. Gumdrops. What else? Let's see, there's a lunchbox. Lunchboxes are good, but, uh... My goodness. Mm-hmm. Okay, so... Let's have a look. See, it looks like there's some mags there. Yep, there's some mags. There's also punch rings. Yeah, knuckles. Uh, 10 millimeter pistol. Pretty sure we already have a 10 millimeter pistol. Let's double check. Yes, we do. Okay, we'll we'll process this one soon. I think. My goodness, what else we got? There's some uh, whiskey over there. I'll take that, gladly. I don't see anything else around here, so, um, my goodness. Yeah, I purposefully res um, used no uh, graphic mods at all other than a, um, a, a face-changing mod. That's it. Mm-hmm. Ramen steak, some yao guai meat. I don't even know what a yao guai is. I mean, I know what a yao guai is, but, like, my character... Uh, has a general idea of what a Brahmin is, because of the, the cows outside. But, uh, Yao Guai, never seen those before. Okay. Nothing so far. A lot of emptiness. Electron charge packs, railway spikes. Oh, good. Med packs. Just what I needed. An original cider? Uh, original cider? Hold on. Oh, interesting. It increases your barter when you drink it. My goodness. Uh, the mod list will have all the mods. I don't remember the specifics. Okay. What do we got? We got 232 rifles. Let's repair this rifle with that. We're good. Okay. Same deal here. I think we have the bullets. No, we, we don't have we don't have those bullets. Let's go. Should be fine. Yes. Nails on the bat even. Looking in that room, there's there's stuff in there. Wonder where that connects to. Oh, it's right here. The lock is average though. I don't know if I can ha handle this. No, I don't have the uh, lock picking skill for that. I need 50 lock picking skill to get that. Okay. Still looking around. There's a door there. There's a fire hose. Has some scrap metals. Good. Okay. Uh, yeah, we're good. Mm-hmm. Good, jeez. I hear them. There's a ghoul. Aim for the head. Make it dead. Damn right. Ooh wee. I hear more of them. Monsters. Monsters in the darkness. Terrifying. Caution. Caution. Mm hmm. I hear. Yeah. Cool, we got some more 10 millimeter rounds. This leads up to Springvale Sewer North. Interesting. Mm hmm. Can't get that way. Nope. Can't do it. Can't do it. What a shame. Okay. We went and investigated our, our hoarder. Oh boy, that that's terrifying. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Scary. Bottle caps. Okay. Checking this way. The, uh, it does constantly show me where the exit is. But, um, yeah. Yeah, we're good. We got bullets. You guys kill this guy while you have the chance. Good. There's gonna be more. Here it comes. 
Wait for it. Got him. Damn. He survived our first volley. That was frightening. Okay. Free war money and some human flesh. That's great. Are my stats better now? Um, yeah, I'm feeling bad. Why am I feeling bad? Oh, because my head took some damage at some point. Probably got smacked in the uh, vault. But yeah, at present, we're just... Um, we're compelled to explore and uh, get what we need for the journey down into... Let's be honest here. The uh, the place that they want us to go, where, where our father is... Um, is in the middle of DC ruins, and we were told that's a war zone. So we're being extra careful. The ammunition box is good. Good. Yep, ammo's good. Collecting more and more ammo, you bet. Okay. Not sure what's here. Is this radioactive, or are these just mushrooms? I think these are just mushrooms. We're fine. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't see anything at present. There are ghouls. Absolutely. Nothing in that metal box. Okay. I think we're fine. Could be more. I don't see anything so far. The super mutants are crazy. Yeah, in TTW. Yeah, we're, we're not prepared, basically. If we, we, we scampered off to the ruins, we'd die. They literally said it's a war zone, so we're being extra careful about this. Lawnmower blade. Don't need that. Okay. Right. There's a junk here. A raider. Dead. He had a 32 rifle. That's good. Badlands armor? Oh. Yeah. What the hell are you? That man is a Simpson. More importantly, this, this is terrifying. Okay. Let's see. Another 32 rifle. Let's repair. We almost got this thing to where we'll be comfortable with it. Got to be careful, though. Let's have a look at that Badlands armor. See how it compares. That's uh, 16 DR, 4 DT. No. That Badlands armor is just going to be vendored, I figure. Sell it for caps. We're back up top. We're back up top. Okay. This is where we entered the last time. This isn't a big deal. I don't think there's anything left alive here, so I'm just going to walk normally. Pack of cigarettes. Some scrap metal. Scrap metal's good, though. We want to keep gathering scrap metal because it'll be useful for things. Um, don't think there's anything else here that we need to care about. I guess there are areas that are deeper. Um, yeah gonna say that um, this area beneath Springvale, I think we found another connection over this way? No, this is back the way we came. So it's gotta be to the right, to the right, to the right again. And then straight ahead. Fuck. I heard something. It, it's the, They're all behind that locked door. I can't use an average lock yet. Do you prefer the Elder Scrolls or Fallout series? Well, I mean, neither universe is particularly compelling from a storytelling perspective, but uh, I think I prefer high fantasy over, uh, oh, what do you call it? Uh, over, like, science fiction. So, um, unfortunately, um, like, Fallout's science fiction is kind of compromised. It's gimmicky and uses magic science, you know? A lot of magic science. Um, whereas the Elder Scrolls gets less high fantasy over time, so, you know, I, I like it, but less the more they, the, the more they push toward, you know, a more grounded setting. And I say, like, dragons grounded, magic grounded, it, yeah, but look at it compared to earlier settings and, you know, what the story, um, the world building and stuff is. You said Fallout is sci-fi as Star Wars is? <laughs> exactly. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yeah. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Magic science. Let's go. Okay. Uh, there's a lunchbox there. We don't have the recipe for the lunchbox, sadly. 
Mm-hmm. Don't see anything around here. This is the uh, sewers under Springvale, which is funny because the a uh, dented garden garden gnome. Oh boy. We're in danger. We're in danger. Okay, this ghoul, we gotta aim for his torso. Okay, we got him. There's there's gonna be another. I'm still in combat. There's like two enemies down there. Hmm. Nuka Cola. That's good stuff. Uh those uh Yep, more ammo. Got a lot of 32, yes, yes. Mm-hmm. Sci-fi changed his name to Sci-Fi. Yeah, <laughs> I was gonna say, terrible channel. Let's go with the rifle for a moment. Should have plenty of bullets. Actually, hold on, is that a different type of ammo? Uh, 32. Huh. I have 27 rounds, 32 ammo, that's good. Getting a lot of 10 millimeters. Really? Re oh, okay, okay. Apparently, uh, apparently we get equipped with helmet. And not only do we get equipped with helmet, how's our hair look? Terrible. Right, uh, more importantly, um, yes, Elite Murbo Motor Hobo Simulator. Oh, no, 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 we are definitely playing a murder hobo. Yes, absolutely. No, it isn't, it isn't uh, the, this is a, a incomparable, just completely. It's a submachine gun, but it's, it's much worse than what we got, so. Uh, we're definitely aiming to be a murder hobo. There's no question about that. Um, I was hoping to get whatever was on that uh, table, but I can't loot that for whatever reason. We're going. Yep, aiming for the torso. Cool. Bolts. Got him. Hell yeah. Let's go. Face that AP. Shit, they're coming. Okay, change change of guns, change of guns. Aim for the head, make it why can't I aim? Okay, there we go. Aim for the head, make it dead. One more shot. Okay. Monsters. All right, we got him. Hell yeah. Woo-wee. Okay. Bottle caps. Bobby pin. Yep. We got the good stuff. So... I'm gonna go down there and check it out. Hell yeah. Let's go. We have defeated the monsters. Yeah, this area is terrifying. I mean, we just came out of the vault and uh, we were looking for treasure. Anything uh, that we could scavenge. We were, we were trying to scavenge and uh, oh boy, that didn't turn out great. We're uh... Definitely, we got enough things to take back for sure, but, uh, Mothra! Yes. I don't think Mothra's in this game. That would be a good thing to add, though, I think. Good. Uh, yep. Ammo, ammo, ammo. Movie tickets. Uh -uh. Wonder why the movie tickets have value. What do you write on them? Because, I, I mean, there's there's no value in them. Okay, we're going to sneak. We got our rifle here. Well, hello. Woo-wee, critical strike. Back up, back up, back up, back up. Okay, here we go. We're waiting on it. Waiting on it. Mm-hmm. Nope, the enemy uh, stopped. Okay. I made the right choice not to go to kick. Oh, I mean, a l there's a lot of reasons. I'm, I'm not... Uh... Here we go. Here we go. 
fuck. Aim for the head. Make it dead. Damn right. Damn, that, that, that clipping with my hair. It's hitting the wall. Why is it hitting the wall? Why? There's, there's another one. Somewhere around here. It's up above us. I was shooting the wall. Uh, are you gonna watch the new Indiana Jones? I'm, I'm not really enthused at uh, theaters right now. Uh, movie theaters cost like, um, like 60 bucks per person, basically, when you get down to like, you know, food and shit. You know, like popcorn and everything. It's really fucked. <laughs> they're, they're, everything's super expensive. Uh, yeah, it's like, it, it's gonna be like, uh, don't buy popcorn. Yeah, exactly. Like, compromise the experience. Just eat it at home. Just, just watch it at home. That's the answer. I don't live in California. I live in Colorado, but, like, everything's fucked when it comes. Like, the movie theaters are on the downturn. That's for sure. I'm gonna shoot this guy. Bam! Yes. Go to theaters not to watch movies, but to have a shared experience with my wife. And uh, understanding that means I, 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 if it comes down to that, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna watch uh, movies at home. We got a really large TV in the living room that we use for like video games and streaming videos online because we don't watch TV. So yeah, yeah. Get a Blu-ray player or some shit, I don't fucking know. Um, yeah, this area is frightening. Okay. How'd you know your wife was the one? I mean, um, basically I had, we knew each other as kids, then I, um, uh, you know, we we lost touch with each other. Ended up, um, you know, I, I ended up dating various people. Uh, a couple were decent. Uh, sorry, a couple of them were decent, but uh, a couple crazies in there too. So, um, yeah, no. That then I ended up uh, meeting the wife again in college, and uh, we headed off <clears throat> in, in in ways that we wouldn't as children. You know what I mean? Okay. Let me see here. Okay, we need to drink water. Yes. Yes. Okay. Yeah, circumstances, um... Oh shit, the radiation, we're backing up. We're, I'm not going through the radiation area right now. We'll come back later. I was gonna say that uh, circumstances caused a couple fairly good relationships to just not work out due to, you know, like, families going different locations, shit like that. Like, I, I was never really invested in the idea of a, a long distance relationship. Bam. Okay. Let's go. Got him. set so far. Bottle cap there. Think we're good. Shit, more radiation. A ain't going that way. And then there's water to either direction, so yeah, those those aren't valid locations. Yeah, these, these sewers are basically done. Done, done. Okay. Uh, jeez. We, got, we gotta just leave. We're, we're, we're getting out of here. Yeah, yep. Well, we'll check the up area one more time. Make sure there's absolutely nothing up here. I say as I get stuck. Look at this. Top quality level design. A world of pain uh, developer. TCL time. What do you mean TCL time? TCL time. Goodbye. All right. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Uh, 
I knew. Let's see. What's your opinion on streaming? Uh, oh, sorry. What's my wife's opinion on my streaming? She likes it. She, she's fine with it. She watches on occasion. But pokes in. Peeks at it. But, um... She would never stream herself. She's a very shy person. So. She definitely, um... Uh, usually, uh, she's either, uh, we, we both work from home, by the way. So, she's either working from home at the time, or, um, yeah, I've got a gun. Don't know why. Uh, she's either working from home at the time, or she's, uh, working on, uh, one of her various crafts. She, um, she likes, uh, sewing, needlework, uh, quilting. All, all kinds of, uh, fun little things, which are productive. So, um, you know, very often I will, you know, take a break and go peek in and, uh, see how she's progressed. And when I'm done streaming, usually I go hang out with her. That's, um, last night though, uh, we ended up with both cats on top of us. Literally, it was very, uh, very uncomfortable. The, uh, the, the cats usually uh, hang out either at the end of the bed or um, on, like, chairs in the room, you know? They, they don't usually hang out on the bed. So we ended up with cats on top of us. Yep. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Let's see here. Yeah, well, it's nighttime. Oh, jeez. Robot there. We're fine. We're, we're getting out of here. So we've successfully plundered the dungeon. I'm gonna... There's no beds here for us to sleep in. That's unfortunate because we're still a little hurt. I'm debating what kind of cats. Uh, we have one domestic short hair who is fat due to him living with the in-laws for six months. Um, and then we have a, um, uh, what do you call it? Are there any mega dungeons? In the world of pain and the interiors, there's definitely a lot of mega dungeons, but, uh, in the base game, not so much. I mean, like, there's definitely some big areas. I haven't weighed him in, in enough time to be accurate. He's, he's definitely lost weight since, um, his big chunky days. Oh, boy. Uh, he, he still, he still looks chunky, but, I mean, he's been losing weight. Um, yeah, about 22 pounds. Um, which is a lot considering his size. Um, and then, um, what do you call it? Um, wait, hold on. Ants. Okay. The ants coming. I got it. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. But in, um... But then the other cat, his name is Mr. Sir, and he's, um... What we typically refer to as an orange cat. That is to say, he is hyper... A, a, a uh, an incredibly hyper, uh, kind of medium to long hair cat, who um, was the neighbor's cat, but uh, since then, um, since then has adopted us, and the neighbor's basically like he's your cat now. All right, hello. Welcome, sir or madam, to Crazy Wolfgang's Traveling Junk Store. Mm -hmm. The Depot of Detritus, the Shop of Slop, and the Caravan of Crap. Now, what odds and ends can I, the craziest of all possible Wolfgangs, offer to you? The craziest of possible Wolfgangs. Well, let's buy. Nothing but the highest quality leftovers, junk, and crap. Uh, junk and crap, yes. Uh, any, um... Health issues for the fat cat? No. No. He just needs to lose more weight. That's it. 
It's um, more attitude problems than anything else. All right, so this bat does 14 damage. The lead pipe does 11, and the hatchet does 10. Why does the baseball bat do the most damage? Police baton does 12. Why are all these weapons terrible? Fine, we'll, we'll sell a couple of them. Wow. Okay. Let me see here. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Butchy, butchy, butch. Let me see here. Sell the Badlands armor, because it's terrible. The reading glasses we can get rid of now that we have the combat helmet. And I guess that's it for apparel. Let's look at aid. I guess we got a lot of aid items. We should probably start considering like what we want to do with them. But for now, leather belt, uh, finance clipboard, leather belt, movie tickets, packs of cigarettes, clipboard, another cigarette. We're keeping all the casings because these are how we get uh, good guns. But a carton of cigarette, we sell that. What else? Keep the scrap metal for now. Keep the wonder glue for now. All right, we'll sell. Good, we got some money. Thanks. See you out on the road, huh? We need more Partner. money. Yes. Hi, Mariartis. Coldest drinks in the capital wasteland. Coldest drinks in the capital wasteland. All right. So, we can't really sleep anywhere. Like, I don't know of any free beds. I think we have to pay to sleep at Moriarty's, and that's 120 caps to spend the night with Nova. Makes me wonder if there's anywhere else that, that's open. He's coming with the clouds. I mean, really, you get you get a free home if you do the, uh, whatchamacallit, the easy-peasy thingamabobber, um... You get a free home if you do the uh, uh, the bomb uh, disarming or, you know, detonate it. That works too, I guess. But um, I'm not sure I want to detonate it on this playthrough. Since I detonated it on the last playthrough already. And I think there's there's no reason to, uh, to do that uh, two playthroughs in a row. Okay. That is the brass lan lantern terminal. Very easy. Okay, so let's see here. Okay. Dud removed. Dud removed. Keep gonna keep doing it. Let's see what else. Mm-hmm. Nothing else so far. Okay. Dud removed. Come on. Nothing. Okay, we're going to go with uh, stash. One out of five is correct. Probably S. Probably S. Mm -hmm. Do you like The Witcher 3? Yeah. It's, it's not exactly my game 100%, but... Um, you know, I'd prefer creating your own character in the Witcher universe, personally. But uh, Witcher 3 was a good video game, for sure. All right, let's see. So, um, I, it's going to be, there's no T, S, uh, there's no T or H, basically. So there's no T or H. Seven. There's no, there's no... Story. Where? Where's? Yep. There we go. We got it. Cool. They announced a new game with a custom character. That'd be cool. Alright, so. Uh, notes on Leo. Uh, I hate to think Leo is stealing from us. Uh, cash notes. 124 caps. We came up short. Inventory notes. Yep. We, we definitely unlocked the floor safe. Good. Good, good, good. Yep. Mm-hmm. 300 caps. That's what I'm talking about. 
A bad show game movie that you like. Jeez, I'm trying to think about this. I don't know. That's a very good question. A bad... I mean, I, there's a lot of bad things that I like. You know, uh, especially like Japanese cartoons the wife and I watch together. Uh, um, a lot of those are bad. I'd say if I had to pick like the... Um, um, let me see here. Just show, um, you're, um, I mean, Ari Freuta was like, um, but before season two completely ruined it. Ari Freuta was uh, was a good degenerate show, I think. Um, uh, again, they they push a little too far. You dealt tab real quick. Um, apparently, I need to take a break for a couple minutes. So uh, give me a sec, and uh, I will be back. So I'll be back in like two to five minutes. The wife wants to talk about something. She's going to go do one of the most American things possible. McDon go get McDonald's. We're going to have burgers on the stream. It's going to be one of those uh, uh, mukbang eat food porn eat streams. Yes. I'm going to have I'm gonna have a burger. She, she's uh, going now. So. It's, it, she, she just wanted to make sure that uh, like I was okay with hamburger. Otherwise, you know, do I want to make my own thing or what? You know, it's a t typical conversation of, uh, hey, uh, it, it's lunchtime and she wants, uh, she wants to go grab uh, chicken nuggets, and and so it's like, yeah, yeah, makes sense. We we don't make our own chicken nugget after all. Uh, okay. Women and chicken. Oh, we have, uh, yeah, ch <laughs> chicken nugget. Earth, come forth. To gather and behold mm. the power of okay. Adam. So we've got a decent amount of caps now. I'm surprised. Those who dwell mm -hmm. here. Honey mustard, yes. I like honey mustard. Now, the first two fallouts worth playing. Depends. Depends on if you like turn based strategy games. You like very, very slow, methodical gameplay. Like, if, if Final Fantasy Tactics was your jam, then uh, Fallout is not that. But it's got the same energy. Like, if that if that's not your thing, then uh, run far away. Because uh, that, that's the style Come of game. Forth and drink the waters of the glow. For this ancient weapon of My war goodness. is our salvation. Okay. Uh, let's go see Craterside Supply. I forgot where that was. It's up there, isn't it? Or is it over here? Don't know. We're just gonna go look around until we find it. That's the armory. It's locked for a reason. Don't get any ideas. Okay, that's fine. My goodness. All right. Yes, one and two are absolutely positively, um, um, like, I, I wouldn't say unmatched, but close to it in terms of writing and um, uh, atmosphere. Absolutely. My goodness. Yeah, T it, the, the problem is, is that there's so much combat that I don't want to play again. 
each of us yep. shall give birth to a billion stars <laughs> That's the real formed issue. from the mass of our wretched and yep. filthy bodies. For some people, like, that combat is their jam. They love it. That's why they went and played Underrail right afterward, you know? Because they're like, oh my god. Uh, I got, 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 like, Underrail is, is a newer game that uses the same combat style as the older ones. Uh, 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 sorry, that uh, older games. It's pretty good. Uh, I don't need the armor jumpsuit. To be, to be honest, like this is just a waste of my time. Like most of this stuff. So I'm thinking about anything other than the, maybe the utility suit. I'm thinking of just getting rid of. Yes. Welcome to Megaton. Okay. Well, I think we're good. Uh, how are we doing in terms of hunger? Hold on. We, okay, so we're we're thirsty. We're hungry. Uh, we're not that hungry, but we're mostly thirsty. So let's let's look at what we have in terms of food, and figure out if we have anything that we'd be fine. Like uh, obviously we got vodka, freaking yaogwai meat, cheese. We should probably cook the yaogwai meat, but um, mole rat steak is pretty good. Let's have some of that. Uh, it makes us more hungry, but whatever. As are more thirsty. But we, we need to go with that. So human flesh is probably not a good idea. So, um, Brahmin steak. Let's have one of those. And now we just need some uh, some water. That should do it. A couple of those and a Nuka Cola. Uh, oh, shit. That actually makes us thirstier. A bit, but less tired. That's funny. More thirsty, I say. All right. Uh, change of plans. We are getting healed, though. That's good. Like, I'm very happy we are getting healed, but, um... How are we doing otherwise? Jeez. Let's have a look at our stats. Oh, we're not that thirsty, and we're not hungry at all. Perfect. Thirsty partner. Mm -hmm. Try yep. Moriarty. My goodness. I like, um... I like Fallouts 3 and 4. I like New Vegas especially, but uh, Fallout 3 just hit a special place for me. Like I had, I had suffered, and I mean suffered, through the gameplay of uh, Fallout 1 and 2 because like I didn't like its combat, but I did it for the story because the story was good, the atmosphere was good, it was a fun RPG. It's just that. Um, yeah, yeah. Um, it's kind of like I, I, I didn't really enjoy this uh, as much as other people did, and then Fallout Three came out, and it's like, yeah, we lost the uh, story. Unfortunately, we got dumbass characters, but my God, was the landscape uh, fun to explore? All the the dungeons. Remember, I like dungeon crawlers a lot, so giving me a first person dungeon crawler is just amazing. So I became a a quote unquote fan of Fallout from fallout 3 and new vegas just said hey let's take all that shitty writing get rid of it and replace it with you know pretty decent writing even good writing at times and um uh, you know give you the same like game you enjoyed in fallout 3 and so that's that's kind of why i i love the idea of tale of two wastelands because you can you you can enjoy the, the like the base game for what it is like the dungeon crawler whatever and then, um, you know, then you go to New Vegas, and uh, you're you're still playing the same character, but uh, it improves upon it. Like, sorry, the, the storyline suddenly just gets better, you know, as you go into quote unquote Act Two, and that's why um, why I love the idea of Benny humbles you, because like the Benny humbles you mod, he shoots you, resets you to level one. Uh, <laughs> you get shot in the head. You got got brain damage. You got fix yourself up. Let's see. What are your thoughts on Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines? I, I like it. I like it a lot. But yeah, janky combat is true. Um, I would say you can get around the janky combat in quite a few creative ways in Vampire the Masquerade Bloodlines, though. Keep that in mind. Like you aren't you aren't staring at a top down um, depiction of your character suddenly. Um, you know, like. It, 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 you know, plodding through turns. Don't get me wrong. Like, Neverwinter Nights is one of my favorite games, and it's turn-based. So, it's just that something about Fallout's combat just struck me the wrong way. 
And he said it's, it's not really turn-based. It's real-time. It's simulated real-time with... Yeah, I think that's what Baldur's Gate and Neverwinter Nights do, is they give you simulated real-time. That, that That's, like, internally, the game is still rolling dice for turns. But um, you aren't actually doing it there. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Uh, boy, 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 what do we got? What else? Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Anyway, I'm having fun. So, uh, yep, we're not too, we're not too tired. We're a little thirsty, but we can fix that. I'm actually gonna sip, uh, sip some water from that fire hydrant. Terrible idea. Let's do it. Five HP, five rats. By the way, I have a mod set up so that um, I've been using Stewie's tweak. So if I hit E on the fire hydrant, it doesn't drink from it. I have to hold the button to drink from it. Hit that can potentially give you rads and otherwise make you sit down. Um, I've put on a delay where you have to hold the button on purpose. Can I make more? Uh, uh, cool Night King. Well, thank you for the donation. Um, I'm not really that interested in Elder Scrolls lore right now. And I only make videos about what I'm interested in because otherwise, um, let's be honest here, uh, they would just be hollow uh, productions. Now, I'm not saying I won't ever make more Elder Scrolls videos. I have several videos I have planned relating to the Elder Scrolls, but most of it is mods and things of that nature. Um, I I'm not horribly invested at this moment in the lore. Uh, mostly because, like, if I was, I'd become one of those Elder Scrolls channels that scrapes over the lore. Let's be, be honest here. Like, I love Fudge Muppet and Camelworks. They are awesome people. Okay, like, I've, I've met them. They're great people. But uh, they are, by necessity, scraping over, like... Uh, they're, 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 there's barely any left, and they're scraping, and they're scraping, and they're scraping. And it's like, there, there isn't any more. Uh, otherwise, you're... You know, they said, what if Test 6 has no lore? Yeah, exactly. No references to later games. <laughs> That's pretty funny. You could do some videos about Elder Scrolls one and two as a, as a separate universe. Yeah, that, exactly. That, I, I could I could see that like more fan fictiony stuff. I, I I could do that. That's that that is absolutely something I, I could see doing. Is, is some more fan fictiony stuff. You know, what if scenarios. But um, just kind of describing the lore as it is in the books. No, that, I'm I'm not interested in doing that anymore. Um, yeah, <laughs> top ten lists. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, my goodness. You lo would love to learn more about the politics in the states of Tamriel. You know what's a great game for that? Elder Kings. Elder Kings is like just, just top quality number one content when it comes to Tamriel, I think. Um, my goodness. Said Fudge Mob popped into your head immediately. Uh, it's like the lore is more or less dried up because ESO offers minimal insight. Yes. I mean, ESO is fun in terms of, like, going and doing dolmens or dark... Uh, dolmens, abyssal geysers, horror storms, or dragon fights. Like, those are all great aspects of ESO. ESO's, um... Oh, let me call it... Uh, Cyrodiil PvP used to be great, too. Unfortunately, they, it got unbalanced and, and busted. Uh, but yeah, yeah. Um... I haven't played Elder Kings 2. I've only played Elder Kings 1, so I'd be super interested in doing an Elder Kings 2 playthrough at some point. Give me a second. I have to click into a few things before I can get back to the game. Uh, let me see here. My goodness. Um, what else? What else? Uh, do, 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 do. General, there are people sending me things. Okay, I think we're set. Okay, we're good. Yeah, let's see. If if the entire game drops to 10 to $20, do you consider ESO? Unfortunately, well, I mean, the, the map size of ESO, does, uh, sorry, of uh, Elder Kings doesn't matter. The map size really isn't a problem because it's a, it's a strategy board, right? It's not a place you explore. Um... It's a place that you, um, what do you call it, um, that, that you have, um, encounters on. And so, like, each individual kingdom really, um, really has its chance to shine, I think. 
in, in that in that uh, grand strategy game. Mm. I keep telling uh, people about my favorite run in Elder Kings One. Oh, no Akavira at more. Yeah, but that was some extreme fan fiction, like where Atmora was just a bunch of Draugr, you know? I I, I, I have to question, like, Draugr court politics working like ours, you know? At that point, like, I, I think that um, Akavir might make a good expansion pack to Elder Kings too, But, um, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's it's a case of I'd rather a little more detail be put on the kingdoms and keeping them a little more separate from one another. Um, you know, the, oh, Springvale School. Let's go into the school, everybody. It's an elementary school. Yes. This is this is an elementary school. Looks normal, right? Yep. I see a bandit. I'm gonna shoot her in the head. Good. Took three shots to take her down. That was nuts. Okay. So we're, we're in the school right now, but this is very important because we can sell. Oh, we just leveled up, everybody. Awesome. Let's get that, um, let's get that repair up to 30 so we can do that quest. Repair is a necessary skill anyway, so I think it's fine. Uh, as for uh, guns, we probably want to put five points into guns to continue to become more effective. I, th I think that might that's a good idea. Um, now, as far as, um, as far as sneak goes, we'll put one point that get it up to fifteen. Lockpick fifteen. The same thing. We just want, you just kind of want to even out the stats a bit, which is, you know, nuts if you think about Like, you shouldn't be evening out these stats. You really shouldn't be. But here I am doing it. Yep. So we've evened out all our stats, and we put uh, enough points into repair to do the next thing. That's great. Okay, now. Uh, my goodness. Okay, we could get junk rounds, but I don't think we need them. I think we're getting ammo at a decent rate. So I'd say... Uh, let's see. You're devoted to your time and intellectual pursuits. With each rank, hacking uh, gets easier and chems last longer. I don't think so. I don't think we need to worry about that. Uh, dirty thief. Movement speed while sneaking and pickpocket chance. I don't think that works. Uh, that matters either. Retention is skill books. We don't need rapid reloader. I think we should go with intense training and get ourselves another point of uh, strength so that we can carry more stuff. I, I think that might be good. It's either that or uh, charisma. No, I, th I think we need to intense uh, intense our strength up. Yeah. We're, we're going with more strength. Yeah, we can get ourselves an additional uh, strength point so we can carry more things. Absolutely. Okay. So we look at our uh, overall here thing, th thing here, and we got, uh, yep, 225. Was strength not the thing? Fuck! Well, what's what's the stat for carrying stuff? Is it endurance? I'm gonna be pissed if it's endurance. Uh, physical fitness, environmental. Nope. Strength is uh, how much you can carry. Okay. So I guess it was just me having the Brahmin meat. Yeah, cause uh, there we go. We're we're cool. We're cool. My goodness. Mm hmm. We're set. Yep. 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 My goodness. Um. Getting to 15, let's use a magazine to open uh, easy locks. Interesting. All right. Hmm. What will happen to the Elder Scrolls when Todd retires? It'll probably become uh, every other, uh, like, franchise. Where, uh, oops, we'll grab that combat knife. Hell yeah. Uh, every other franchise, uh, uh, AAA franchises, you know what happens to them. Um, where they become... Uh, I guess they've already technically become, like, very different to their original selves. Yeah, there, there's no question about it. You save the Brahmin steak for when you need carry weight. Makes perfect sense. Beer, beer, beer. Right away. We're gonna need the right away later. Beer. Okay. 
My goodness. Mm -hmm. I mean, you never really make Fallout New Vegas into an RPG RPG the way uh, the way people would want it to be, right? The, the, sorry, the way uh, old, like players of older games, you, you, you create a kind of a hodgepodge mockery of what it was before. By the way, toilets have 18 rads and uh, sinks have 5 rads because apparently people pee out their... Uh, and that stuff, a stim pack, jet, some medics, and some buff out. Yeah, that was scary. Okay. My goodness, I have a uh, Wayward Realms. Um, what I ha I have a non-disclosure agreement when it comes to the stuff I um uh, uh like the stuff I know about Wayward Realms. So I'm just gonna say that I'm super enthused. But at the same time, I need to remind people, and I need to remind them again and again and again that uh, these are this, this is an indie game that's being developed, and, and um, I missed impacts on the counter. Interesting. I was gonna say this is an indie game that's being developed as uh, on their spare time, right? It's not um, it's not something that. Um, um, it's not something that they can, um, that they can accelerate, that they can make quickly, because at the end of the day, they have day jobs, right? So, um, yeah. I have absolutely, um, I was involved at the early, um, stages of development. Like, it, it's all theirs. Like, I'm, I'm not taking any credit for anything, okay? It is 100% their project. I just, uh... I just popped in a bit at the beginning. Yeah. Hey, hey! Bandito! Shoot, shoot! Ah! It's killing time! Oh, I missed. Ah! the hell are you doing time to take you apart he says that oh geez there's more there are more enemies yeah he's gonna come back with his friends i only have four shots here i need to change it yeah killing time oh no it's real it's definitely real uh let's go with the pistols i suppose yep we should be good Medical brace. Bottle caps in the school desk. Uh, what else? I'm checking each school desk. Oh, bottle caps. Why are there toy cars in the school desk? I suppose it's for... Come on now. I promise a quick death. Oh, I promise a quick death. Right. Don't care a whole lot about that. Scared, oh, all right. You should be. Yep. The 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 item floating in the toilet water there. Mm-hmm. Question what? Let me see here. Mm-hmm. Yep. Okay. Come on. Cooking pot. Excellent. Stim packs. That is good stuff. More importantly, pack of cigarettes. We can take that with us. Yeah, we're set. Okay. I mean, I expect... Hold on a second. We gotta, we gotta shoot this guy. One torso shot. You He's... got what you deserve, dumbass. You got what you deserve, dumbass. It's killing time, everybody. I know you're here. Yeah. yeah. I'll find you. I'll find you. <laughs> it's killing time. It's goat. We got him. Blew his head off. Hell yeah. You turn up. You're dead. You're dead. Dead, I say. Okay. We're good. We're good. 
Yeah. As far as I know, they've only shown cinematics. The Raiders just enjoy killing. I mean, you, the player, could mirror that feeling and enjoy... Um, enjoy killing just as much. But you've got a main story that puts you as the hero. Quote, unquote. So it really comes down to how you want to interact with uh, the game world. Did they put some engine footage on YouTube? Absolutely. Uh, but it was more or less them talking about how uh, uh, how their procedural generation is working, which makes perfect sense. I mean, at the end of the day, if you want a game like that works like Daggerfall, it's got to be procedurally generated. There's no question about it. Um, yeah, there's a, there are enemies upstairs. By the way, you see these tiny little skeletons? That's because these were all children. They're, they're giving you evidence of kids that died before with these tiny little skeletons all over the place. And little bloody handprints on the walls. This is environmental storytelling. Ooh, so special. Yes. Mm-hmm. Goodbye, sir. Your head is gone. He's well armored. Jeez. I'm impressed. Yeah. Tear him apart. Come on in. Come on in, sir. Goodbye. Damn right. The environmental storytelling skeletons. Well, they get ridiculous in Fallout 4. The environmental storytelling skeletons get placed in a way that shouldn't be, um, like, that... They're, they're jokes. I'm gonna tear you up. No graphical it's mods other than, than a single face mod. No gra no textures, no animations, nothing. It, uh, other than a face mod, it is 100% vanilla graphics. Boom. Yes. I got the library key. Nice. A shotgun. I am You're over encumbered now. Sack. I'm over encumbered! Aim for the head. Make it dead. I know I'm over encumbered. Can I can I please select the head? Yes. That's fine. He dead. That's fine. We're cool. Alright, pain spike armor. There, there's definitely a lot going on here. We are, we are fine, though. We're just gonna walk downstairs. You bet. Mm-hmm. Very good. Yep. Fallout 4, they're frozen in time. Yes, it's really silly. It's like all these people died on the toilet or died here or died there. And, and uh, the all the quote-unquote environmental storytelling skeletons in Fallout 4 are all comedy. They, they are absolutely positively comedy. Yep. I'll TGM once I'm out of uh, danger. I'm still in a hostile location. So, uh, yep. Currently walking away. Without tech, aren't you worried about ma immersion? No. I'm not worried even a little bit about uh, how other people view it. Uh, we're, we're back in uh, the ancient times. Yes. Uh, we're, we're going back to the past. The, 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 there was uh, some meme there. It uh, doesn't matter. Blood dropping everywhere. Terrifying. Okay, we're out. So... In 200 years, no one could fucking clean up. Yeah. Okay. We'll TGM this. Yep. We're gonna we're gonna sprint it. Sprinting. Damn. Okay. We cannot sprint while over encumbered. Damn. Yeah. We'll TGM back. If we get into combat, though, we'll we'll turn it off. But uh, I'm fine with that. Yes. Where we're going, we don't need roads. Oh boy. Yeah. 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 So. It's it's really it's really screwed up though if you think about the whole situation. 
because Fallout 4, uh, or should I say, all these Fallout games, specifically with 3, like, the people are living in squalor not because they're con under constant threat. They're living in fortresses, and they're still living in squalor. Uh, why are the kitty skeletons in jail cells? Because the raiders took over the school full of children and then uh, started murderizing them. Yes, that's why. It's, um, yep. Du -du -du. You're looking for the mayor or the sheriff? Yes. I'm looking for the mayor or the sheriff. Now I'm just going to walk down. And we're going to go... Kind of from, we're just going to go sell all the raider stuff and be able to handle this. Oh, by the way, we can repair these now. We just raised our repair skill. Yep, repair it. Bam. We just need to repair the other two. I'm not going to shoot the town's brahmin. I accidentally hit the button. Yes. My auto run button is right next to that. What a shame. Yeah. I should probably put the rifle on number three. Mm. To hear the thunder of his voice. It takes Let a long the time men, for them to. Women and Thank children you. of the earth come forth to gather and behold the power, power of, of Atom. Atom. Yes. Let those who dwell here in his favored land attend now to the words of the prophet they, of Do you Atom. think they died during the bombs so they come were already in cages and then? The waters of and the society globe. was deteriorating that much? Weapon of war yeah. Is our salvation. Burger. It is the very symbol of Atom's glory. Let it serve as a reminder of the division that has occurred in the past. Mm -hmm. But they're little red bloody handprints on the walls. Keep that in mind. But that's just telling a story. I don't think they know the story they're telling, but they're telling one. Hello. Leo. Hey, hey. Nice to see you. Everything okay? You doing all right? You need something? Come on, talk to me. Mm -hmm. I understand you have quite a cam habit. Uh, cam habit. Damn it. it! Who told you? I, mm -hmm. I mean, I have no idea what you're talking about. Mm -hmm. It's okay, Leo. I want to help. I could say, is it worth it to keep out of the public? I want to help. Help? What's to help? So I'm a junkie. Big fucking deal. It's not like I'm hurting anyone. You're hurting your family, Leo. Jenny and Andy care about you. Nice try. Well, guess what? I have the power. I have the power to turn back time. That's right. Remember that autosave? Quantum entanglement, everybody. We're gonna do it again. We're gonna we're gonna help. We're gonna convince. We're gonna help him by force. Welcome. Yes. What can I get for you? Hey there, buddy. Good. Hey, buddy. You got a chem habit. Damn it. Who told you? I, I mean, I have no idea what you're talking about. Yes, there was a TTW playthrough where I took a. Uh, a lady, I set her as uh, African, uh, African American, but then I made her skin lighter. I also gave her the ability to auto heal off of drinking alcohol. So whenever she was hit for a certain amount, it would show a swirly eyed vault boy who's immediately forced to drink. And so you, you would immediately down a, a, a bottle in order to tank, uh, damage. Yes. I, uh, yeah, yeah, that, that's how, uh, how we did it. Yep. I want to help. You're hurting your family, Leo. I... I guess you're right. I have to tell them about my problem, don't I? Mm-hmm. Let's do it. I just don't know what to say. I've been stealing from both of them for years to get my fix. Where do I even start? Well, I'll figure something out. Look, I want to thank you for your help. I guess it took a complete stranger to show me what an ass I've been. Mm -hmm. Take this key. It's to my private stash in the water treatment plant. Just get rid of the stuff. Burn it, sell it. I don't care what happens to it. Let me use it. You made the right choice. Thanks. It'll be hard, but 
I'll do my best. We gained karma. Talk. So our descent into being Hitler due to stealing too many um, iguana bits, it has been stalled for now. Yes. Behold, he is coming with the clouds. I'm sure he's coming with the clouds, but I'm going to go over here. Hold on. Hey, hey, nice to see you. Everything okay? Yeah, yeah. Um, how's the addiction? Kicked it yet? <laughs> yeah. I I'm going to tell you right now, uh, n you don't kick an addiction. Um, what's on the menu? Sure thing, man. Yep. He's got 100 caps. I'm going to sell him some junk. Junk, junk, junk. Those armored uh, jumpsuits, absolutely. But more importantly, bear. I'm going to get rid of the bear. Eight caps. These Chinese pistols are awful. I guess 9mm is a unique ammo. I don't know if I have that. Hold on. Hmm. I do not. I mean, I have 21 rounds. Fuck it. We're not doing 9 millimeters. N not happening. Right, we're getting rid of them. Cool. What else? Uh, clothing. I uh, believe the Raiders had clothing. Yeah, Badlands armor. That's cool. Beastmaster armor. I don't need any of that Raider crap. A pain spike might be nice. 16 damage. Yeah, the damage threshold. We're just going to use leather armor for now, I think. Fuck. Uh, we need to buy something. Buy vodka. What about stim packs? You sell any stim packs? You do not. Oh, yeah, yeah, you do. You do. Cool. 100 caps and a stim pack. Let's do it. Yes. <clears throat> Jace. Yep, yep, yep. Come back anytime. 9mm is vanilla New Vegas. Well, I guarantee you something. Uh, we, like... Assuming we wanted to hoard that, Benny would steal it from us anyway. You know what they say about New Vegas, right? It's uh, a good game can change your life. Yes. Yeah, but the addiction never goes away. Like, do you beat that addiction yet? <laughs> Watch it, will you? That's why Kate, Kate's Magic Machine... Or she makes the, uh, the, uh, the, the Z, or sorry, the addiction magically go away. Dad usually doesn't like when I talk to strangers. Hey there. Who takes care of you? My dad, of course. He teaches me to shoot and about the law and keeping people safe. Mm -hmm. When he's not busy protecting the town, that is. Mm -hmm. Let's go. Sorry. Bye. Let the men, women, and children of the earth yep. come forth to gather and behold... No, th there, there are four mods. I, I, I don't have them all installed. I only have Benny Humbles You and Benny Steals Your Stuff. That's all I have. But there is a mod uh, titled Benny Steals Your Truck, in case you have the mobile truck mod. And then there's another one uh, titled... Uh, uh, Benny clowns on you and steals your bitches. Okay, so, um, yeah, there, there's definitely some, uh, uh, I can't get this one. Like, this leak apparently is uh, unfixable. What a shame. Yeah. <clears throat> there shall be no tears, no sorrows, no suffering. Or in the division. All right. You said uh, you saw a video ty uh, that's called uh, Kate's Addiction, uh, the best addiction story in gaming. That's awful. Imagine if she actually had to come to terms with it instead of using a magic machine. Ma imagine if she used the magic machine and it didn't work, or if the machine was busted or whatever, and she actually had to, you know, as a human, deal with her addiction. I do think it's really funny that you can keep, like, you have to use, I mean, sorry, you don't have to, but you can use drugs, and Kate's like, yeah, and she, she's like, Kate liked that when you use a drug, and all of a sudden she makes, she's like, does a 180, and she's like, you fucking hypocrite. 
it, it's very special to see Kate's uh, arc in, in ways that uh, it shouldn't be. My goodness. Okay, let's just fix this water valve. Uh, fix it. Yes, we got one more uh, pipe to repair. <laughs> yeah. There's also a mod to make Benny a follower uh, after you uh, finish his character arc. Which I think is fucking hilarious. Considering he'll just shoot you in the back the moment he has the opportunity. Benny can never be trusted. Ever. Yep. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna drink from a water fountain real quick. That's right. Mm-hmm. Radio. Are there any mods that continue the main story after the ending? Yes. Go look at my mod list. I have one. All right. Uh, more importantly, where is that cash? Is it in here? Yeah, it's there. We got the key, and we got all his drugs. We got all his drugs. Super, five super stim packs. Jeez. Yes. That's incredible. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, Bethesda wants to more or less ignore. Uh, guess we're a little hungry. We're getting a little tired. We're not that tired. Like, the the first set of penalties comes at this threshold, and you only die at a thousand. So. Mm hmm. Yeah, you want to use two of them together. The uh, the one that adds consequences and the other one. Um. Jeez, I've already forgotten what it's called. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Uh, yeah, yeah. The, the point is, there's one that adds... Uh, I think it's like the Living Wasteland. You use that in conjunction with the one that adds the ending. And th they work together. Uh, yes, I'm running hardcore mode, so I can save it anywhere I want. It's called uh, Customize Your Experience. Now, let's figure out where the other water... Because that's not the real valve. There's got to be another valve somewhere around. I have to figure out where that water noise is coming from. Yes. Nothing is as you remember it. Let's put it like that. I know there's supposed to be one more water valve around here. And I don't see it. To gather and behold mm -hmm. the power of Atom. Yes. Let those who dwell here in his favored land attend now. Mm -hmm. Uh, let me let me check this. Hold on. Uh, duh, 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 duh. Crappy hitbox. Huh. Okay, let's go ahead and uh, go check quests. And then it would be the not the power of Adam, not the super duper mart, blood ties, not this world. It's not a quest. Is it? Is it just a job? I guess it's just a job. It's like a minor quest that doesn't uh, matter in that sense. Yeah, I, I only see the one, like, one spritz of water. It's just not, there's no node to interact with it as far as I can see. Mm hmm. Valve can't count to three, yes. That's true. I can tell you exactly why Valve can't count to three either. Uh, it's because they only want to make stuff when it comes to innovations. Uh, like, oh, okay, here we go. Yeah. Oh, there we go. We got it. We fixed all three. Yep. We shall see our release. I can't wait. Mm-hmm. Well, the Republic of Dave is funny. That's for sure. No, but Valve is super interesting because they um, they continually um, develop whenever there's a new hardware gimmick. 
That's what they, they make games for. Good stuff. Like, the Steam Deck has um, given me uh, great support from Avidia Games. For those who don't know... Um, hold on. I info. Oh, the Info Center. Okay. So, for those unaware... Um, let me see here. I think it was... Um, there we go. That That's a good one. So, um... I'm running Linux right now, so you, you know, like um, Linux support has uh, has increased by leaps and bounds since the Steam Deck because this, because of the Steam Deck developers are like rushing to meet it and uh, people are all hopping on Proton, you know, development to to fix it, make it work, which is great. Um, yeah, Va well, Valve is not a publicly traded company. The, the develop the individual developers in Valve make what they want when they want. Uh, they they aren't being pushed by profits. Like they still they still pay a ton of developers to develop things. It's just none of that shit gets released. That's the real issue. Anyway, after using Linux enough, uh, you you too can um, y y you know become a cat boy. That that that's the uh, that's the reality that awaits you all. Anyway, um, yeah, so we'll just quickly put this back. And uh, give me a sec. Okay, we're good. Log Horizon 3? Didn't the author get, like, put in jail for tax fraud or something? It's, uh, you know, if he, like... Yeah, I'm pretty sure he did. So, how's the scaving been? That the scaving hasn't been yet. Um All right. Um haven't gotten around to it yet. Okay. So, I need to see what you have to sell. Please, please. Let's uh let's go ahead and uh see what you have for sale. Sure thing. You said season 3 released last year? Hmm. I didn't see it. That <laughs> that's really the answer. Uh, let me see here. Uh, oh, yeah, 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 that, that's just sorting. Okay. More importantly, uh, don't need the 32 pistol. I'm gonna keep the 32 rifle, though. Get out of here, pistol. Uh, baseball bat. Combat knife's kind of nice. It only does seven damage, though. Uh, what else? It'll, I want to keep the single shotgun, because shells are lovely. But the straight razor, don't need it. Machete... Machete's pretty nice. Seven damage. Hmm. 17 DPS. How's the baseball bat? The baseball bat is 25, 22 DPS. Fuck. Yeah, I'm just gonna get rid of most of this raider armor. All the raider stuff needs to go away. Uh, she only has 210 caps. That's unfortunate. Oh, well. Shouldn't matter too much. Or, uh, the security armor's nice, but it doesn't do much. Anything here? Weapon. The vault... Uh, two, yeah, the, the, there we go. Just just keep the utility jumpsuit, I think. The armor jumpsuit's nice, too. It increases your gun skill, but I don't care about that. So, yep, let's go. We now have 900 caps, which means if we need anything, You'll we can... You'll shoot your eye out. Fuck! Why'd you say that? Try not to die! She's so lovely. She's so lovely. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Uh, D3? What's D3? I, I don't know what you mean. Diablo 3? Diablo 4? Yeah. Yes, you can absolutely combine Fallout 3 and New Vegas. Be you should check the mod list. Because, uh, Benny Humbles You is, uh, glorious. I mean, if you want the original Isekai, go check out Alice in Wonderland. Megaton. Enjoy your stay. Yep. Oh, season three. Okay. Yeah. My goodness. I have not played with Waba Jack. No. For one thing, Waba Jack doesn't work on my uh, operating system. As we explained, uh, uh, like I, I'm pretty devoted. Like, I would have to, in I'd have to install the mod list into the game and then, like, copy the game over to my uh, other drive and be a pain in the ass to do. Ah. Uh. But even if it did, like I'm, I, I have so much fun setting up the mod lists that 
why like why would I deprive myself of that fun? Uh, I suppose RL craft like for Minecraft is an example of a um, is an example of like a mod list I put together. Um, sorry, not, sorry, I I I got from a, a launcher. And Minecraft does launchers so well by comparison to other um, <laughs> to Bethesda games at least. Uh, but you can see how uh, uh, things ended up for us uh, with, um, with with Minecraft here. I'll, I'll, I'll show you what I mean. There's there's my Minecraft character, and you can see there is there's absolutely nothing wrong with that at all. Anyway, uh, let's see here. Do -do. Mm -hmm. No, no, Alice in Wonderland is like the first isekai, more or less. I mean, there there are there were other stories, of course, but it's like the m m biggest one that hit um, hit the mainstream anyway. Yeah. So um, a as I was saying, let's just get back to this. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Papa. Okay. Yeah, I mean, almost all the Minecraft launchers are open source and just kind of work with uh, whatever operating system you want to run. My goodness. But yeah, I, I set up RL Craft, which is a brutal uh, mod loadout. And then I added some uh, quality of life features that kind of make it less brutal. And uh, it... it creates an action-y, a very enjoyable action-y experience. Definitely will do again. Um, hmm. I'm going to combine these two pistols, I think. Um, yeah. Let's do that. Let's, let's go... Wait, hold on. Can I, can I unload a pistol? I don't think I can. I don't think there's any way to unload a pistol. Uh, modify it? No. Yeah, yeah that ain't happening. Fuck it, we're just gonna repair that one into this one, I think. It hasn't hit the threshold yet, so I'm, I'm still holding on to way too much stuff. Uh, let's see, anything else? My goodness. Ain't that a kick in the head is one of the mods we're using. It's a fix for the beginning of uh, New Vegas, because otherwise we'll be in for some bad times. Yes. Yeah, I'm not too interested in the... Uh, the building part of Minecraft because the game, the base game itself, doesn't give you any reason to care about it other than uh, creating ridiculous mob farms. At which point you've defeated the adventure spirit of you know going out and exploring, right? Once you, once you've destroyed the concept of adventure in Minecraft, it's kind of over. I'm just gonna farm resources. Yeah, that's a problem. Packs of cigarettes, by the way, are good money. So anytime we find, like, cartons of cigarettes, we absolutely positively pick those up. You see lots of carton... A lot of cigarettes inside of the, uh... The elementary school, I've got to say. What's wrong with the beginning of New Vegas? Um, if you... you if you travel from the Capital Wasteland there... And you've done all the DLCs and everything. You're level like, you're level twenty, and uh, you like the entire game isn't difficult at all. So the the reason you, we need to fix the beginning is uh, so that Benny uh, Benny humbles you and steals your stuff. Because if Benny doesn't humble you and steal your stuff, reset you to level one, then uh, the the game's kind of fucked, right? Yeah. Alright. Bottle cap. I mean, you can just go in overpowered and, you know, you could just kill all the death claws in the intro. I've done that before. Did, did a punching character in, in one of my runs. And when I got to the Mojave Wasteland, Benny shoots you in the head and then you, you wake up and you're like, Okay, now I'm going to murder all the death claws straight to New Vegas. <laughs> There's no reason to go around. There's no reason to explore, right? Uh, it's because uh, the, the like the kick in the head didn't actually work. You know that that's the whole point of uh, of the mod is that you um, you're, you're resetting your character to level one. Be Benny Benny humbles you and steals your stuff. 
Yes. All right. Let me see here. Brass knuckles. Mm hmm. Now then. There's a. Yeah, I don't know why they string raiders up with hooks. It doesn't make any sense. This feels like something super mutants would do. And only to, like, scare people. Oh, yeah. Let me see here. You always played a mod pack with your friends. They would do farming and liked it. Uh, but you hated the farming. Um, yeah, yeah. I, I don't like the farming in Minecraft. I like going out and exploring. And that's what RL Craft does. Is it gives you, like, a huge world with, like, Diablo-style waypoints that you can travel between. It's really fun. Uh, my goodness. Yeah, all your stuff gets put in uh, in Benny's suite, basically. He steals your shit. Yep. Alright. Mm. My favorite part about uh, Caesar was the line, Okay, let's state the obvious. There's something wrong with me. Alright. Uh... More packs of cigarettes. Thank you. Nuka Cola. Pre war money. Nuka Cola. Is that some jet? That's jet. Hell yeah. I'm getting some good stuff here. Yep. Mm. I don't mind a small farm between exploring, yeah, but what I'm saying is like they will set up uh, mob farms and it won't be incredibly great. Eh, shoot, what's this? Check in the terminal. Alright. Uh, user, suck me. Ha 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 ha. Right. I hit a goddamn hive of ants in the tunnel. Uh, uh, some of the scabs are getting tired of digging into the tunnel. Uh, Bippo died like a bitch. I, I see. And disconnect user. Yeah. Fuck. That hurt. Damn. I need. I need to shoot his arm. Okay. God damn it. Yeah, your head's dead. Bam. That's what I'm talking about. Awesome. Yes. This is Fallout New Vegas. Uh. Uh. Gunplay. Correct. It's got, like, Fallout 3 does not have aim down sights. But this also has, uh, sprint. So you can't see I'm sprinting. This has, uh, slow down time. Bu bullet time. A few other things. We, we got lots of good stuff. How, how does, uh, be, uh, cool. We, we're gonna, yeah. There's there enemies nearby. What's this? Oh, nice bullets. Uh, can't open that. Fuck. Yes. I was gonna say, no big gun skill. Instead, we get uh, survival skill. Yeah, no, no big guns. All right. Mm-hmm. Checking everything here. That leads to the lower level. I don't want to mess with that right now. Let me go ch check out the top area. It's got to be some, like in the middle, I suppose. Just a couple beds. Nothing I would care about. Okay. My goodness. Mm-hmm. You said in New Vegas, uh, don't have iron. I don't know. Interesting. Weird, uh, Fallout 3 zoom. I see that blinking terminal. It's irritating. I could have sworn that there's still an enemy around here somewhere. Oh, cool. We got a Nuka. Yep, Nuka Cola. What else? Uh, bottle cap. If there's anything else around here. We're gonna, we're gonna make a jump. Sprint and jump. Cool. What do we get up here? A quantum. Ah, awesome. That's what we aimed for, I suppose. Can I jump back? Yes, yes, I can. Cool. Yep. 
eat 200 year old canned food i mean yeah but they've got like fantasy uh uh preservatives in there yeah we don't need liquid nitrogen liquid nitrogen we can use for like uh uh certain recipes yep mm-hmm Let's go. Going downstairs now. I was hoping to be able to, like, rest on these beds, but there's an enemy nearby, and it's stopping me from doing it, so. Here we are. There's going to be more here. No doubt. You can hear the ants. There's something down there. Where's that lead? That leads back into the elementary I'm school. I'm sure you are. It's I'm sure you- time. Fuck. Ow, that hurt. Stop it. Stop it. Yes, about that. Please, just end you. Go! I like how most of the bandits didn't even come on, notice. Come on. Oh. Uh, excuse me. Excuse me. Please die. Thank you very much. I'm sure that's true, but uh, c come on down, Relax, sir. Relax, fellas. Trouble's over. Yeah, the trouble's over. Relax, fellas. The trouble's over. Ah, uh, this is gonna be Get. fun. I I screwed up. I screwed up. I hit the wrong button. I accidentally toggled off my weapon. Hell! Damn. That hurt a lot. Okay, so we've looted fully several banditos. That's good stuff. The arc light. Uh, let's check out the arc light stuff. Hold on. Uh, first of all, we should probably repair these, like merge some of these pistols. So we're going to repair this one using the lowest grade one first. Yep, fuck it. Now we have uh, two, two mostly fully repaired pistols, and we can just kind of merge this one into that one. Yes. Good. Uh, we're almost over encumbered, but we're gonna drink some water soon. We don't see anything else there. Let's see. Checking the boxes. Nothing in the middle boxes. We're fine. We're fine. Uh, what do I think about the rumors about uh, how strong the next Nintendo console is? I think that they've given out a variety of developer kits to different uh, to different developers and. We won't actually know how strong it is until we get it in our hands. Uh, filing cabinets. I think there's there's an enemy somewhere around here. I hear an ant. It's trapped in that room. I'm probably going to have to come back here later. Yeah, I, I'm definitely going to have to come back here later. There's no question about it. There's, there's way too much stuff for us. I mean, we we should... Yeah, we're, fuck it. Uh, first things first. Grab grab the medical. Pure. Oh, we got a purified water. That's lovely. We're good. We're good. Yes. And that set up some developers for failure. Yeah. It's fucked. They they will release the official specs, but they'll give people dev kits that aren't necessarily in line with the final product. That happens. Oh, shit. Oof. Terrifying. We got it, though. Yes. So, um... No, the, the main issue with, um... With development kits is that, um... It's mainly to make sure that the game works, and then during the optimization stages, they will just straight up tell you what the final specs will be. But Nintendo is famous for sending out a variety of kits and not really deciding on what the final product will be. But yeah, it's... Um, Will it work in our operating system? The answer is yes. Sprint. Imagine Nintendo's next Switch is as powerful as a PS5. Well, I mean, they're using 
if it's going to be a handheld, they're going to have to use modern cell phone um, hardware. Give me a sec. Yeah. As I was saying, there is a... Um, there is hardware that... Um, for cell phones that'll work pretty well. And by that I mean, like, it'll run modern games. But those are expensive. They're usually like $1,200 cell phones, right? They're like the high-end gaming phones. And um, at the end of the day, that's what a Nintendo Switch is, by the way. Is It's a, uh, it's like an eight-year-old cell phone. I'm not joking about that. Like, in internally, that's what the hardware is. Please, hey, hey, looking to buy? Yeah, I am looking to buy. Nothing but the highest quality leftovers, junk, and crap. I see, I see. We'll take this pipe and this machete and this extra shotgun. Yes. My goodness. Um, I'm certain I saw a Tim Kaine video. I can't tell you what it was, though. So long ago. Uh, or not so long ago, but rather I wasn't paying attention. That's what I'm trying to say. Like, so long ago. What are you talking about? Those, those Yeah. No, I, I'm certain I saw it. I had a Tim Kaine video going in the background, but there's there's no way <laughs> at the moment uh, for me to remember what it was. Like, um, it was Fallout. It was Fallout. It was, it, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm, I, I just looked right now. Hold on. Let me, let me, let me, let me double check my history. Yep, 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 yep. It says I've seen it. Let me see if I've seen anything else of his. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go to library. I'm gonna click on, because my memory sucks. So I'm gonna click on library. I'm gonna click on history, and I'm gonna do a search. Yeah, it was, it was the Fallout one. It, it was the Fallout one. Oh, my say here. Mm-hmm. But um, that that's it. That's all I've seen. Welcome to Megaton. Okay. Uh, pipe machete stand. shot. Yeah, single shotgun. Okay, we got everything sold. I just need to make sure we didn't accidentally oversell. Yep, we we're getting rid of that one too. Where I I don't I don't like the vault jumpsuits based bit also. But you're missing out on five gun skill. It's true. It's true. I am. I, that is indisputable. But also I don't care that much. Okay, packs of cigarettes. Oh, God, he doesn't have any more uh, anything. Let's take his stim packs. Let's take his rocket launcher schematic. I don't think so. Uh, Raider Badlands armor. Nope, it would be... I'm just trying to see what he has that I might want. And the answer is a whole lot of nothing. Oh, I, I can have his casings for free. He doesn't care about them. Good. Uh, bu 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 what do we got? 32 rounds. Yes. And 12 gauge rounds. Yeah, we're just taking all his ammo at this point. Yeah, okay, there we go. Yep, yep, we got it. Cool, cool, let's do it. We got all his money. Another satisfied customer. Goodbye. See. Mm -hmm. Good, 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 good. Mm hmm. What my say here? Mm -hmm. they, they they give them power. Oh, it's not that they give them powerful hardware. It's that they give them hardware that they know will meet the uh, like operating system specifications. So like this is this will more or less run what you're doing, and uh, that will give you the final specifications, and you may need to pare down later. That's happened a couple times with Nintendo consoles. As, um, I, it's usually the other way around, by the way. They're usually underpowered. Hey, Leo, how's it going? Hey, hey, nice to see you. Everything okay? Uh, yeah, kick that addiction yet? Uh, I just started, but so far, so good. Right, right. I guess that's it. What are you doing in here? Nothing. I'm, I'm not doing anything. Leave me alone. He was looking for his stash. That's what he was doing. And I took it. I took his stash, yes. He asked me to take his stash, so it's fair. But it's also very silly. Okay. 
Uh, would love to be able to sleep in on one of those raider beds. That'd be nice. Small talk simulator, yeah. I guess everywhere is closed, and I don't want to sleep at Moriarty's, so I guess the answer is go back into Springfield and go sleep on one of the raider beds. Fuck it. Can't run and jump at the same time. That makes me sad. Sprint mode and jump is just like, what? what is this? Look, look at this. Whoa. Yeah, yeah, you, you can't gain uh, any height, unfortunately, or any distance. Yep. What a shame. I, uh, I remember a time before the Nintendo, the Super Nintendo, before the Nintendo, yes. Oh, boy. It's pretty hard in real life to do a running jump. I mean, I've done it. Yeah, I, I, de I definitely gained a little bit of distance in running and jumping, so... Their beds are outdoors, are they? Are there beds outdoors? I was just gonna go and like sleep in a raider bed somewhere around here. I mean, there's like, uh, there should be something around here somewhere, like in one of these little locations. Uh, okay, this is a kitchen. Mm. Well, the other ruined house had a lady in it, uh, but like I was looking at this bed here and it won't let me sleep on it. it just says, nope, you can't sleep on that bed. Fuck you. Uh-huh. Yep, I guess we're gonna go upstairs first. Screw it. It's nighttime, so I can't deal with anything. If we look over here at our uh, stats, you can see we're, uh, we're only at 76 fatigue. Uh, we're a little hungry, and we're very thirsty. But uh, that shouldn't worry, uh, shouldn't matter too much. There shouldn't be too many worries. All right, we're going out. We're gonna be fighting banditos. I'm gonna really quick check to see how we're doing in terms of rifle. Reload. <clears throat> yeah, we're set. We're getting a little thirsty. Ah, uh, this is gonna be. Uh, yeah, about that. Lose your head, sir. Yeah, rifle time. Good. That guy's head is gone. Now, more importantly, whoops! Hello. Ow! Ow! It hurts! It hurts! It hurts! It hurts! Make it stop. Holy crap! That was painful. I will, I will, I, I will be torn apart. Give me a sec. I'm gonna pause time and drink a Nuka Cola and then also have a Meyer Lurk special. Let's do it. Oh boy, where are you? I'm getting shot at, but I don't see. Oh, that, that, that explains everything. Fuck. Shoot them in the head, shoot them in the head, make them dead. Got him. Okay. Ow, ow, oh, oh, it hurts. Hold still. Oh, jeez. That metal bra she's got on grants her all kinds of uh, resistances. Jace. Yeah, th th that metal bra is something. Those are like two colanders that she's just wearing as a bra. It's her pain spike bra, apparently. All right. Well, there's desks here. Um. Yep. Not much in the desks. 12 gauge. How's our shotgun? We, we picked up a shotgun earlier, but I think it's crap. Yeah, it's very damaged. Got 13 uh, shells for it. Yeah, I got 13 shells for it. What a shame. Okay. Now, if a game included real drugs, it would be subject to heavy censorship. Yep. Okay. Yeah, I don't see anything around here. Anything relating to beds. Hockey mask and leather belt can be sold, though. My goodness. Yep. One clean piece with no holes in it. Yeah. you think that there would just be a hole in their neck and then they'd fall over dead, you know? As the blood just sprays out of their arteries. Oh boy, describing gore is not so good. Bottle caps! There's toilets in here. And a doctor's bag. No, that's not a doctor's bag. It's just the tank. I keep forgetting they had tanks. I'm gonna drink uh, some water here. Mm hmm. I don't think I would ever. I, I'm, I'm not 
outside of like Left 4 Dead, which I fucking adore, I'm not actually big, you know, very keen on zombie games and mods. Uh, I think that there there was one hilarious, and I mean hilarious, uh, mod. Oh, bottle caps. I was gonna say hilarious uh, mod for uh, what's it called Skyrim that had zo a zombie apocalypse, but uh, that I I think I d even disable that feature completely. That kind of tells you where I'm at with zombies. Uh. Cataclysm the Dark Days Ahead. I've played that once. What was it? Like? Talk about jank. Um, never played Zomboid. Yep. Again, not really a fan of zombie games. All right. Hmm. I realize there are people out there who thoroughly enjoy... Uh, then there are zombie games. Call of Duty Zombies! Uh, I, I, I don't even... No. Nope. Minecraft... Minecraft does have zombies. Also has skeletons. And giant eyeballs. And in uh, the version I play, Blade Fury. Where a bunch of uh, crazy uh, golems come out and try to murder the shit out of you. Alright. Stream runs better through a vape VPN. In other words, uh, your connection to YouTube sucks. And your VPN's connection to YouTube is better. That's it. Uh, have I ever played the game with the stop sign and the Malkavians? Yes. Okay, so there was no beds. No beds. Man, there, there's no beds anywhere. Anywhere. I'd have to spend 100 caps if I want to sleep in this damn place. Because, I, I don't know, I couldn't sleep in any of the beds. I'm gonna drink uh, from the fire hydrant again. There we go. Yeah, Minecraft is sort of a zombie apocalypse, true. True. Yep, there are a lot of interesting uh, masquerade bloodlines, like overhauls, like total conversions and shit, which I have not touched. Uh, and I really should give it a try. Give me a second. Someone said an Umbra Forma drops in the current Warframe livestream. Okay. Well, what we're going to do is we're going to uh, just throw that up onto Twitch. And then I'm going to mo then I'm gonna mute tw the Twitch website. Uh, mute site. There we go. The uh, Warframe livestream is now running in the background. And I'm going to lower the settings down from 1080p to 160p so that I am a quote-unquote viewer. Yeah, but yeah, an Umbra Forma is dropping off of the uh, the current live stream in Warframe. That's hilarious. Yep, get an Umbra Forma for watching, it says. Uh, 30 minutes, okay. There we go. I'm doing it. Yep. Do. I did, uh, yeah, I actually did some Nosferatu. I'd never beat my Nosferatu playthrough, but God, the idea of actually, like, you have to hide or people will see you and attack you. It's that simple. So, yeah, I think they, they nerfed these beds. I can't use them. I have to actually pay. No question to boot it. Hmm. Let's go upstairs just in case. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, that's another bandito I didn't uh, loot. Fuck, I'm gonna get over encumbered. Almost. Almost. But not quite. The caravaneer is done. I play there's a bed here. Use bed? Nope, can't sleep in that bed either. Wonder why I can't sleep in these random beds. I think I should be able to. Hmm. Wondering, uh, what's up with that? I need to come back here, though. Um, like, is, is there a, an enemy around? Oh, said, uh, oh, hold on a second. You said a man of culture. Really? Really? Did, okay. That's fine. All right. Ahem. As, as I was saying, uh, what are we doing? Uh, they have bed bugs. Yeah, apparently. I'm going to go look at the configuration settings, though. I'm going to go tweaks. I'm going to look at bed. Bed. Okay. 
So, sleep in owned beds. Uh, no alt tab on pause. Jumping doesn't drop grabbed item. Uh, encumbrance includes grabbed items. Okay, so yeah, I don't see I don't see it there. Mm, sleep. Yeah. So allow sleep, faster sleep, wait. Allow sleep on chairs, sleep and sleep in own beds. So allow sleep on chairs. Why not? <laughs> That's pretty funny. Uh, sleep in combat, sleep radiation, taking damage, trespassing. That's just pretty. Sleep underwater. Oh my goodness! What the hell? Mm-hmm. Oh, and McDonald's. Oh no. Uh, what's this? So yeah, based on all of this. Oh shit! I know exactly why I can't can't sleep there. Hold on, hold on. Yeah, don't. don't it's okay. No, no. I know. I know exactly why I can't sleep. It's it's simple. It's simple. Okay, check the check the shit out. I have a function on so that you can't lay down or sit down or uh, go into like any kind of animation on a button press. You have to hold the button, and that's to prevent you from accidentally, um, to stop you from accidentally going into a, like uh, from accidentally say drinking toilet water or whatever. That's it. I just had to hold E. That's it. That that's it. Yeah, but. Like, you know those times when you're trying to loot something from the toilet and you accidentally drink the toilet water instead in Fallout? That, that's a Falloutism, by the way. Um, yeah. We, 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 we fixed that. Absolutely. Um, I'm going to let you in on a little secret. So I usually go Legion, but this time I'm thinking about going this route with the NCR, okay? So uh, I'm, I, like, j just just a heads up. Like, I am, I am seriously thinking about doing... Um, about running with the NCR. I, I think that might be uh, might be a good idea for, for this run. Anyway. Um, yeah, so uh, not not much else to say about it. Let's let's keep going. Ahem. Alright, let's sleep for we'll just yeah. If we can sleep in here, it's it's not a problem. We sleep eight hours, we should be fine. And it'll be daytime and we can go out. Yep. Yes. I mean, come on now. Um, you said I images of, of my cat boy? Yes. P people don't know. P people don't know the truth, though. Like, I, I use this often enough that people are learning. But, uh, yeah, yeah, this is whenever I don't want to be on camera. I, I use the uh, the effeminate cat boy. Wearing the French maid outfit. It's true. It's true. And there, there are a handful of streams that I've used it on. And, and people go, what the fuck, constantly. It's great. It's great. Yeah. There you go. Ahem. <clears throat> yes. Moving along, moving along. All right. Hey, Con. Tale of Two Wastelands seems completely, positively stable. And... There's a mod now that makes, um, what's his name? Uh, Benny, sh when he shoots you in the head, when you switch over to, like, Fallout uh, New Vegas, it resets you to level one. Benny steals your stuff. And, um, as a result, um, a as a result, you have to play most of the game normally up until you, you get into his, like, personal suite and get your stuff back. And then you can go back to being the overpowered badass you were at, at the end of um, at the end of your Fallout uh, uh, three run, but um, like they they've integrated it perfectly now. It's kind of amazing. Yep. Yeah. Anyway, we're gonna sprint our way over here, back to Megaton to go sell all the junk from the Raiders. Does he equip your stuff? As far as I know, he doesn't. But that might be a good mod. There's also a mod that adds a, like a mobile truck that you can use to fast travel between locations, including the two wastelands. And there's a mod called Benny Steals Your Truck. And then if you get like followers that don't uh, go away, 
Then there's another one called Benny clowns on you and steal and steals your bitches. Yes. So um, the point is that there there are uh, there are a, a number of uh, uh, of Benny mods uh, that that exist out there to, uh, to to work perfectly. Yes. All right. Now then. Need some grub? No. Try the brass lantern. You deserve to be a bigger challenge than vanilla. Yeah. What? What? And goddamn. <laughs> All right, we got we gotta go sell stuff. That's what we're gonna do right now. We're going to the clinic first. <laughs> yeah. And he steals your DLCs. Hey, we have d DLC delay on right now. So other than Mothership Zeta, which happens automatically, all the other DLCs you have to actually find. True. Hello. I'm Doc Church, and I run this clinic. Okay. Now, before you go asking me for help, you'd better know the rules. Rule one, don't bother me. If you do bother me, you better be damn near dead. I'm busy enough taking care of people I actually like. Follow my rule, I'll keep you patched up. I'll keep getting paid, and we'll get along just fine. Right. Okay. My goodness. Okay, I'm hurt. Can you help, Doc? Can you heal my radiation? Don't care about that. I'd like to buy some medical supplies. Planning on going out and getting shot up, eh? Yes, yes. But what I actually mean is I want to sell you a bunch of trash with the knowledge that I will then turn around and, uh, yeah, get shot up. It's true. It's, it's, it's actually not wrong about that. But, uh... We're not going to acknowledge it so much as we're just going to sell most of this trash to you. And then we're going to go over and say, I need some stim packs, man. Uh, let's see. Damn, I owe him money if I get that many stim packs. Not sure I, I like that. Not sure Not sure I like that much at all. Uh, uh, let's see here. Hmm. Let's give those stim packs back and let's get the, that purified water first. Yeah, once we get the purified water, we can kind of, like, individually... Oh, that's good. So he gives me 99 caps, and then I get two purified waters in a stim pack. I like that a lot. Yes. Trash can be exchanged for goods and services. That's true. Cartons of cigarettes, you're right. I totally forgot about that. Yeah, 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 yeah. Definitely time to sell the cigarettes. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. Uh, jeez. Uh, packs of cigarettes. Gonna hold on to the pre-war money for now, but, um... Yes. Ahem, <clears throat> Wonder Glue. We'll need Wonder Glue later for crafting, but we can purchase that. It's not a big deal. Uh, um, let me see what else we need. Holy crap. Yeah, everything's great so far. All right. Yep, yep. I I'd say we just uh, grab a few more uh, stim packs and we're good to go. Radex would be nice, I suppose, but does he have right away? He does not. He has no right away. Uh, so yeah, just, just some individual stim packs until we hit the... Yep, perfect. Five stim packs and two purified water. Perfect. There is a smoke cigarettes mod. There's actually a save in hardcore by smoking a cigarette mod. You done? Yeah. Good. Here we go. Try to be careful. It's like save your schnapps from uh, Hungry Hungry Henry. Absolutely. Okay. We just looted a bunch more medical supplies from this lovely man. I think we're good to go. So. The men, women, and children of mm. the earth come forth. Then he goes to Hyrule. And behold the oh, power geez. of Adam. Yeah. Let those who dwell here in his face. Nano machines, son. <laughs> okay, I think I think we're good. We just need to see if there's anything else. We got our two pistols. Like, one's going to get broken, and we're just going to repair it using the other. Uh, apparel, yeah, we got our combat helmet and our leather armor. Yes, we're very good. Top quality number one content, you bet. This ancient weapon of war is our salvation. Yes, it yes. It is the very symbol of Atom's glory. The symbol of Atom's glory. As a reminder of the division that you bet. In the past. Okay, we're, we're leaving. Uh, pretty sure if we've got... Yeah, our carry weight's good. Unfortunately, we have the hoarder perk at present. So we lose, um, what, what you might call it, jeez. 
Uh, we, we lose uh, stats as long as we don't have that much ge uh, items on us. It's true. It's true. Okay, it's why we are increasing our strength constantly to be able to carry more. Uh, we're actually kind of thirsty, uh, I think. Look, let's have a look. We're hungry, thirsty, tired. What are we? Hold on, let's hit the stats. We are thirsty. Uh, not that hungry, not tired. So we, we just got to... Uh, I'm going to zoom back drunk. in. I'm going to grab a drink. Try the brass uh, hold on a second. Oh, shit. I see, I see a box. Uh, cool. Yep. Po welcome to Pony Express. These drop boxes. You can deliver items to any Pony Express box you've discovered cool can't wait to start sending stuff around using pony express it's gonna be great adam be praised okay more importantly someone should have like a, a sink i can drink from yeah if we go over here like lucas sims house we should be able to drink from the sink there it is yeah it's five rads a pop but that's fine our dehydration level has decreased so we're just gonna we're gonna drink for a bit That should be good. We got a lot of rads, but we shouldn't be thirsty anymore. Nope, we only have one point of thirst, so we're, we're set. Let's go. We will eventually need the doctors to cure our radiation. We ac accumulate it just drinking and surviving, but that's fine. Do, do, do Fallout 3 and New Vegas share the same timeline? As far as lore nerds are concerned, they do, but they are so different to one another that they probably shouldn't. Honestly, Fallout 1, 2, and 3 no, sorry. Oh, yeah. Sorry. One, two, and New Vegas Welcome should be in at one timeline. And Vegas then three, time. uh, uh, three, four, and seventy-six should be in a different timeline. But that's not how it works. You know, the the, the lore nerds are co absolutely convinced that, uh, that it's all one universe, and you should pay attention to it. So that's fine. Yes. Okay. Let's go. We are. We are going to uh, head back in and start fighting those killer ants inside of the Springvale School. We're, we're looting. We're selling. Getting good stuff. We're going to sprint. <laughs> That's pretty hilarious. Sprint is good for accelerating you into the, the physics objects. The physics objects don't hurt you, thankfully. Yes. Uh, do, 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 do. 4 and 76 are in a different dimension. That's why I'm saying. That said, Tale of Two Wastelands is really fun. Playing through the entire game in Fallout 3. Then uh, switching uh, stories there. Uh, uh, Minecraft, but with deeper survival and crap. Interesting. Never heard of it. I have never heard of Vintage Story. Nope. Not even a bit. Okay. We're going to go downstairs. We got to go... We got to go up to go down, I think. This way. That'll take us down, I think. This is the lower levels. Okay, pretty sure we got everybody and looted everybody fully, but we're going to make absolutely certain that everything is clear here because uh, we're going to be fighting ants in a second. So uh, there is a corpse there. Yeah, behind that door are the ants. I'm surprised there isn't an ant up here. Yeah, this is this is the uh, the deeper, the deep darkness where this, the ants are located. Grab that. Uh, scrap metal is good. Did I, did I miss it? Yeah, ammo. We're good. Okay. I think we're set. Mm -hmm. Filing cabinet. Another filing cabinet. No, we get, we're going to check the other room before we go fight ants. Close that door. Is that water? Yeah, that's water, all right. Scrap electronics? Sure. Grab some scotch. Some water. Dirty water. Hockey mask we can sell. I still have uh, lowered stats because I don't have enough on me. My hoarder perk is actually punishing me for not having enough stuff. Benny versus Johnny Silverhand. <laughs> okay, okay. Yeah. You, you legitimately got me with that one. Holy fuck. Oh, boy. Go, go. Oh, we got him. Cool. Excellent. The ants are coming. And we're slaying them. I got 15 more shots with this, then I can move over to my pistol, and I have billions of shots with the pistol. So someone's been digging down here. No question about it. There's a whole ant hideaway here. There's lanterns. Which means that someone someone's definitely been down here. 
Oh boy. These are only one shot, so. Oh, never mind. I take that back. Did that one get killed by its friend? That was kind of strange. 11 shots. Got. Remember Trespasser, Jurassic Park, where she would count? Like, the voice actress would count the number of shots that she's fired? that you'd know how much ammo you had because there was no user interface in the game. If you wanted to know how much health you had, you had to look down at your, um, what do you call it? Uh, you had to look down at your, your because you could see your own character running around. So you'd look down at her chest and her chest would have a tattoo that would be full, uh, full basically, whoa, hold on. It would be full as, um, for health. Yeah. I am. Amazing. There's more. Oh, boy. One more. One more's coming. Got him. Okay. This is not good. This is not good. Change to pistol. Hey, 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 hey. Pistol, p pistol time. Come on. Woo-wee. That's some crackle. That's some crackly noises. Ant Nectar. End up selling most of this stuff. But for now, we got some good things, so we should just keep going. Grab all the ant eggs, the nectar. You see them crawling underneath? Yes. If you hit their antenna, they attack random targets. That's interesting. I had no idea. I do know that these ant eggs are looking pretty good. Uh, that is an assault rifle, and it's got some mags. There are mags for that assault rifle. Oh my god, what's this? Hold on, get, 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 off, get off of that. Oh no! That! L look at the secrets! Oh no! Oh, no. Uh, I have the radio turned off. Why? Uh, do, 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 do. Galaxy News Radio, Enclave Radio, uh, Vault PA system. Can't select this for some reason. It's it's in the, yeah. Vault 101 PA system. <laughs> My goodness. Yep. Mentits and some turbo. That's good stuff. Uh, get off, Ant. Jet. Jet's good. Ant meat, Ant nectar. We're going to be mostly selling this junk that we're picking up. Oh, a carton of cigarettes and a camera. Awesome. That's good stuff to hear. I can't get up there right now. What a shame. What a shame. So this area where the raiders were doesn't seem like there's a whole lot down here. Unfortunately. Well, let's go. We've uh, successfully slain most of the ants, gained a bunch of experience points, and items to sell. We also got an assault rifle that I'll have to consider using. With, uh, whoops, never mind, there's another path. Oh, it leads to rock, okay. So the, the monster that just came around the corner was a uh, whole lot of nothing. Got it. Uh, let's do this. Let's uh, switch things up. Let's see what we got in terms of weapons. Yeah, I'm thinking the uh, submachine gun can go away. Because it's 73 DPS versus, I guess, 43. This has a higher DPS rate. That's interesting. Hmm. Yeah, Liberty Prime's really uh, funny. Not quite the flex some people think it is, but uh, it's really fucking fun. Uh, doesn't need to be smart to be entertaining. Okay. Back to the capital wasteland. Where is this lead? It's out over here where we killed all the raiders? Ah. Oh. Okay, walking irony, more or less, yeah, but it's enjoyable. 
Yeah, okay. Nobody likes to think of all the cogs that get crushed under the system while the system is running, but hey. It's fine. It's, it's fun. Alright. Cups. My goodness. Uh, in Daggerfall, you need mods, you test walk, uh... From one city to another. I mean, that that makes sense. Fast travel is a must. My goodness. Yep, yep. I'm looking forward to... Um, yep. But I, I'm looking forward to... Um, Starfield, honestly. I don't think it's going to be an incredibly good game. I think it'll probably be, uh, as the children call it, mid... But, uh, for, for, like, open world sandbox standards, throw in a little bit of a space, uh, easy peasy space simulator, I think I'll enjoy it. Evening. Uh, evening, indeed. It is evening. But we finished looting everything. We need to go, uh, sell some things at Craterside Supply. I think we go up this way to get to Craterside? Something like that? End up putting a foot through someone's house at this rate. Moira, how ya doing? So, how's the scaving been? Got the food medicine from that super duper mart? Not yet. I haven't gotten there yet. Okay. Uh, let's see. First things first. Um, items for sale. Absolutely. Yes. She has 21 caps, but she also has uh, 32 rounds. So, I'd like. Uh, so, I'd be paying her 35 caps to get those. Uh, these are piercing rounds. Those look pretty good. But let's see here. If we want 10 millimeter, because it's got a 10 millimeter pistol, I don't think so. 556 would be for the uh, the machine gun we have right now. Uh, so let's grab a couple bobby pins. And more importantly, um, does she have any stim packs? What's this? Cybernetic Surgery Standard Edition. Oh, shit. We'd have to get that. That's a book on cybernetic surgery. That'd be great. We can learn all about uh, getting a hand stabilizer implant would be nice. Yeah, some of these are kind of nu uh, nuts. Motorcycle helmet. Don't care about any of that. Shot glass. Yeah, well, let's go ahead and just kind of sell her a couple more things. To, uh, I guess, a cleaver and a combat knife would help keep the baseball bat just in case but um yeah that assault rifle uses 556s hmm yes it, this is tale of two wastelands it's uh it's actually new vegas it's just we're playing through the fallout three part all right what do we got pre-war money scrap electronics uh bu -bu -bu -bu. yeah scrap electronics get rid of those I guess she doesn't really buy any oh, aid. There we go. She yeah, she she'll buy the ant eggs. Okay, and the ant meat. Uh, that's more than she has. Okay, we need to find something else we can purchase to kind of offset that. Fuck, uh, she's a super stim pack. Now we're paying her. No matter how we do it, it's just gonna be something else. Keep the bloat fly smoothie for now, but uh, absolutely positively look at anything else now we don't have to worry psycho we're gonna keep the pork and beans fuck it we'll just go do this we got good hunting animals. yep my goodness all right so we're gonna get the submachine gun would be nice to get it fully repaired i think uh because it does eight damage but it also does 73 dps versus eh, no we'll just sell the submachine gun fuck it uh no one in Megaton has money at this point. It's rather sad. Here's the water processing plant. Uh, hello, sir. Yeah, what is it? I've pit fixed up your pipes. Well, I'll be. The pressure's up in the plant. Mm -hmm. It looks like all the leaks have been fixed. Thank you, stranger. Thank you. Indeed. But listen, it's only a matter of time before they burst again. And someone like you might not be around to fix them. I'll make you a deal. I'll give you caps for any scrap metal Fuck. you can bring me. You'll find it all over the place out there in the waste. Okay. If I have a steady supply of scrap, 
I can keep the plant running and the pipe should be just fine. We got a deal? Yeah, yeah, sounds good to me. Good, this just keeps looking better. Those parts will keep this place running and the town in fresh water. Hurry back as soon as you find some. Yeah, yeah, I'll, hold on a second. Hey, hey. What do you need? Uh, yeah, I actually need to give you some scrap metal. I sure am, son. Yeah, I have, uh, f just take all the scrap metal I have. Um. Well, all right. Let me count out your caps. Yeah, five scrap metals it is. Cool. Well, back. Cool, we get EXP for that, too. That's good stuff. We get EXP for turning in the scrap metal. Uh, we should be fine. We should be a-okay. I'm wondering what else we would need to do then, because we get we got enough money to get what we need. We can probably go for the uh, Super Duper Mart now. Although we should take a nap inside the school before we go anywhere else. I've got enough bullets for this. Let's uh, let's actually look. Okay, so first of all, um, we should buy 556s from Mora, uh, Moira, Mora. We should repair the assault rifle and be ready to use it. I think. Like, we, we take the assault rifle, bam. You see, and then, um... The regular rifle, bam. So, yeah, we've, we, we've got, um... Got the... Yeah, the assault rifle looks good. It just doesn't have the ammo to really make, uh... Make up for that, I think. So, let's get Moira to repair our stuff. Then, um... I'll figure out what to do after that. So, hey, Moira... What's up? Anything interesting out there in the wild wasteland? Uh, not yet. I actually need to, uh, talk to you about repairing my stuff. Uh, let's see. Repair. You got caps for me? You got caps for me? Yes. Repair my armor. Repair my assault rifle. This is expensive stuff. Yep. The 32, absolutely. And I'm getting rid of the submachine gun. I'm selling that, so... Uh, oh well. Let's, uh, go ahead and, um, yeah, it's, it's what we got for sale. Absolutely. Very good, very good. Mm-hmm-hmm-hmm. Okay. Wow, 56. Oh boy. Mm hmm. Now, you, you can get jury rigging later. Yes. Just uh, not right now. We're, we're like level three. And uh, there's a lot we can't get at the moment. So let's see. She's got a lot more caps now. So I'll sell her the submachine gun just to get out of our inventory. And then, uh, more importantly, the hockey mask. And. Um, I guess that's it. Glowing mushrooms, sure. I'm not going to be crafting anything with them right now. Uh, mole rat steak. What? Damn it! I actually need the steak. Yeah, the steak is good. It's the uh, the other stuff I wanted to keep. Uh, purified water. Hold on to that. Mostly like dirty water. We have to be careful about. Yeah, I'd say we're good. We're good. Just uh, sell that. We're good. We're good. You can convince Moyer that writing the book is a bad idea. Yes, you can do that. Good hunting. But I'd rather go through the pain and suffering of all her qu uh, all her jobs. Take care. It's a big wasteland, but you know that better than me, right? Yes. So uh, here's the workbench where we can make like auto injected impacts, conversion to different cells, gecko hide belt, energy. Yeah. So you make a stim pack. You need a Brock flowers. I'm not sure we have those here. Super Steam Packs is Mute Fruit, Leather Belt, and a Nuka Cola and Steam Pack. So you can make Super Steam Packs pretty well. Uh, Super Steam Pack debuff kind of sucks, though. Weapon Repair Kits are... Yeah, I, I like how when you mouse over one of these, it goes... Okay, it just makes that weird noise. Like... Oh, it's, it stopped making the noise now. Weird. Uh, all right. And then there's the reloading bench, of course. No big deal. Yeah, we're done. We're done. We're getting out of here. We're, we're going to head over to the uh, uh, the school to sleep. And then we're going... Yeah, inject, injecting Nuka Cola. You bet. That's how it, you turn it super, you see. It was a normal stim pack, and then you made it super by injecting Nuka Cola into your veins. But yeah, it's absolutely true. You can convince Moira writing the uh, book is a bad idea. Drop. 
Mm -hmm. Try the brass lantern. All right. My goodness. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Hey, yep, you said 30% uh, discount crater side supply. Moira's uh, repair skill raises up. Yeah. That's pretty funny. But no, I think we'll go ahead and uh, go through her quest line for the EXP and the fun that we can have just doing it. Yep. We did it uh, one time, but it was never... It was never worth the amount of fun you can have just, you know, actually doing the adventures. Like the dungeon crawls that she sends you on. Yeah, okay. Let's go. We're in this blood dripping little uh, elementary school, little boy. Now, you'll notice there's a lot of meat chunks here. We can't really do anything about that, but we can sleep with the meat chunks. It's delightful. It's great, really. Sleep for 12 hours. Now we're not tired, but we are a little thirsty, so we're going to drink from the sink. Give us some rads. Minor dehydration sickness. There we go. We have a fair amount of rads, but it doesn't matter. Hey, Andrew. Thanks uh, for joining. I appreciate it. Okay. Food. We're going to need to eat something. Also, yeah, we're not tired and we're not uh, thirsty. We just, uh, we probably should have eaten before we drank. Doesn't matter. Uh, scroll on a stick. Maybe we got some cram to eat. Yeah, we got two cram. That should do it. We should be a-okay. Yep. No, f no food problems. Yep. We're, uh, we're in good condition. All right. Yep. Uses quantum expecting it to <laughs> uh, give better results, just dies from strontium in the bloodstream. I mean, that's more or less true. Uh, okay, so it's early morning right now. We're heading on out. We're going to be going to the Super Duper Mart. Uh, going to make sure we mark it on our map. Do Wasteland Survival Guide. There we go. We got to go find the Super Duper Mart, which is that way. Yeah, it's, it's some distance that way. My goodness. Well, uh, thank you for the $20, Andrew. Uh, that's that's awesome. <laughs> I, I tip my uh, metaphorical nerd fedora uh, to you. Holy crap. Okay. Stash outside of Megaton with some stuff. Um, I had no idea. Wait, wait. What's going on? Oh, that's an evil doge! It's vicious. Oh boy. No, 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 no. Aim for the head. Damn. Hostile doges. I had no idea. Okay. Yes. Oh, would that be too atheist to wear a fedora? My god. My god. All right. Did I ever get into... Fr I, I played a bit of Dust. Dust is actually well-crafted and has a point to it. Frost is kind of... Oh, Skeeter. Uh, thank you for the... Um, uh, the uh, What do you call it? The big help. Appreciate it. Wow. Yeah, more members is great. Like... Oh boy. Okay. Uh, what was I saying? Uh, yeah. So, um, b b back to the topic. Uh, frost. Frost felt kind of like hacky. I only I only did a little bit of it, uh, and it, it felt like it was kind of hacked together. Whereas dust really um really feels like a um uh dust dust feels like it was kind of built for purpose from the very beginning and oh another uh, another manual there but no i was gonna say that um you can actually find the courier in dust and it's like really fucking sad 
Yes. You can get yourself into no-win situations in Frost. Yeah. Got to get away. They're burning everything. What? What? Whoa, 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 whoa. Burning what? They're all dead. Burned Great Detroit to the ground. Those really? things, they came out of nowhere. You've got to run. Run. Okay. So Gray Ditch has been marked on our map as a location where there are things that are burning it to the ground. Good to know. Good to know. All right. You are not the courier in um, in dust. You are a stranger to this area, and it um, all kinds of shit went horribly wrong in dust. The idea that um, this nuclear cloud just came by and uh, and wiped everything out, drove people insane. Yeah, dust feels like a carefully constructed. Um, video game whereas uh frost feels again hacky by comparison okay that's my target we go rifle yep these wastelanders are fighting them Fire in the hall. Be careful. Oh god, the cars are gonna explode. Be careful, Wastelander. It's a damn shame. Morning. Yeah. Why are all these people out here? I don't even know. It's very strange. Okay. Mm-hmm. Why is who so big? Who 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 are we talking about? Mm-hmm. Wait, you don't know? Uh, our, our man Robert here? Yes. Good to see. I was gonna say, uh, uh, our character's name is uh, is Robert. I, I don't have any data about them other than, uh, let's see, good, good Samaritan. We've been stealing a lot of stuff, jeez. Uh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Uh, we are a hoarder, by the way. If we have less than 160 pounds of carry capacity, then we are, um, and then then we lose one to all of our stats. Okay, uh, ser seriously. Like if we if we need to have a lot of shit on us. Uh, yes, yes. It's it's great. We're a gun nut. Obviously, we're obsessed with firearms, and uh, we have intense tra uh, training for our strength. Um, Wild Wasteland. It's the most bizarre post-apocalyptic America. See you. Uh, hello there. Hey there. Thanks for not attacking us. Most people don't tolerate ghouls. Oh, well, you're dead meat. Give me all your stuff. No, no, no. What are you doing wandering around here? We were on our way to Underworld, but we couldn't make it past the super mutants. Right. So now we're just going to find our own place in the Wasteland. Right. What's Underworld? It's a city of ghouls. It's the only place in the wasteland that belongs to our kind. It's hidden inside the Museum of History. Mm -hmm. Very good, very good. Then, yes. Okay, let's have a look. Hey there. Nuka Colas. Morning. Morning indeed. Yeah, uh, we, we, we were a good Samaritan, all right. Mm hmm. Super duper mart time. This is a dungeon. We got uh, tons of banditos to fight. There's more Nuka Colas here. Chase. I mean, it's fine. Anytime we get hurt, we'll just drink some Nuka Cola. But we, we should be fine, really. See that guy right there? Okay, there are multiple banditos here. We're gonna get our assault rifle out. Introduce ourselves you know, the old I almost feel sorry for this poor bastard. It's go time. It is in fact go time. Excuse me, miss. Your head is gone. Oh jeez. Yeah. That was something. Oh, hello. Hold on. Pistol time. Your head is gone, sir. 
Very good. We got him. Yes. That's right. As long as we can purge all these raiders, we'll do good for ourselves. We'll do very well. We may need to grab some other stuff along the way, but we're fine. Yes. Mm, ba -ba. Use what now? You mean a uh, 32 rifle, assault rifle, 10 millimeter, and a baseball bat. Those are our current uh, setups, yes. I think I should change these out, but yeah. I use a magic trick to make their heads disappear. It's true. It's true. Mm -hmm. Nothing over here so far. Bring from the urinal. 18 rads. Yep. You never got around to the DLCs? Well, I'm not playing Fallout 3. I'm playing Tale of Two Wastelands. You should you should do that, too. Check out my mod list. Trust me. Um, this is way better than uh, playing regular Fallout 3. Yes. Okay. There he is. Mr. Raider Man! Fuck! Yes, you! Your head! It's gone. Awesome. Okay. Uh, what do we got? Ammo box, easy. I need more lockpicking skill for that. Yes. We're almost over encumbered at this point. What a shame. What a shame. Boy car. Steam gauge assembly. Jeez, that is way too much weight. Uh, average lock there. Easy terminal. Okay. Uh, easy terminal. Allowance replenished. Fuck. I'm trying to get duds removed. Remove all those duds. You bet. Yep. Remove more duds, please. Thanks. Uh, what else? Come on. Probably can't do this correctly. Who knows? There you go. Removed another dud. Uh, my goodness. Alright, I think we got whatever we're gonna get. Because, uh, let's just go with content. Two out of seven. Easiest? No. Hunting. Waiting. No. Nope. What a shame. What a shame. Uh... Yeah, well, it wasn't allowance replenishes I was looking for. It was uh, dud removal. Yes. Waiting. Okay, waiting has four... Um, so it should be ING. There should be something sealing... Yep. No, 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 no. Lockout imminent. Try again. Yep. What a shame. What a shame. Yep. My goodness. The last attempt will reset. Yes, well, I'm just saying service. Uh, serving. Special. What a shame. Sadly, it is faster, yes. I have no idea. It's fun to hunt for stuff, though. That intro sequence takes a little while, though. You see the halt restart stuff. Hmm. Headset. Okay, so I, I guess E is the uh, common word. I'm guessing. So it wouldn't be H. There, there's probably no H in it whatsoever. Uh, you can't gift subs? I've seen people gift subs. I think there's a mod to skip that intro. That intro only appears when... Oh, give me a sec. Someone's sending me a thing. All right. What was this nonsense? Okay. Mm -hmm.
Back to it. Yes. There's the mod to skip the hacking. If you have the skill. Yeah, yep, 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 yep. It definitely exists. Okay, so. Let's try killing. So, it's not ING. Yep, yep. Hmm. Yeah, it, n whatever it is, it's not ING. So, probably I. There's This probably has an I in it. Trinity. Nope. I don't know then. Allowance is replenished. Okay. Mm hmm. Offline? What do you mean offline? Oh boy. Hmm. My pattern recognition sucks. Uh, routing heavily. Nope. Offline. Okay. Offline three out of seven. So. Oh, Andrew, thank you for uh, gifting those memberships. That's awesome. Wow. Cool. Uh, let's see. Okay, so offline has three, um... Uh, three correct. So, hmm, probably. Yeah, it was machine. Disengage the lock. Level up. We did the thing. Okay, now the time for lock pick, I guess. I, I just think we have to spend, yeah, we, we gotta spend uh, enough in lockpick so we can hack uh, easy. We can uh, open up easy stuff. Yep, yep, it's not hacking, it's science, yeah. So, uh, what else? Uh, buh, 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 buh. Beachcraft, survival. We need repair, we need more repair skill. We need 50 repair skill in theory, it's kind of nuts. Um. I guess I should see what I want to put points toward next. Uh, science would... Yeah, you know what? I, I need survival to be able to... Um, not guns. Fuck it. Leftover points go into guns. <laughs> you know why? Leftover points go into guns because... Uh, guns. Shooty. Bang, bang. Survival. Yeah, so let's see here. Confirm Bachelor, Daddy's Boy, Gun Nut 2, Intense Train 2, Junk Rounds, Lady Killer, Rapid Reload, Retention, Swift Learner, Thief, Cannibal. Oh no, Cannibal. We could eat the baby. Mm-hmm. Yes, Guns Beat Rock, exactly. Child at Heart, Educated. Uh, unique Dialogue Choices, I don't think so. Comprehension, Edumacated. Uh, two more skill points every time you advance in the level. Edumacated would... No, no, we, we don't need edumacated. Because, uh... Yeah, yeah. If we did that, um... We'll cap out sooner. Oh, boy. Uh, does that mean your character is unedumacated? Yeah, yes, yes. We, we, we are not ed we are not edumacated. We did not learn me a book. Scoundrel perk uh, can influence vendors, get 10% uh, discount. I don't think so. I think we're going to go with intense training strength again to support our um, to support our uh, our way of life. Yes. Okay, we did intense training. Um, you max out skills no matter what. Yeah, exactly. So we did, we did intense training strength so that we can carry more junk. I'm not even joking. That, that, that is our, our current uh, thing. My goodness. Um, yep, let's do it. We can we can now uh, locky pick this. Yep. We got 10 millimeter rounds. Oh boy, let's just go in here. What else? We're back. Somebody open up the... Hang on. Something ain't right here. 
Something ain't right here. Yeah, we're gonna have enemies. A me mini nuke. Yes, mini nukes are glorious. Frag grenades, you bet. Is this an employee office ID? That'll let us get access to a different area. Mm -hmm. Automated maintenance, sure. Uh, let's see, what else? Yeah, so there'll be enemies back inside there. Is that, are those multiple quantums? Those are multiple quantums and radaways. Hell yeah. Never played TGW. Looks like Fallout 3. It's both. It's uh, Fallout 3 in the new Vegas engine. And it lets you... Uh, and when we finish Fallout 3, we'll be uh, getting shot in the head by Benny. And getting reset to level 1. And Benny will steal our stuff. And then we'll have to go get our stuff back from Benny. In addition to the platinum chip, like, he'll have all our junk. And so, uh, we'll have to uh, reclaim it. Yep. B Benny Steals Your Stuff is actually, like, a core mod. It's true. Alright. I'm just combining some of these. You bet. Okay. Okay. But, yeah. Okay, let's switch to the shotgun. I know we have a shotgun here. Yeah, you think you're a mess with the Raiders, he said? But how about a single shotgun? Let's do that. Yes. Oh, there are banditos. They're, 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 they're crawling over the top there. That's some crazy stuff. Uh, yeah, about that. Why don't I have a shotgun here? Hold on a second. My shotgun here. Yeah, there we go. Here we go. Uh, excuse me, you don't exist anymore. Yep. Fuck! Fuck. Fuck is right. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Can't wait till I get to New Vegas. Yeah, I've got got some stuff for New Vegas as well. So, assault rifle it is. Let's go. Fuck. Yep, we got it. You don't exist anymore. Six shot later. Yeah, I was expecting them not to be tanky bastards. I was. What kind of an idiot screws with the raider anyway? I don't know what kind of idiot screws with the raider. Yeah, like these guys were tanky, just tanky. Time to tear you apart. Oh uh, yes. Kick ass. Kick ass. She's not dead. Oh my God, I don't want to die. Too bad. All right. That's kind of amazing, regardless. Uh, yep. This is glorious. Take that jet. How close are we to being over encumbered? The answer is very close. Got it. Yep. There's the enemy up there. Let's use our rifle. Oh, jeez. Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Please, please lose your head. Yes, reload and... Oh, yes. Why'd you turn around? What? Damn it. He's running away. Why is he running away? I mean, I know exactly why he's running away, but still. <laughs> yep. Yeah, that, that's not great. Give me a sec. I'm out of here. Shoot him in the back. <laughs> oh, jeez. That is some armor. We got him. Critical strike. Damn right. 95% chance to miss. Please. Please. Don't kill me. Yes. Fallout war crimes. 
Oh, no doubt. No doubt. We, we are, uh... We've only just begun. Just for getting a decent amount of bottle caps and other things, for sure. Some ammo, cigarettes. We're gonna have to come back and sell... Or we're gonna have to go sell everything. And then come back, I think. No question about it. My goodness. I, I uh, prefer vats over the... Uh, well, for, for the one thing, there's no survival difficulty in this. So, like, you're thinking of Fallout 4. Uh, but, um... Yeah, as far as... Uh, as far as uh, vats goes, I prefer vats over the uh, the first-person shooter. I, I like I, I like watching the, little, the stupid little cinematic uh, um, cameras, uh, c c cinematic uh, g gameplay happen. It's funny. World map. Oh boy. Super duper mart. We need to get to mega. I like how all of these areas have been discovered, like uh, just just by me hearing about them. I've overheard uh, things about that. Anyway, uh, we need to get back to Megaton. No, I don't want to travel there. I just want to place a marker. H how, do, how do you freaking... Yeah, okay. If I right-click, I put set my marker. There we go. That's all I wanted to do. I just want to set my marker to Megaton. Cool. Yep. In any case, we go, we sell. No problem. Yep. And then we come back. It's not a problem. Okay, I don't know what that is. I mean, this, this is a water tower, but does it have anything around it? Like loot, whatnot. Use that. Oh, 5 HP, 9 rats? Why? Is it, I get that it's a water uh, source, but why? Just why? Come on. The mole rat. It's gonna die. Very good. Mole rat down. Let's keep going. But yeah, I mean, if it comes to like a first person shooter, like Unreal Tournament as, uh, uh, like Unreal Tournament 2004, shit like that. Those are those are my jams, first-person shooters. So, I I just like vatsing my way through a Fallout game for the most part, and occasionally dipping in to do some uh, FPS damage. But um, yeah, I these are first-person dungeon crawlers in the same way that like a Bethesda game is. There isn't a huge emphasis put on um, locational damage, you know. Uh, uh, there is, but not huge, you know. So, mostly lazy shit. Okay. Let's go. Yeah, I know, sad, but the problem is that's not advertiser friendly, lol. So, uh,. You know, we, we can't talk about that necessarily. Troll la 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 la. <laughs> no hard feelings or anything, but at the same time. Um. Yeah. Uh, yes, that's locked, and yes, I can see you eyeing it. Oh, really? I can see you eyeing it. You're gonna Let's steal go everything. Well here in his land. We can play a game where we shoot people's heads off, but mention one wrong thing, and it's uh, it's to the gulag with you. Yep. Very silly. I know. Uh, we're getting thirsty again. What a shame. That's the processing plant. Um. There we go. Hello. So, how's the scabbing been? Uh, not yet. Not yet. Uh, I haven't gotten around to it. I'm, I, I'm, I'm still there. It's just, uh... Yeah. Uh, sale. What do you... What do you need? She's got 400 caps. We're gonna sell her the uh, outfits of the raiders. Yeah. The crappy armors that they got. It's, uh, very silly. Arclight helmet, armor... 
uh, pain spike armor, so on and so forth. The, the DR on that is uh, not terrible. It's 16. But I'm going to stick uh, with leather for now. Uh, Brahmin skin outfit. Don't care about that. More importantly, let's go over to miscellaneous and see. I, camera, cigarettes. Whoops. I did not mean to. Yeah, I want to keep those casings. Okay. <laughs> uh, jeez. That mini nuke. Uh, I don't know if I'll ever be using a uh, one of those, but it's pretty funny. 10 millimeter pistol. Oh, yeah, I've got two 10 millimeter pistols. Got a lot of 10 millimeter rounds as well. But um, I can keep all my ammo. My ammo doesn't matter. Like, having more of that is objectively good. Like the bloat fly meat, stuff like that. So, very questionable. Brahmin steak, so on. Like, I'm just looking at all this stuff going, wow, there's so much junk. So, uh, combat knife, uh, machete, uh, what else? Chinese pistol. We're almost there. We're almost there. We're almost there. We went to the Super Duper Mart and we shot a lot of people. So, um, yeah, the cigarette packs are great for the, uh, the ratio. There's doge meat. No, okay, I think we're we're pretty much set. We just we should probably saw some Nuka Colas. Come to think of it, hadn't occurred to that. It hadn't occurred to me, but we should definitely sell some Nuka Colas. Uh, how much Nuka Cola we got? The answer is probably too much. Uh, boy, nu yeah, we got 31 Nuka Colas, so we should probably sell a few of those. That should do it. Yep, we're good. It's all her money. Don't hurt yourself. Very good. Windowless hotel. <laughs> Alrighty then. Hmm. Yeah, we're, we're doing pretty well. I just need to make sure there's nothing else we want to deal with. How's our condition? Hit stats. We're not tired yet, but we're thirsty. Okay, so we should go upstairs and drink some water. We'll get some radiation sickness there. And that's fine. Let's, let's go. We're, we're gonna... Yep, our dehydration level increased. I should have known. Um, there's the water fountain. Amazing. We no longer have radiation sickness. More importantly... Yep, we are... We're set. Food, we're not hungry yet. And we're not tired yet. We do have some radiation there. So, uh... We have 127 rads. At uh, 200, we'll get uh, a debuff. Not a major debuff, just like one uh, one stat down. Not a big deal. Okay, let's head on back over. We're going to check the map. And uh, that's the Super Duper Mart. Whoops. There we go. Move the marker over to the Super Duper Mart. Let's go. We're, uh, we're going. No delays. Not enough rads yet. There's a, actually a mission where you're supposed to just get, like, a whole ton of rads, and then she will uh, cure you of those rads. Very silly. Playable ghoul mod. Nice. Need some drugs? a brass lantern. A Who are you shooting at? Attack on hostile target. Oh. So Good enough. It's... Oh, okay. If I participated in that, I'd get, uh, what do you call it, uh, EXP, but I didn't see it in time. What can I say? All right. Slow pace and low levels. Yes, indeed. Okay. Yeah, I am enjoying it. That's the whole point of uh, this, and then... We'll have to go through New Vegas in low level as well, because uh, Benny shoots you in the head and resets your level, so. All right. We're good. Mm hmm Being overpowered is only fun at the end of an RPG? Yeah, I get that. I'm, I'm mildly overpowered now for, you know, where I am at, which is good. Because I'm, uh... But at the same time, you know, I have to kind of stop consider my situation and I, I guess we'll drink a um, a nuka really quick that's good and that'll heal us a smidgen yep 
Good, good, good. Hmm. Let's go. Meta powers. Yes, indeed. I mean, I can literally slow down time. <laughs> I can sprint. I can uh, aim magically. Yeah. The Vault Tech assisted aiming. You know, like Fallout 3 didn't have aim down sights. But here's name down sight. Yep. Okay. I mean, these are all tied to uh, all kinds of fun. Grab that muta fruits. Yeah, aimbot, exactly. Vault Tech assisted aim system. That's always been kind of fun, but they, they straight up Vault 76 turns it into an aimbot. No question about it. I wonder why those Wastelanders weren't harassed by the uh, myriad of banditos around here. Very strange. Grab the pre-war money from the registers. That's good stuff. Yep. We can sell the pre-war money later. Okay. Vats is fun. Yep. They said how sprinting is uh, listed between time bending powers and magical aim. Well, yes, because they're uh, the vanilla game never had sprinting, so that's uh, that uses the same resource action points as your uh, your uh, what do you call it your aimbot and your uh, time bending powers. Yep. Yep. Okay. What do we got here? A lot of drops. Huh. Light. Let me go check the back room one more time. Make sure I got everything. I don't want to have to come back here again. It'd be cool if there was a super duper mart full of stuff, but I mean, aside from this little refrigerator here, I'm not seeing much. I did find food in the Super Duper Mart, so I, I can get back to Moira about it if, you know, I wanted to. No, we gotta steal all his stuff. Oh, mags! Oh, shit, okay. I'm happy now. Tales of a Junk Town Wonder. Interesting. Let's quick save. Let's try using that and see what happens. So, Tales of a Junk Town Vendor. Uh, there it is. Permanent barter plus one. Amazing. Permanent barter plus one. So happy about that. I'm now over encumbered. What a shame. What a shame. Oh, well. We're going to nuke Moira's town? Haven't decided yet. Probably not. By the way, sensor modules are important. Uh, they're practically junk. How'd you like your payment? I'm thinking I kind of want to disarm the bomb, but at the same time, I don't have the things for it. Yes, we are definitely slow. Scrap metal. Yeah. Conductor there. Oh, boy. Mm-hmm. Uh, a contractor expected you to have time-bending powers? For $24 an hour. Yeah, well, even though you can't finish uh, a certain thing in time. Oh, there's this another sensor module. Yes. Well, that's not my problem if you can't fulfill the contract. That, that, that I'm just saying, that's how, uh, that's how most uh, contractors end up, uh, like, th that's how they basically justify it, is they just say, hey, it's not my fault if you can't uphold your end of the contract. Oh, you, you don't want to sign this unreasonable contract? Well, too bad. We'll go someone... We'll find someone else who will. All right. Psycho. Nuka-Cola. Uh, what else? Medical brace we don't need. I know the medical brace is used for a specific something, but... Surgical tubing. What's this? Jet. Jet's nice. That's all... That's a lot of liquid nitrogen here. Jeez. Okay. 
Uh huh. My goodness. Onwards. Yeah, if it weren't for things like the Actors Guild, actors would be uh, treated even worse than they are now. Of course, uh, we're reaching a point where we can AI generate uh, actors' performances, so, you know, actors are going to have to fight for their rights um, pretty soon. Or they're just going to be like, hey, we can do one performance and then we're going to AI generate a billion other performances. Uh, excuse me, that's a terrible idea. Okay. I like how we're massively over-encumbered and it doesn't matter. Yes. Replacing people with robots. Yes. Although, there's going to be a reckoning. Uh, where these different AIs are going to have to... Oh, we got the pharmacy key. Awesome. Uh, these different AI... Um, um, what do you call them? Uh, outlets are going to have to start proving that they have the intellectual property rights to all of the uh, all of the things that all of the input to that um, and that, that that's where things are going to kind of fall over and go boom right is uh, like the, these a, these different uh, AI um yeah, the training data itself, they're going to have to prove that they have um, the intellectual property to all the training data. And that that's where, well, once this gets litigated, it's all going to fall down like a house of cards. Because uh, while we can argue that the generated results could be produced by a human, they weren't. Um, it's going to be uh, very special. My goodness. Countries are one by one going to start uh, cracking down on them. Yep. It's going to be hilarious for shit posters online. Well, shit posters, it doesn't matter, right? And take all that food. But, um, because shit posters don't derive income from it. So, your infringements are most likely, and I say most likely, going to be ignored. That's, um, eh, like, but infringements that are profit producing, people are going to want a piece of that. Yes. Yep. Energy cell, stealth boys, yes. You think they'll replace real actors anytime soon? Yes, of course. I'm just saying, it's we're hitting a point where they're going to want to. Where that AI Mark Hamill that you saw in um, in The Mandalorian is going to become the standard for a while. It's going to look like crap. Never said it was going to be good. They said about art. Well, I mean, art has been around for ages, but uh, AI is not going away. Neither is plastic. Um... However, there are issues that are going to have to be resolved. And those are not going to make people happy. Alright. Let's see here. Yep. The war and fallout? I don't know. Let me see. Do, 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 do. Really bad CGI actors in Flash, yes. And people will bash it, but as long as it makes money, they won't give a shit, right? That's really what it comes down to. All right. Mm -hmm. I'm just gonna combine these armor pieces and sell like one really good armor piece. Otherwise, we're kind of stuck. Massively over encumbered forever. Yep. Combat helmet. I don't know what we're gonna do, because, yeah, two laser pistols. Not great. Cleaver, brass knuckles. Yep. Damn. Damn is all I gotta say. Alright, let's, let's go. Uh, single use plastics were banned. 
that every single soft drink uh, is kept in plastic bottles. That's funny. But I mean, um, it dies in the su uh, starvation, the super duper mark, Ken tearing a huge Santa sack of stuff. You don't understand, everybody. I'm going to show you one of my character's traits, okay? I want you to read this on screen. This is this is one of my character's traits, okay? It is intrinsic to who he is, okay? I want, want you to understand that. <laughs> there we go. All right? Now then, uh, let me see here. Uh, do, do, do. Optimal inventory, yeah. Exactly. <laughs> oh, boy. Now, I'm actually uh, pouring drink. That's what I'm doing right now. Oh, boy. Uh -huh. mm. Okay, so. What we need to do at the moment is, yeah, unfortunately, the sledgehammer will have to go. But that's only 12 pounds. That's sad. Yep, we're still kind of over. Ah, uh, jeez. Too much, too much. I guess the answer is, um, if we look at the weight, it's this. Yeah, this helmet's three. Got five more to go. Oh, this armor sucks. Okay, that's fine. Yep. Yep. It's only 12 pounds, exactly. It's only 12 pounds. That's so sad. Because the armor's 15. That's why I'm saying. Like, the armor's 15 pounds. Versus that. Let's see, this one's light armor. Uh, this leather armor's also light. So, 16 DR, 4 DT. 5 DT, 24... Yeah, the, the leather armor's just better. Just better. Uh, it said the junk cannon will work with the hoarder perk. You bet. You bet. What a waste of a perfectly good sledgehammer. I, I want to sell it and get the caps. You don't understand. I want to sell everything. Everything in the wasteland that isn't a junk item. I want to sell. Vendor it all. Vendor all of it. Yes, it's too it's too slow for combat. Eh, that's true. Unless you're using vats, in which case it's busted. Vat, yes. The merchants are forced to buy useless shit. That's the idea. We're, we're you see, we're preparing for, to go into a war zone. If you don't know, we're we were told that uh, GNR is where um, our father went, and uh, like we uh, that this is this whole area is a war zone, meaning we're not prepared. We need armor, we need weapons, we need Please good stuff. Help me. Please. I jumped on this guy's head like Mario. Okay. Okay. Loosen the sledge so the the end fall, flies off. That's glorious. Yes, I love that. Oh, he is coming with the clouds, and every eye shall be blind with his glory. Every yes. Mm-hmm. You betcha. He shall be blind. I need armor and weapons. I need better armor and weapons. Yes. Mario style. Moriarty's saloon. Hmm. <clears throat> I like how I got EXP for that, and simultaneously it was, uh... Yep. Come on. Excuse me. What's it to be? A few caps to find out where your father went? Uh, the wasteland can be such an unforgiving place. Sorry about that. What's all this about Galaxy News Radio? 
Galaxy News Radio is some loudmouth radio station located in the ruins of D.C. Mm -hmm. Three Dog, the king of that loony bin, keeps yapping about fighting some good fight or something. A bunch of crap. But I suppose if you wanted to know what was going on in the wasteland, that's the place to go. Me, I could care less. That's what I thought. Uh, I'd like to buy a drink. Tell it to Gob. Damn. Looking for a drink? You've come to the right place. Hey, Gob. Hey, smooth skin. Do you need something? A drink, maybe? Anything? Anything at all? Uh, yeah. What the fuck are you? Let me think about it for a moment, my good man. Wait. You're not gonna hit me? Yell at me? Not even berate me a little bit? Are you kidding? Uh, shut the hell up, ghoul. Or I'll be... Uh Oh my god. Like, th this is some special dialogue written by some special people at Bethesda. Wow. <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, this is, uh, hadn't planned on it, honestly. Well, now, that's a surprise. I'm used to every asshole smooth skin in this town giving me shit just because I look like a corpse. I'm glad to see that there are a few worthwhile people around here. Listen, Moriarty'd have my head if he caught me selling at a discount. But for you, I'll risk it. Cool. We gained karma. Now we get uh, a new drink. Sure uh, thing. Okay. Well, by a drink, I mean I need all your stim packs. And then I will sell you the trash I picked up in the... Uh, in the lovely location. I'm not doing laser pistol. It can't, it can't, it's not going to work out for me. Not this one anyway. Maybe in the future. Maybe in the future we use uh, some energy weapons. But in the meantime, say this raider armor. Damn right. That's, that's what I wanted. That, that, that's what I actually came back to the, uh, to that place for. So that's, that's awesome. Okay. In the meantime, we got a lot of dirty water. Like that's, that's 20 pounds. So let's, let's go ahead and sell five of it. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, what else? 52. There's still too many Nuka Colas. Let's go with a few of those. And then miscellaneous, of course. We got like cigarettes, cameras, carton. Jeez, okay, the carton of cigarettes was too much. Let's grab the Super Stim Pack. And cigarette, coffee mug, conductor, dog hide, duct tape. We're almost there. Fusion battery I can't uh, sell right now, but uh, that's six pounds, so we should definitely get rid of it as soon as possible. Uh, yep, that's fine. That should liquor you up for a while. That should. Those stim packs should liquor me up for a while. Thank you. Come back soon. Good, good, huh? good. I I'm so glad that those, uh, those stim packs can uh, liquor me up for a while. You bet. Okay, how are we doing anyway? Are we hungry, thirsty, tired? What, what are we? Let's see. We're thirsty. And we're starting to get a little hungry. So what we're going to do is we're going to steal the squirrel on a stick. Uh, yep. And now we'll go ahead and head on out. Miss West. Evening. Good to see you. Colin, listen. What is it now, Nova dear? It's the tips, Colin. Your customers are actually getting cheaper, if that's even possible. Is a girl supposed to just lie down and take that? I remember a time when you screwed more and complained less, Nova dear. Ah, but for the good old days. Thanks a lot, Colin. I can always count on you for sympathy and respect. Ah, oh, no one loves you more, sweet lass. And don't you ever think any differently. Now quit yammering and get back to doing what you do, hmm? Wow. Looking for a drink? Come to oh, that's a lovely place. Just a lovely place. Okay, that's Crater Side Supply. We need to go down there, but it's locked right now. Uh, yeah, Crater Side Supply is closed. Let's head on up and turn in our uh, scrap metal, assuming the old man's awake. Water processing plant's always up. Uh, huh? Yeah, what is it? I got some scrap metal for ya. I got five to sell. We can always use them. Absolutely. I know you can always use them, but yeah, we're, we're good. Let's go. Bobby Kotick runs a saloon. Uh, jeez. 
That, that, that's comedy you said right there, but um, I, I think that uh, obviously it's, it's satire. Don't sue. Thanks. You're looking for the mayor or the oh, sheriff. sheriff? Yeah. I definitely um, am. I, I'm not boycotting Blizzard goods <laughs> um, for any particular like I, I'm, I'm not boycotting Blizzard goods because of um, for any moral reasons, right? Like I, I if if the games were like if I want if I was interested in the like Blizzard's universes or characters anymore, which I'm not, I would have picked up Diablo 4. However, it feels good to know that I'm not contributing to Bobby's next yacht, right? Like, it, it, it's kind of like bonus points in that sense. Because because I'm no longer interested in Blizzard's, you know, universes or characters or anything like that. You know, like, I, I, I know that um, I'm not... At, at the same time, I'm not contributing to Bobby Kotick's next yacht. So... It's, it's, it's double dipping there. Ah, welcome, weary traveler. You look like a traveler in need of relaxation and the finest of chemical assistance. Oh. Well, wander no more, my good friend, for I am Doc Hoff, procurer of the finest of medical goods and chemical assistance. Now, how may I help you? Doc Hoff, let's talk. Let's see what the good doctor has in his magic bag, <laughs> shall we? Okay. We're going to go look in the doctor's magic bag. Uh, let's see here. No, there's a lot of Diablo likes I, I really enjoy. I'm, I'm in the middle of Record Lotus where I'm going to be playing, um, what is that other game? Uh, going to be playing Path of Exile in the next big uh, league reset for sure. Uh, definitely, definitely. Okay, yeah, this guy has a lot, and I mean a lot. Today's physician. Huh. Let's see what else. He, he has doctor's bags, I assume. Nuka cocktail schematics. Interesting. Uh, refined fruit. I don't see a whole lot of anything. I'm gonna grab his medex because that's worth it. It's damage reduction food. Grab those cases because I can. I'm gonna grab some buff out because that's helpful. And I guess that's it. I mean, he has stim packs, but I don't have to worry about those really. If I wanted all his stim packs, let's see see what it would cost me in terms of um, like yeah. Get some grenades out of here. What else? Looking at all the miscellaneous trash that I have. Yeah, dog dog flesh. More importantly, uh, the f yeah, fusion battery. Not going to do that. Packs of cigarettes. Keep the sensor modules because the Brotherhood of Steel Outcasts want it. Uh, the pre-war money should handle it. Yeah, that's cool. The pre-war money handled pretty much everything. So we are we are making money and getting chemical assistance. You bet. Thanks. There we go. Time about to trade caravan. I provide food, drinks, and discreet chemicals to discerning customers around the wasteland. I help ease the suffering of my fellow man. Mm -hmm. For a price. I don't have a home office exactly, but I organize much of my trade with Ernest Rowe in Canterbury Commons. Got it. So, yeah, Canterbury Commons, cool. Can you repair? Let's take a look and see. Yeah, so, like, the assault rifle and the leather armor. Get those repaired. Hell yeah. Um, I guess a single shotgun we should probably do as well. Most of our money... Oh, jeez, my combat helmet's almost broken. Fuck this. So, this, yeah, this is where all my money's going. It's going to getting certain things repaired, which is great. I'm glad. Just, uh, yeah, maintenance is important. See you next very good. <laughs> Not, nothing uh, eases one suffering like a buff out coma. I mean, buff outs uh, a okay, but I was thinking of something a little more uh, in intense, like psycho. Oh boy, what is it? Psycho buff? That uh, thing from the other one? Gray ditch is down there. There's, there's. We were told that there was crazy stuff going down in Gray Ditch. I think it might be worth checking out. We're going to Springvale, uh, Springvale School and going to sleep real quick. 
Jury Rigger is absolutely a game changer, but I don't know if I'll ever get to that uh, point on this character. I don't know exactly what direction we're going to go as far as uh, our level loops, but uh, we'll see. We'll see. Psycho Jet. Well, Psycho Buff was great because you just tank all the hits. We no longer have Radiation Sickness. Very good, very good. My goodness. Is what cool? Uh, of course it is. Hail to Wastelands is great. Now, hold on a second. Let me uh, really quick get something set up here. Oh, uh, food. We need to eat something. We're going to eat a mole rat steak. You bet. I'm going to go take a nap. We're good. Mole rat steak is worn out. That doesn't matter. It's the healing effect. Don't try to drink from a fire hydrant. Yes. Obviously. It's a lot of mods, though. All right. Eight hours should do it, and then we should be able to travel. 6 a.m. now. 6 a.m., bright and early. We're going to head on over to the uh, next area. Let's go ahead and have a look. Data. And our goal is Grey Ditch. We were told that Grey Ditch is being uh, attacked or something. And we should be able to go check out the amazing location down there. It's in that direction. I'm gonna say the Super Duper Mark. I guess we didn't turn in the Super Duper Mark quest. Fuck, okay, L let's do this. Let's go over to Megaton, turn in the Super Duper Mark quest, and then head over. I think that's good. Every everywhere in DC is a gray hole. Yes, absolutely, absolutely. We don't have a running bot right now, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, my goodness. Okay, jump, jump, and jump. Okay, so we go back. We talk to Moira. Then we head on over there. We're kind of going in the general direction a little, kind of, sort of. Not really. We're paralleling it. Oh, well. Doesn't matter. Let's get going. Good to see you. Yes. We're heading on in. Absolutely. Now, Moira's crater side supply is still closed, but we can wait an hour. And get in, I assume. And a quick save just in case. Wait an hour. Wait an hour. There we go. Billy says not to talk to you. I probably shouldn't be talking to you. Billy says I get too friendly with people I don't know. She says it's dangerous. Okay, that what do you think of Megaton though? It's okay, I guess. I used to live way far away when I was little, before Billy found me. Right, right, right. Uh goodbye. Bye, mister. Billy says I shouldn't talk to you. Talks to me anyway. So, how's the scabbing been? Got the food medicine from that super duper mart? Oh, yes, I did. It wasn't easy, but I got your food and medicine. Really? You did? You did? Well, all right. Tell me all about it. Uh, yes. Uh, okay, the raiders were using the pharmacy to store, uh, as a place to store their best gear. Yep, yep. So you're saying that they acquired a well-protected stash? Hmm. I wonder how many other places are hiding treasures behind monsters. Hmm. Well, keep what you got. Just traded for a big food shipment myself. Here, take a bit. My treat. Tastes kind of great after a while. Tastes great. Oh, and take this. It's an old food sanitizer. Just carry it with you, and it should automatically make most food and drink more... Uh, Better. <laughs> Better. Food sanitizer. Let's continue with research. I still need to study a living specimen with radiation poisoning. I need someone to research how to travel through a minefield. And that'll cover the first section of the book. I'd like this radiation. Well, that's what I need your help for, isn't it? I know lots about it from books, but I never seem to get a live example. Not for long, anyway. So I need you to get a bit of radiation poisoning 
so I can study its effects. Oh, not a deadly dose, of course. I can fix you up before that. Mm -hmm. It's fine. It's fine. Okay, just get irradiated. Um... Oh, you're a peach. Or at least some sort of hardy fruit that grows in the savagely irradiated mockery of agriculture we have nowadays. Now, 200 rads should be enough for basic sickness. But if you can get 600 or more rads, my test will be even more accurate. Just make sure you can get back here, and I'll see to it that you're well taken care of. Okay. I, I like how she talks as if she had lived through a period where it wasn't, um, it wasn't, you know, a horrible radioactive hellhole. She, she acts as if, uh, it was completely normal. Yeah. Don't worry about it. Okay. Try not to die. Try not Dumb. to die. <clears throat> Let's go. We're gonna go drink some water. Check this shit out. My dehydration levels increased. I must sate my appetite on this amazing bomb water. Bomb water is the best. Indeed. Indeed. Yes. Bomb water. Very tasty. It's okay, really. So I have critical radiation poisoning. Okay, it's no big deal. Look, look, everything's fine. Okay, the radiation meter's blinking red. There's, there's definitely nothing wrong with that. Let's go have a look at our status, our radiation. And maybe we have minus two strength, minus three endurance, minus two agility. That that's not too bad. Oh boy, we we sl uh, slather that up. Who are we here? Could it be a new addition to our humble little community? Dear child, welcome, welcome to Megaton. I am Confessor Cromwell, prophet of Atom and father of the Undying Glow. Please, child, come to the church anytime, anytime at all. I see, I see. Have you traveled outside of Megaton by chance? In my youth, I traveled quite a bit, but that was a different life. I assume that you are seeking information and advice, yes? The only advice that I can offer is this. You will find no wealth in the wasteland greater than that which you will find within yourself. Bask in Atom's glow, and you will understand. I see, I see. Let's go. I wish you well on your path. Hey, how's it going? Let's get out of here. We need to go talk to Moira and have her cure us of our uh, undying glow. We're, we're suffering, you know? Suffering. Okay. Oh, feeling a bit under the weather? Or a bit over the Geiger counter? <laughs> yeah, I'm about as radiant as I can get without burning a hole through the floor. I can tell. You're positively glowing. Now, just hold on and try not to move. Tell me how it feels, and I'll get you fixed right up. Mm -hmm. uh, I feel fine. Never felt better. No problem at all. Uh, yep. Oh, you poor dear. Putting on a brave face like that. Well, don't worry. It'll all be better. And it's for a good cause. Now, let me take a few notes, and I'll handle that nasty radiation with a bit of my own homemade rad cure concoction. I've never had a chance to test it out on someone so heavily dosed. Oh, but, but I'm sure it'll work out fine. Exciting, isn't it? It'll be great. Okay, a little Brahmin milk, a couple magnets, and maybe a few happy thoughts. Well, you're alive. Oh, that's the good news. But there was a little side effect. A teeny tiny, um, mutation. Uh, but it seems to be benign, at least. 
No. Here, take a few radiation chems. As my little way of saying, I'm sorry I twisted your DNA like a kitten with a ball of yarn. I see. Moira's experiment had an unexpected side effect. You now, When you suffer from advanced radiation poisoning, crippled limbs will automatically regenerate. By the way, storyline perks like this will not be reset when Benny shoots us in the head and resets us to level one. Um, perks like this will stay for the rest of the game. So, uh, let's uh, finish up that landmine research. Landmines are one of the few dangers out there that you can profit from. Disarm one before it blows, and you can sell it for plenty of caps. I've heard stories about a ghost town that's just full of mines. Traders just call the place Minefield. Mm -hmm. Sounds like the place for some field work. Get in there, get back, and tell me all about it. And could you bring back a mine for my studies? Uh, sure, I'll head into uh, Minefield. Oh, don't worry. No one ever goes there because they say it's a ghost town. And since ghosts don't exist, you can just focus on the landmines. I hear there's a playground in the middle of town. Reach that point and come back, and I'm sure you'll have some stories to tell. Landmine is run by a crazy man who puts down landmines to keep people out of his town and snipes at them from on top his tower. Yes. Uh, won't you be stumping enemies in New Vegas? Depends. Uh, like, you don't keep all your perks. You keep your storyline perks. There's a difference. See ya. Say ya. Oh boy. You don't get your you don't keep your level up perks. You you get reset to level one. And that includes all your level up perks, but your storyline perks, the ones you get from like You want something? Uh like regenerate my limbs when I'm advanced radiation poisoning and shit. Those stick around. So if I get like the vampire perk where I can uh, derive sustenance from blood packs, for example. That, uh, that perk will stay. There's all kinds of amazing perks. That, uh, so the good, the fun stuff. Yeah. But, uh, like, functionally I will be back to level one. When New Vegas starts. Is that rocks? Why there are rocks here? I have no idea. There's a mole rat. Yeah, shoot. Aim for the head, make it dead. Wait, no, 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 the body. Aim for the body, aim for the torso. Yep. Bam, There's yep. a bomb strapped to me. You've got to disarm it, quick. Wait, what? There's a bomb strapped to me. You've got to disarm it quick. I, I don't... What the hell was that? <laughs> I have no <laughs> radiant bomb, yes. Damn. That was scary. Okay. Damn. What the hell? There's a bomb strapped to me. You've got, oh geez, I got crippled limbs and everything. I'm gonna die. Drink a couple Nuka Colas. Grab a Psycho. Grab a buff out. And then, um, got a Psycho, a buff out, and we need a doctor's bag. We're set, okay. Oh, jeez. Already crippled. What the hell is that? It's like a grenade launcher or some shit. Yeah, that's frightening. That grenade launcher thing that's going on. Yeah. Goodbye, sir. Oh, jeez. So Terrifying. Who the hell got me, anyway? Uh, yeah, it was a grenade rifle. It was definitely a grenade rifle that got me hard. That was painful. Yeah, I'm, I'm definitely uh, having fun here. Yep. Yep, yep. 
the the raiders uh, strapped a bomb to him uh, and then used him as a suicide ambush I gotta go back oh, okay we're set we're, we're gonna we gotta delay our trip let's put it like this I was hoping to make our trip today but this whole suicide bomber thing is gonna cause us some issues so uh, the hell there's more mole rats why why are there more mole rats I don't understand got him I don't even know how I hit that the the first one that was very strange but yeah I got a grenade rifle for what good that is I'm not gonna keep it because I don't use explosives but uh Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, we should be fine. Yep. Yeah. No idea. Yeah, this hair is literally titled in the data files Sephiroth. I'm not even joking. I can't sprint with my legs being crippled. I need to get in. Go, go, go. Come on, someone. Come on, someone, please help me. Yeah, I need to... I need to get my limbs cured. If, if nothing else, I need to... Uh, uh, geez. Uh, my radiation sickness has been cured, but I need to... Hey, I'm hurt, Doc. I'm hurt. Help me out. Help me out, Doctor. For Christ's sake, you don't look sick, and you sure as hell don't look dead. So why are you bothering me? My legs are broken. I'm hurt. I'm surprised you made it in here. I can fix you up, but it'll run you 100 caps. You don't look what sick. You, you don't look dead. Uh, like, I'm surprised you made it in here. Uh, wh which is it? Which is it? All right. Hold still. He's gonna... I swear you people never learn. Yep. What do you think is out there in that wasteland anyway? Yep. All right, that should do it. That's all I need. All right, then. Oh, hold on a second. Uh, I'm going to sell you that grenade rifle, actually. You'd best have cancer, because from the looks of you, you're breaking rule number one. Uh, yeah, medical. Not quite as good as that vault stuff you're used to, but it'll do you. Got it. Okay. We do not need this 30. Actually, I'm going to repair using that pistol, so it's fine. But, uh, baseball bat. Yeah, I'm going to sell the bottle cap mines. I, I never use mines anyway. And then I'll grab a purified water because I'll need that later. He's got a lot of stim packs, just in general. Like, I'm super happy about that. Uh, brass knuckles. What else? Yeah, that grenade rifle is... I, there's no way I'm going to be able to use those, so fuck it. Uh, can't can't sell him the grenade rifle. I'll sell it to someone else. Moira, probably. Yeah. You done? Good. Yep. Mines are fun to set up. I just don't do it. We're all breathing, so I know you didn't screw up. You got something on your mind. We're all still breathing, so I know you didn't screw it up. A 25 explosive skill. So it looks like I have to get 25 explosive skill to get my player home here. What a shame. Hmm. How are we doing in how What is our explosive skill even at? Probably way too low. Uh, explosives is 14. Jeez. I'd have to spend 16... Sorry, 11... Yeah, 11 points to be able to do it. But you know what? I think, I think one level's worth of uh, points is worth getting a home. A player home. I think I think we're gonna do it. I think we're just gonna put those points in explosives uh, on our next level and get ourselves a house. So, hmm, what else? Yeah, we're we're just gonna next level is just gonna get us the player home. In the meantime, however, let's go create a shred supply. We're gonna go talk to Moira. Moira, how are those hot little potatoes? Because, you know, they're on the ground, like potatoes, and hot because they, um, explode. 
Anyway, what's up? Uh, yes. Um, I haven't been to minefield long. Hold on. It yeah. In the meantime, sell. I need to... Uh, yeah, you've got 301 caps. Like, I can obviously sell you the grenade rifle. No problem. Sell you the frag mines. No problem. And the raider armors, because, you know, the raider armors. That should do it. All things considered, sell you beer. Anything else? I know we have, like, vodka, whiskey. I'm going to hold on to... I'm going to get, like, rid of a few of these. I'm going to keep a couple on me just in case, but... Uh, Otherwise, I need the money. Don't hurt yourself. Thank you. Let me see. Hold on. I've got messages I need to read. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. I, we're, we're discussing uh, dinner plans. So that, that's what's actually happening. You got my eye, you got your eye on me, serious business. I like how we were overwhelmingly considered a good person despite having stolen a lot. We're a kleptomaniac hoarder, so. Uh, looks like I got about another hour I can play, so that's good. Um, let's, let's go out, let's go to Grey Ditch, go check out that place. And then, um, assuming there's nothing painful, uh, you're looking for it. You said KFC. <laughs> uh, more like uh, most likely going to uh, uh, some uh, family member's house, and yeah, G gonna gonna have dinner, uh, and, uh, you know, social dinner as opposed to cas casual at home dinner. Yes. When I say dinner plans, I actually mean plans. Yes. No, wait. What's happening? Fuck! Doge! I know, hashtag not a real gamer. Right. I like how we immediately took huge amounts of damage from that doge. We should probably put on our helmet for now. Because we don't know what's in Grey Ditch. Yep. That's a hostile robot. That's a hostile robot. Okay. We're safe here. In this spot. Alright. Hmm. Not, yeah, Danny Boy apples and some water. Well, maybe a Nuka Cola as well. Yeah, we're good. We eat a lot. We just have a whole meal here. Heal up. It's not, it's not enough to heal up fully, but... Uh, uh, do, do, do. How are you not overpowered by the time you hit New Vegas? So, what happens is Benny shoots you in the head, and you get reduced back to level one. Then Benny steals your stuff. You'll get to keep your storyline perks. The ones you got as a part of, like, quests and stuff. But uh, you don't get to keep anything else. And you have to earn your gear back by uh, confronting Benny. Here we go! It's the combat it inhibitor on its back. Located. We, yeah. Attack. We have to shoot the combat inhibitor on his back. That's his weakness. His head is not his weakness. Law abiding citizens. Please leave the area. Yeah. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Excuse me. Combat inhibitor. Come on. He's been frenzied. He's been frenzied. Use of deadly force. The loss of deadly force. Yes. I get that. <laughs> we got him. Scrap electronics. That's right. We're going into Grey Ditch to see what's in here. We've been told that Grey Ditch has all kinds of stuff. Cooper's Hotel? Oh. Huh. I don't know what Cooper's Hotel's about, but we're gonna go pay a visit. 
It looks like a crazy place. Save the game. Oh no. I'm gonna kick your ass. Raiders? What are raiders doing here? Time to tear you apart. I'm sure that's true. Okay, we're going with the assault rifle. Yeah, yeah, we're going with the assault rifle. Hiding from me? Better hope I don't find you. They're everywhere. Get back, you monkeys. I got first call on the goods. Hold on. Uh, bottle caps and Nuka Cola inside the vending machine. Just like a little bitch. When you turn up, you're dead. I'm sure that's true, but let's. Yeah, there's a lot of stuff here. Just like a little. Holy crap! This is bullshit. Come out and fight. I'm sure that's true. That it's bullshit, but I just got Scared, like three huh? more mags. I almost feel sorry for this poor bastard. Almost. <laughs> Scrap metal is good. This is bullshit. They Come never shut fight. up, do they? Holy when crap! Yeah, they never shut up. That's some pre-war money? Hold on. Get that shot glass out of the way. Pre-war money, hell yeah. Some empty bottles I don't care about. Very easy lock. What do we got? Nothing. Nothing was in the foot locker. Only a fucking cow would hide. They're cup there. Oh, hello. Goodbye, sir. Go, go, go. I'm going to eat your heart. heart. She, she said heart. Okay. There's a lot of stuff here. We're going to be making tons of money going back to uh, Megaton, I think. We're over encumbered, sure, but we're gonna go ahead and just process this together. Wait, I, I need the pain spike armor. Pa pain spike. Where, where's the good stuff? The, the, this is the one, the sadist armor. Cool. Repair that shit. Uh, drop the pre war. Damn it, the pre war casual wear. You don't need that. Uh, keep the sadist armor. Drop the helmet. Okay. Um, yeah, I don't need the 32 pistol. We can drop that as well. We're fine. Okay. Yeah. Hearing those damn Aww. voices again. Got those cases. Only a fucking coward hides. I'm gonna repair my single shotgun with this single shotgun. Amazing. Time to tear you apart. Okay, cut the shit. It is go Who time. Is oh shit. There, oh, okay, okay. Ch change your plan. Change your plan. Change your plans. Who's out there? Goodbye. She's so happy. Yep, she's so happy. Hide from me. Better hope I don't find you. Close that door. They they always seem to come come running to open the door. I promise a quick death. This hotel's this is interesting. Come out and fight. When oh, you turn up, a Mesmatron power cell? Huh. Oh. That's an interesting item to find here. Queen size bed looks nice. I'd love to be able to use that once the bandits are dead. Damn noises again. I'm sure when I turn up something. Oh, that's another single shotgun. Cool. Let's repair. Our single shotgun is almost completely repaired now. Yes. Steam summer sale. Nice. Uh, it's not just the two games in one. It's uh, it's a lot of changes. Go. Yep. Kick ass. Mistake. Yep. Last mistake. Oh damn! Look at you, sir. Look at you. Yeah, yeah. Th this hurts a lot. 
I, I, I shouldn't be taking this much damage, but here I am, almost dead. Okay, good news, I'm still alive. Let's uh, immediately drink a Nuka-Cola and then have uh, some Iguana Bits and use a Stim Pack. Jeez, use a Stim Pack, you bet. Please repair, repair. Okay, cut the shit. Who okay. is that? You should be fine. Okay. Who's out there? There's a lot of banditos here. Look, I do want these. Who's out there? Fuck. They are they are definitely watching. There you are. Kick ass. I shot her in the face. Got her. She down? Where's the other one? The other one's confused. Her head is crippled. Damn. That hurt a bit. Got her. I know that it's bullshit, but it's still funny. All right, let's do this. Let's grab all the raider armors. Yeah, all the raider armors. I know we're over encumbered, but we're gonna fix this. We're gonna we're gonna combine the raider armors. Specifically, like that. Good. This is bullshit. Come out. Fight. Yes, it is. It is definitely bullshit. I agree. Okay, I need that pain spike armor, and then I just combine the two like that. Cool. So now there's two almost fully repaired, fully valued Shit. items. Just like a little bitch. And we're gonna sell those. Damn. Fuck, 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 fuck. The DLCs don't start automatically. We we're only like six hours into the playthrough. And uh, we'll be doing the main game first before we do any DLCs. Yes. I like how that guy ducked after his head got crippled. Fuck. Yeah, yes, I, I want I want a lot. I don't oh and I'm dead. I wasn't paying attention. First death. First death, everybody. What a shame. Yep, that was first death. Okay. Yeah, the only quest that started was Mothership Zeta, and we're gonna purposefully ignore that. But I mean, um, we actually turned off all of the uh, Caravaneer, like New Vegas DLCs. Uh, we purposefully, uh, a lot of those items get distributed across the world. That guy's beefy, jeez. No wonder he killed me in like two hits. What the hell? That guy's like, that guy's crazy yeah stim pack and a purified water chase yeah that guy's beefy my head is still crippled what's what's the head cripple status effect let's find out uh, concussion personality minus four Mm hmm Right. Wow, that sounds lovely. Okay. Yeah, I was wondering if it uh it, it mi minus four personality is what it what the status effect is. No need to hide. It'll Here we go. This guy's fully armored. Little, huh? I'm, I'm on the verge of death. Super stim pack, go. Oh, jeez. He had metal armor. He, he had heavy armor. That's great. 
What's oh god, the uh the damage threshold on that is nine. Perception, not personality, yeah, perception. Yeah, yeah. I, I got the heavy armor though. Okay. Oh wow. Okay. That's great though. We we got him. Yeah, we're we're kind of screwed though. That guy was intense. Mole rat wonder meat. I think so. I like how my lock picking is lower now. Mm -hmm. You're feeling slightly unwell. Yeah, definitely. Hey, at least we um, what's the the leather armor has like no value at all. So we're gonna drop that. Still massively over encumbered because this light, ar yeah, this this armor is nuts. Combine these Chinese pistols. That sniper rifle of his looks amazing though. It uses 308s. I kind of want this. Bonus critical chance on that sniper rifle is crazy too. Yeah. Like I, I'm gonna have to get back to Megaton, and we're gonna have to. Uh... Yeah, there's there, there's no question about it. Let's see, the armor on this is what? Uh, it has one damage threshold and nothing else. Screw that. This combat helmet has three, uh, five damage reduction and one damage threshold, so it's de facto better than this pyrotech helmet, which is awful. Get rid of it. Keep doing the wrong thing. There we go. I want to sell these two armors, but uh, more importantly, I need to get myself some heals desperately. So... Uh... My goodness. Yeah, bandits are kind of crazy. This is, this is... We're gonna have to just kind of waltz out while the, the bandits like... This is bullshit. Yeah, we, we gotta get out of here. Oh, jeez. We, we need to get back to see a doctor. I'm hoping that I don't get shot, like, through the, the side there. Hiding from me? Better hope I don't find you. I'll be back. I'll be back. Just, just drink some dirty water and you'll be okay. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Uh, jeez. I mean, you're not wrong. Uh, y you really aren't. Like, that's something I should do. But I also need to get my uh, limbs cured. Have you tried Fallout the Frontier? Hiding from me? <laughs> I hope I don't find you. Uh-oh. SpaghettiOs. Let's go. Yeah, we're, we're gonna... We're gonna trudge our way back to Megaton and get ourselves repaired. This area is awful. Wow. How far away is it? Too far. But we need to drop some stuff. There's no question about it. If we drop one of these armors, we should be good to go, I think. And we can we can get the yeah, we can get the other one next time. So we drop the armor out in front and hopefully we'll be fine by the time we get there. We're going to Megaton. Yes. <laughs> Oh, boy. Yes. Yeah. I, I, it was a great bit of drama, though. I'll say that right now. Like, the whole circus surrounding Fallout the Frontier was incredible drama. Uh, get, a, get a companion to carry extra loot. Where would we get a companion here? Definitely can't do that right now. We're just getting started. Oh boy. But no, you should definitely check out the mod list if you are interested in what I'm using. Because uh, it is absolutely... What did you think of Brutal Wolfenstein? It was fun. Also, YouTube hates it. YouTube thinks that Brutal Wolfenstein contains, um, naughty things. Yes. Yeah, you Former Raider in Megaton? Interesting. He is coming with the clouds. Sex out is a thing. You just don't know about it. You came in here on your own power, so you must not be busted up too bad. <laughs> Yes, no words would suffice for what uh, Fallout the Frontier is. Let's put it like that. 
All right, I'm hurt. Help. Good lord. Good lord. This may sting a little. You're just going to get yourself killed out there, you know. Yes. Not that you'll listen to me. All right, okay. that should do it. You need anything else? No, no. Uh, I, uh, I didn't talk to you. Hold on a second. Whoops. Hey. For Christ's sake. For Christ's sake, yes. I, medical supplies, please. Thanks. Yeah? Yeah. My goodness. But yeah, the the whole um the whole circus around Fallout the Frontier was amazing. The the the, the just unmitigated drama uh, around it. My goodness. Who's the mod author saw my video? Cool. I mean, it was fun. Absolutely. Just uh you know, I wish that YouTube didn't hate it so much. All right, let me see here. Uh, geez, what was I doing? Oh yeah, armor, armor, armor. We were gonna go with the uh, sadist armor, and then we were gonna get rid of some of the uh, miscellaneous junk that we have that we probably don't need. Scrap like we, we need the scrap metal. We need to give those over, but. Um... Yeah, we keep the sensor modules, scrap electronics we can get rid of. What else? The fusion battery, dog hide. Sure, everything looks good. We'll get rid of the mini nuke because honestly, we're never ever going to use that uh, on this character, so it's fine. Mm. You didn't even hear about the frontier until now. Trust me. You done? Yes, I'm done. Thank you. Yeah, the frontier is special. Women and children of the What's Earth. happening? Yep. So first things first, we need to figure out who to trade to next. I think we've traded to everybody around. The last thing we need to do, we can go up and we gotta turn the scrap metal. Should be up at the water plant. Yep. I mean, there are other authors who are trying to correct Fall at the Frontier, if I if I remember correctly. So it's possible we you might get something good later. Uh, or something decent out of it. You know, like the, the quote-unquote meh campaigns that you were talking about. Uh, the only one that's... Um, the, the the campaign where you went to space definitely goes away. You, you just sold a mini nuclear warhead to a doctor. Yes. Yes, I did. I'm sure he'll have good use for it. Shove um, it up his ass. Oops. Yeah, what is it? Okay. Scrap metal. I sure am, Sonny. Yep, take it all. Well, all right. Let me count out your caps. Damn right. Okay, so. We're going. Yeah, well, the original creator didn't give them, them much choice. He wanted to show off what you could do in the Fallout New Vegas engine. He just didn't care uh, about the consequences uh, you know, like, uh, how, how it actually, you know, made the story or the, the overall gameplay experience. He didn't care about that. Hmm. Thinking less shotgun, more sniper rifle. Gonna stream Starfield? Assuming it plays well on my computer, yes. Assuming Starfield chooses to play well on my computer, I will stream it. Keep in mind, um... There are games that uh, run well, like, say, Fallout 4, and there are games that run uh, awfully, like uh, Fallout 76. And so, I ha like, depends on how well Starfield will run on my PC. Um, remember that I'm not running Windows, I'm running KDE. So, um, y you know, like, uh, it might work, it might not, who, who knows? Um, yes. Minimum specs, oh boy, oh boy. That's, that's it. Yep, no problem there. Okay. Anyway, anyway. G give me a, give me a second here. And, uh, we'll be back to it. Okay. <clears throat> give me a moment. Hmm. Alright. We should be good. Up. 
The hotel was on its way to Grey Ditch, and I think we should plunder the hotel some more. We've been, uh... We, for those who are unaware, those who don't know about this character's details, we go to stats, we go to perks, and read this trait that the character started with, okay? We are a hoarder, okay? So we need caps. We need lots and lots of caps. And we're going to get them by uh, plundering. We'll be back to this place later, for sure. The NCR, uh, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. You know, redo the NCR of, um... I, <laughs> I'm just thinking of that Call of Duty part where you have to go around killing your own, uh... uh like, like, all the wounded soldiers, you have to go put them down, and then it, it puts you into a different sequence, and then a different sequence, and a different sequence. Uh... Honestly, though, who really does need to add the Enclave? It's fucking stupid. I understand, like, I personally like the idea of, quote-unquote, playing as the baddies. But, um, yeah, they, they, like, people put too much emphasis on it. Mm hmm Hollowed out rock near Megaton? Uh, yes, I definitely missed out on that. Sorry. No starting gear for me. We are, uh, we are absolutely positively not, uh, not doing that. We are, uh... No, no way. Uh-uh. We, we earned all our gear through ridiculous circumstances. Mm-hmm. Ahem. Hold on a second. You you can't unsee paint me like a French girl a la carte? Well, too bad for you, I suppose. Oh, well. Let's, uh... Let's get back to it, shall we? There you go. Ha, ha, ha. Gray Ditch. We've been told... Oh, shit. Uh, fire fire ants? What are fire ants doing? Yes. Yep, someone mentioned it before. It's a bit metagamey. I mean, it's cool that it exists. But, uh, yeah. Mm-hmm. Let me see here. Mm hmm I'm in combat with something. It's over here. There it is. Shoot the head. So, Gray Ditch. A wonderful place full of wonderful people. Kill it! Okay. 10 millimeter blowing people's heads off, yeah. It's quite silly. Just need to be careful because they, they spit fire. That, the, these ants literally spit fire if you let them get close. So this is Grey Ditch. Let's go. Yeah, this recently built shack is locked. Still in combat. Yeah, I'm still in combat. Targets this way. There it is. Come on. Got him. Yeah, f literal fire ants. Magical fire ants. Okay, I think I've dealt with all the enemies, so let's, uh... Oh, jeez. Gray Ditch is something else. Hello. Palowski. Preservation shelter. Interesting. <clears throat> Let's see what else we got here. Nuka. Barely use that liquid nitrogen. Mm-hmm. A nearly invisible orchestra. Crunchy mute fruit. Yeah, but I think the big, the main issue with, uh, whoop, hold on. 
The main issue with the uh, Fallout the Frontier being Fallout the Frontier is that it, uh, it it tried to like treat itself like a AAA game. Uh, you, you know, like as far as oh, we'll have separate campaigns and side stories and things like yeah. I, most people just want a sandbox to explore. Mo uh, honestly, that, that most people just want a sandbox and uh, some cool stories in that sandbox. Well, of course, Indril is better, but I mean, so was Narum for Oblivion. So, you know, we we can't say much. Got overhyped. I, you know. Oh, hello. Those monsters, they're, they're gonna get me. Uh, what's the matter, kid? Those things. They keep coming. They scare me. Make it stop. I see. It's okay, kid. I'm a big, tough guy. You look stronger than all the other grown-ups. Can you... Can you protect me? Uh, I'd like to help. I need no more first. Those big things. They're all over Great Itch. And they killed everyone. Mm -hmm. Please, please find my papa. I was gonna say, uh, all right, I'll go look for your father. You will? My house is the one closest to the huge sign and the old diner. Okay. Please, find my papa and make him come back. Uh, okay, look, uh, anything else you can do might help save lives. You know, maybe this will help and maybe it won't. But papa hid a bunch of stuff behind the old diner and a dumpster. He trusted me with the key and said it was for emergencies. But I bet he wouldn't mind you having it. That's right. Very good. Anywhere you can hide while I search? Well, there is the personal shelter next to the old diner. Mm -hmm. Papa always said to stay away from it. But I guess it's supposed to be safe. No. I'll head over there and wait inside. Hurry back. Yep. Okay. Those is the name of the quest. We have a quest to kill ants. We have to find this guy's father. Oh boy, I can't wait to get the special ant perk. What was the ant perk for again? I forgot. But, um, yeah, there's supposed to be something by, like, behind the diner dumpster with the, it's locked. And then it has a pistol, uh, ammo, casings, frag grenades, right away. Okay, that's not too bad. The right away is important. Well, we'll, you, we'll end up using that in the, uh, wherever the hell it is. Stupid monsters. Can't get me in here. Can't get me in here. Yep, the 12 grenades are nice, I suppose. Um, yeah, we can't open that lock right now. We have to keep exploring. suppose I'll, uh, disable the map marker, though. Yeah, remove the map marker. It's gonna confuse me. Uh, carton of cigarettes. Sure. There's going to be a lot of places around here to look, so... First things first. <laughs> well, what do we got? More ants. Pretty sure it's going to be more ants, yes? Oh, yeah, it's more ants. Those. Them. Yeah, its head is crippled. Okay. Ant meat is good. There's more. There are ants outside. Getting thirsty. Shouldn't be a big deal. Mm-hmm. The boomer shooter section? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's good. Thank you. Cool. What's next? Yes. Uh, the, the kid could be... Uh... Oh, there's an institute here. Great. Uh -huh. Got um. Whoop. That ant had no loot. Okay. What we need to do is go to Springfield and sleep for the night. Uh, then we need to head on, um finish selling all our junk. Uh, I guess we should probably hang out in Springfield for a couple days, force the Megaton vendors to reset. What's the re default reset timer in Fallout New Vegas for vendors? It's, it's like two days, right? Like 48 hours, something like that? 
Okay. Mm hmm. Three days. Okay. Cool. Yeah, yeah. So, um, we'll just head on over to, um, let's head on over and, uh, rest in Springfield for three days. And if we're in Springfield, the, because the cell is active, it won't, um, uh, uh, the the corpse re uh, despawn is a cell reset. That's what we're talking about. Yeah, uh, Springvale School. So we'll, we'll head over there. We'll drink from the fire hydrant again. <clears throat> yes. Oh, oh, to make nights darker? Probably not. They definitely look darker on my uh, stream preview though, for some reason. Than they do for me but I have a slight tint on my monitor and that's because I don't um, I don't see blues quite the same as everyone else does like I can't differentiate them as well so like there's um, I just kind of turn blues into not blue and so as a result like all, all of my colors are slightly slightly different and as a result I um, I don't necessarily, um, bring veils this way. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Do -do. My goodness. Yeah, if you check my mod list, it's actually very, uh, the very, uh, small load order. Very small. Yes. But yeah. Like, a cell doesn't reset if you're in it. So, what I figure I'll do right now is just in case I made a horrible mistake, I'll save it here. And then, um, yes. Do you drag all the respawning NPCs to one spot in the cell? You can mow them down when they respawn in the same spot? That's weird. I didn't, I, I, don't think that's the thing. Any crashes? No. I've died uh, once. My goodness. Partially colorblind? Barely. Barely. It's literally just differentiating shades of blue from each other. That's it. Everything else is perfectly normal. Okay. Uh, yeah, we should be set. The, the Springfield is where we're gonna <clears throat> nap. We're gonna drink from the sink, though. You betcha. Yep. Yeah. Okay. So we sit here for 24 hours. Then we take a. S uh, we don't. We don't really need a sip of water. So let's one. Two. And then should be three. Gore bed indeed. That should do it. Third day. Okay. Now that we've waited three days, we should be very unhappy. Uh, minor starvation and minor dehydration. This is great. So dehydration is especially bad. That should do it. How's our dehydration level? 56. Barely uh, existing. Sleep with the gore. You bet. You bet. We, we slept with the gore. I like to think I swept it off, but the game does not want to let me, so... You know, I have to headcanon it. Alright, pork and beans. What else? Uh, not a red roach meat, but like Salisbury steak. How are we doing in terms of starvation? We're still minus one strength. So, uh, I mean, the yup patch fixes a lot of stuff. Yum yum deviled eggs. Another Salisbury steak. How are we doing now? Chase. That is a lot. Three days is a lot of de uh, food debt. Jeez, like, that's not how humans work, but whatever. I'm, I'm gonna just kind of accept it and be like, okay. I'd like to be able to cook some of this stuff, though. That'd be great. Yep. 
We should be fine. So yeah. Yes, food doesn't heal. Hunger is good. It's true. Well, hopefully Megaton has uh, completely restocked itself now. That would be nice. We'll see in a second. So we come out here. And in theory, these have restocked themselves. No, I guess they don't respawn. The Spr Springfield stuff doesn't respawn, I guess. Oh, wow. Something exploded over there. I think the iBot just got destroyed. Wait, what? Oh, it was a tin can. Don't care. Don't care. There's an ant meat there. Oh. I saw an explosion. And I don't know why. Cellar door here. Let's have a look inside. Oh, sexy sleepwear. Excellent. All right. The time has come for our character to achieve his final form. Aww. That's sad. The female sexy sleepwear does not go on the male character. This is not not sexy on ma on female characters the sexy sleepwear actually looks uh, pretty decent yep not female one out of ten exactly we, we will never be able to achieve uh, transcendence now yes yep let's take off our uh, army helmet real quick there we go. No problem. Very watch good. It, will you? What do you mean? What do you mean watch it? Looking to trade? Uh, yes, I am. How'd you know? It's my pleasure to offer hot death in a variety of exciting flavors. Uh, yes. How about pick. how about that? And those sell you the Chinese pistol. Say those ten frag grenades I picked up and don't need. Uh, what else? Uh, the nail board. Good. I think we're set. Actually, it'd be nice if I could get some more thirty-two rounds. These are piercing. Yep, Th those are armor-piercing rounds. They don't necessarily need those, but be interesting to have nonetheless. Uh, do, 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 do. Don't need the single shotguns. Fuck it. We're good. Yep. So, be nice to get the sniper rifle repaired so we can start using uh, 308 rounds. That would be good, but uh, I guess it doesn't matter a whole lot. I, uh... Want to make sure we're all set. So, dirty water, human flesh. None of that matters. None of that really matters. The food sanitizer we hold on to. I think we're good to go. I think we've gotten everything we need. I just want to make absolutely certain that we were in a good spot. Uh, liquid nitrogen's hilarious. Oh, liquid nitrogen counts as a uh, ammo. I guess because there's like a cryo gun or something. No idea. Shit, these two Chinese ops manuals give you permanent sneak plus one. I had no idea. We, we, we got two of them. That's great. Permanent sneak plus one. Wow. Holy crap. Give me a shout if you need it. Okay. Uh, now, where would we get a hot plate for cooking? I'm going to think of it. Uh, I hadn't thought about that. Preparing weapons costs a ton, yes. Were you just kidding about disarming that mm -hmm. thing? Mm -hmm. My goodness. Okay. Uh, can't go in there right now. Skill books get carried over uh, at the same time as perks and quests. I believe so, but uh, fuck it. Yep. Permanent sneak increase. Uh huh. That's why they're plus one instead of plus three. I assume so. Yep. Because they they will be carried over. Um, Good to see you. I guess we don't need to worry about any of this. We're supposed to go to minefields to continue Moira's quest, but I don't think that's going to happen. I think we've got a lot of other nonsense we have to worry about. 
Uh, give me a sec. I need to poke out a couple more things before we go. I say that. It's continually making that sound. Give me a sec. Oh, uh, boy. Move away. No graphical mods other than a single faces mod. Other than that is in 100% vanilla graphics and animations. Oh, boy. Yes. Give me a sec. I still have to poke at something else. I just want to move away from that annoying noise. Uh, very good. Very good. Uh, that should do it. I'm, I'm good. Are you playing it on normal? Yeah. I suppose it's, we should be uh, bumping it up, shouldn't we? You're right. Let's, let's bring it up to uh, very hard and see what happens. There we go. We'll see. We brought it up to very hard. I mean, uh, normal was pretty adequate, but uh, we'll see how very hard works out for us. We might br we might bring it back down afterward. Don't know yet. Okay. At least you can manually save. Yes. Yes. Uh, hardcore mode is fucking stupid. So. <laughs> All right. Join Fallout 3 Factions fa No. I, I, I barely, like... I'm pretty sure I don't have those mods. Anyway. Let's get going. So we, we need to go to Minefield, I get. It's either Minefield or uh, we need to go to the... I guess Minefield's... No, Minefield's way too far away. If we head over to Grey Ditch, we can probably get that solved pretty quick. But there's also Cooper's Hotel. Like, that's right in front of it. My goodness. Anyway. Uh, Cooper's Hotel's on the way to Grey Ditch, and we should get that done. The kid's like, please, I'll, I'll sleep in the shelter. I'll, I'll stay in this little tube. It'll be safe. Okay. Mm-hmm. Fallout 4 survival that you only have to do in beds? Yeah, Fallout 4 survival. I, I, again, I, I ended up... Uh, I end up fixing that in my playthroughs as well. Who, who knows? Who knows? Mm hmm. Let me see here. Yeah. Mostly we've disabled the hardcore parts of hardcore. And um, uh, the only thing that we really care about is the hunger, thirst, and uh, fatigue. That, that adds, like, a pacing mechanism, gives a real reason to have food other than, you know, mass healing. And just generally makes the game... Oh, boy, doggy, vicious dog! That's pretty impressive. Yeah, well. Let's double check that it's on very hard. Uh, gameplay. Yep, very hard. Okay. We're good. Yeah, I don't really care about the hardcore part of hardcore. Uh, what I want is the, um, what do you call it? Um, one. Shoot. Got to get it out, out of there. There we go. We're set. That thing is terrifying. Yeah, that thing is scary. Mm-hmm. The dog uh, dodged three bullets. Yes, the dog did. What the dog doing? Okay, all the bandits should be respawned now. Which is fine. But it means that we gotta... Oh, no, no. It doesn't look like the cell reset. The doors are still open. Oh, you know, there's a bandit there. It's killing time. It is killing time, yes. It's killing time. I'm gonna tear your fucking throat out. Oh, jeez. Okay, hard is definitely harder. I expected to have an easy time of it. Yep. Terrifying. Okay. Right. Well, the, the sleep and the hunger, thirst, that usually acts as a pacing mechanism in, in their games. Which is good. I like it a lot. Here we go. Hold on a second. 
Yep, we should be good. Wonder meat. Ah, fuck it. Wonder meat. Here we go. We're set. It just uh, damage sponges. Yes, it's fine. We mostly just want their all everything. Yep, we're over encumbered, and that's fine. Is there? Yep, liquid nitrogen. Fuck. So uh, now what we do is we we repair their armor using their armor. Then we drop the sexy sleepwear because it sucks now. And we also drop the helmet because it sucks as well. More importantly, the single shotguns we want to continue repairing with. Cool. Uh, we're also going to drop that sniper rifle. It's just not for us right now. Don't get me wrong. We're definitely going to approach it later probably. But uh, yeah. I dropped the baseball bat. I need it just in case I run out of ammo. But, um, yeah, Stop we're set. Death. I don't know what's down there. Okay. There will probably be more Ready enemies. To die. It'll all be over soon. It will all be over soon, yes. Beers and water. Uh, more beers and wines? Sure. Okay. Yeah, the sexy sleepwear just ain't working. I I'm annoyed because... Oh, there's more wonder meat here. Cool. I was going to say, though, um, the sexy sleepwear is unfortunate because um, it would have been awesome to Come see on, him dressed like I that. A quick death. Uh -huh. Oh, damn. Damn, 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 damn. This guy is has heavy armor on him. Yep. I'm out, I'm out of ammo. Fuck. Pistol time. Head headshot. Headshot. Damn it. God damn it. Thankfully my armor is uh is holding. Yeah. The flamer's interesting for sure, but uh Oh boy. Okay. You can play an actual femboy in Fallout 4. That's true. That's absolutely true. Dang. Hello, sir. <laughs> Glorious. As I said, though, I don't need cheesecake for every meal, even though I rather enjoy cheesecake. I, I said that back during the... Um, uh, during the, uh, the, pe the losers screaming about, uh, the, f the, what is it called? The, uh, the fable trailer character not looking, uh, attractive. And it's like, not every character needs to look attractive. That's what mods are for. <laughs> no need to hide. It'll all be over soon. Okay. Ah. Oh. You can understand if you, 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 oh boy, uh. Only a fucking cow would hide. I'm sure that's true. Oh. No Man's Sky is not even close to the Outer Worlds. Yes. They are not even a little apart. similar. Okay. Kick ass! Kick ass! Okay. Aid, we need some uh, stim packies. Yes. Here we go. Hello there. Good to see ya. We got her. Damn right, 20 gauge. I guess that's it for the shotgun then. We leveled up. We did it. This is perfect. Hey, oh, we, we don't get the level up menu until combat's over. That's that's fine. Come on out. I promise. A yeah, because we're in death. combat with that guy. So be careful. Come on out. Escapism. What if I want to escape to an uglier world? Exactly. Exactly. We're gonna step out and level up. There we go. 
Okay, explosives. Explosives need to be 25. Yes. We get our player home now. We're going to save. We're going to disarm the bomb and get our player home. And then uh, we'll be able to actually store stuff. And we won't have to cons constantly consider what we're carrying and where. Uh, that's, that's good. That's good. So, yeah, yeah. We're, 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 we're investing in explosives. There's nothing else we can use grenades now. But um, let me double check to see if there's anything else I want to work toward. Survival. Let's, yeah, let's put uh, a couple more points into sur No, nope, no, nope, guns. Extra points are always into guns. Uh, I, I, I need to remind myself of that. Okay. So, um, we got a lot of perks we can potentially pick from. They're all pretty good. Uh, but really, the intense training uh, goes to um, goes to strength. We, we are now um, no ten no ten penny tower. No, no, we 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 blew up um, well, we blew up Megaton our last playthrough, and now we're going to go and um, actually do our um, our big gam. Uh, yeah, we're gonna do Megaton house this time. Because again, last playthrough I did, I, I blew up the thing. Yeah, uh, we, we are we are we are strength we're strong, we're somewhat charismatic and we're smirked, but we're not very lucky. That is true. Yep, we're very strong. It lets us carry more stuff for our hoarder perk. Yes, point lookout is fun. I agree. Um. Yep. 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 My goodness. You're guessing the trailer is ugly for parody? Yes, but you can always... Um, you can always guess when... Um, it, yeah, you know, you're, you're jo half joking about that. Let's, let's unequip our combat helmet. And and yeah, yeah, we, we definitely have that uh, that look, don't we? It's, it's pretty funny. <laughs> oh, I fucking love it. It's so... It, it is so, uh, what do you call it, um, it, 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 a little, little bit of contradiction there, and it's glorious, glorious. I'm having fun with it. Okay. Oh, boy. The contrast. Contrast is the word I was looking for. Yes, the, the contrast between the face and the, uh, the hairstyle is glorious. I love it. Okay, onwards. Okay, we're gonna is... disarm that bomb now. Pretty sure it was just 25, so it was worth the level investment to get our player home. If nothing else, we'll be able to spam grenades now. So, uh, hello. Yep, we're going to uh, disarm that. Actually, hold on. Mr. Burke will uh, uh, ask us a question. And, um, I, I guess because yeah, we're, we're definitely not having a ten penny tower home. But let's let's listen to Mr. Let's hear Mr. Burke out before we unilaterally decide to you know not do it. So I, I I'm curious about it. Give me a sec. Uh, what's this? This is the armory. I uh, I didn't I I liked Fable. I haven't played the Lost Chapters though, so I can't tell you a whole lot about it. But I did like the uh, original fable that I played. You want something? Hey, Miss. Okay, get ready for the Imperial soldier. Every, uh, sorry, the, the, your average Imperial from Oblivion. He's back. Let's listen to this amazing man. He's. I'm gonna turn up the game sound a bit so you can hear him better. Uh, get ready for it. The, this is this is him. My my, just when I had all but given up hope, my dear boy. I'm very happy to make your acquaintance. I am Mr. Burke. Lucian. And you, well, you are not a resident of this putrescent cesspool. That makes you a rather valuable individual. Yeah, Lucian Lachance. Ahem. Mr. Burke, is it? Please continue. I find myself enthralled. Finally, someone with a modicum of civility and common sense. I represent certain interests, and those interests view this town, this megaton, as a blight on a burgeoning urban landscape. You have no connections here, no interest in this cesspool's affairs or fate. You could assist us in erasing this little accident off the map. Mm -hmm. 
Absolutely. Uh, ooh, ooh, wait, you're a sick man, this conversation. Did you know they removed this guy from the Japanese version of the game so he can't blow up the town? Because, you know, there, there are cultural consequences, what with, um, you, you know, uh, nukes. Anyway, uh, go on, I'm listening. The undetonated atomic bomb for which this town is named is still very much alive. All it needs is a little <laughs> motivation. I have in my possession a fusion pulse charge constructed for a singular purpose. Mm -hmm. The detonation of that bomb. You'll rig it to the bomb, then you'll get paid handsomely. What do you say? Uh, uh, throw in 500 extra caps and you got yourself a deal. Is that the best you can do? I'm afraid I'm not impressed. Okay. Sims wants me to disarm the bomb. Sims is an idiot. He prides himself on his position as mayor and sheriff of this scrapyard. I told Sims I'd disarm him. Maybe some extra caps would change my mind. Is that the best you can do? What's in it for me? You mean... Besides doing the world a favor by removing this pestilent scab of a town? Why, you'd be rewarded most handsomely. My employer is a very generous man. If it's bottle caps and luxury you're seeking, you shall have it. Mm -hmm. Megaton is under my protection. You're going to leave now. Oh, I see. I didn't realize Megaton had any guardian beyond its intrepid sheriff. Very well, then. I'll take my leave, as you suggested. Yeah. All right. Let's quick save and then shoot him in the head. Damn. Why are you still here? Fight! Him. You gained karma. That's right. Good, Good riddance. riddance. Good riddance, everyone said. That's right. And now, every his house key, Mr. Burke, is mine. I now have access to Mr. Burke's house and everything else. That's it. He's gone. Gob! I know, I know. I'll get him up. It's just... Blood is so hard to get out of the floor. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Blood is so hard to get out of the floor. Good riddance. Yes. Yep, 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 yep. Let's go disarm that bomb. Let's go. Absolutely. Ahem. For this ancient uh, weapon of yes. war hey. is our salvation. It is the very symbol of Atom's glory. Yes, well, attempt to disarm the bomb. Yep. Bam. Done. Let it serve as a reminder of the division. Hey, Lucas Sims, how's it going? I'll be damned. You did it, didn't you? You disarmed that thing. Mm -hmm. Here's your reward. Hell, why don't you move in? Could use someone like you. Got an empty place here you can use. Here's the key indeed. Damn right. It ain't much to look at, but talk with Moira. She's got random odds and ends you might be able to spruce the place up with. Damn right. Alrighty then. Power of the Take atoms care. plate. Mr. Burke is dead. And I now have a house in Megaton. Right here. Hey, Wadsworth. Very nice to make your acquaintance. I'm your new Robo Butler. It's Wadsworth. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Wadsworth, your personal robotic butler. I am here to look after your needs and to keep you happy and entertained. What can I do for you? Mm hmm. Alrighty then. I'd like something to. Actually, hold on a second. Can I. Uh, where is. Uh, tell me a joke. Yes, it's common knowledge that the irradiated cats have 18 half-lives. Okay, thank you. You have yourself a fine day, sir. Very good. 
Yes, uh, so. Oh, we've got food. We're gonna, gonna put all our, um, I was gonna say, let me, let me see here. Okay. We need a hot plate. We got a bobblehead stand. There, our medicine bobblehead has been placed. Uh, the smart man knows how to bandage only. Um, ooh, hides his wound. Here, hold on. Okay. First things first. A irradiated cat, boys. Oh, no. Oh, no. So, we're gonna put this extra pistol here. Uh, the si oh, the silence. Hold on a second. What's the difference? What's the okay? DPS is 31, DPS is 44. So this is actually th it does less damage because it's suppressed. That makes sense. Um, as for this shotgun, we'll put that away for now. Yeah. So we'll just kind of run with what we got here. Put away all of that for now. This is just our apparel. Good. So. Uh, it appears you've been wounded, sir. May I suggest you seek medical attention yes. as soon as possible? We recorded a thousand of the most popular names for him to say. Oh, boy. So, um... Yeah, yeah, we're just going to put away all our aid items in here. And we'll pull out specific ones we want later. But this way, uh, we don't have to worry about being over-encumbered all the time. So, uh, whoops. I did not mean to do that. My bad. Got my miscellaneous back. Thank you. Uh, ammo as well. Okay. Ahem. So, we're going to grab a couple items. Squirrel bits. Uh, apples. Dirty water. Uh, medics. Jet. Because these don't have weight. So, I'm, I'm pulling out the ones without weight. Five Nuka Colas. Psycho has no weight. The Radex has no weight. Two purified waters. All the rat away. Uh, the rebound. The stim packs. Super stim packs. Turbo. And we'll pull one vodka and one whiskey. And there we go. Now we're in a much better situation. We got all our extra food in here. That is great. Uh, Terraria is fun. I, I haven't played it since the update that added the wall of flesh and like the the hollow versus the, uh, you, you know, like super corruption. Uh, been a lot. Like I, I played. That was the last update I played when they added like the wings and stuff. The uh, the underground jungles. That that's the stuff. Jeez, I'm I'm like my my combat armor's entirely busted. Yep, I'm sad. I hope things are going well with you today, sir. Okay. Mm -hmm. So. I was looking at all the miscellaneous stuff. I'm thinking what we're going to keep up here. Uh, I suppose, like, there's all kinds of miscellaneous stuff I'm going to keep in this filing cabinet. Okay. Yep. So, like, miscellaneous items that have weight, we're probably going to put here. So, like, uh, not the casings per se, but, like, the sensor modules. Sensor modules are great. You take them to the uh, Brotherhood Outcast and they go, Ahem. It's practically junk. How'd you like your payment? And that's all well and good. All right, we, we've got... Um, we have to go soon. Uh, so before I do, I'm going to first do a regular save because that, that was good stuff. Uh, now I'm going to go down and see Moira and see if she, we can buy a hot plate so I can cook. Uh, yeah, that armor broke. Broke, I say. But uh, we'll, we'll spend like a thousand caps to get Moira to fix it sure that oh shit her thing isn't open yet uh wait one hour billy says not to talk to you okay thanks billy hello how are those hot little potatoes give me a second uh i haven't been there hold on okay first things first i need to uh repair my equipment if you yes you've got the skill my metal armor 600 ca fuck that's expensive it is so expensive okay there we go we did it. It's not cheap. Yeah. Okay, we're set. Jeez. Um. Yeah. Uh, let's go. What do you have for sale? Sure thing. Okay. Uh, should be like house items, right? Mo Moira should have. Yeah, my first laboratory. Hot plate. I just need a hot. Yeah, give me a hot plate. 
Uh, don't need the Nuka Cola machine right now. The reloading bench would be lovely, though. Um, let's see. Yeah, my my first laboratory. A workbench. She's I, I, yeah. I can't. I don't think I can afford that. Um, we'll start off with the hot plate, and then we'll work our way towards the other uh, rewards as we go. Good hunting. But yeah, we have we have a home now. So we Hell don't day, have to worry it? too much. Like, and our uh, our armor's good. Uh, yeah, we, we should be good to go. So, let's go. First things first, go back to our house, check the hot plate. I want to see if we can cook anything, if we are able to cook anything anyway. Hot plate should be upstairs, I take it. Uh, do, 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 do. <clears throat> In here, maybe? No, it's over by the refrigerator. It's got to be, yeah. There it is. Hot plate. Okay, ant bits. Cool. We can we can make we can make food out of this. We're gonna take everything from the uh, refrigerator. Now I know I spent all that time uh, doing that, but we can make ant. Yeah, we can make ant meat. Cool. We can make fire ant meat. Cool. And we can make steamed red roaches with our terrible dirty water. We are good. Welcome home, sir. We are good. I'm super happy about that. Okay, now we're gonna put stuff away. Uh, we're gonna keep the ant bits, obviously. No, fuck it. We're gonna put everything away again um, because it's gonna take too long for me to pick out individual things to put away, and then I'll make a mistake and be pissed. It's just so much easier to do it this way. Uh, of course, then I accidentally put away a couple other things like bobby pins. I'm like, but I need the bobby pins. Uh, that's it. Just eight. Okay. So ant bits we're keeping. Uh, one mac and cheese, bloat fly smoothies, fine. Ramen steak is fine. Buff out. Cat's eye. We're just any of the eight items that are not uh, that way is just kind of nuts. Uh, next Morrowind playthrough is going to be a while because the next time we play it in the Morrowind engine, it's going to be Starwind. Uh, I'm, I'm convinced I really want to do Starwind. So um, we'll take those fire ant bits too. That's some good food. Human flesh is not such a good food, but we don't worry about that. Hydra, Jet, Medics, Mentits. Uh, some five Nuka Colas, one Quantum, all the Psycho, purified water. Yeah, just just making sure we we get this good because I wanna. I'm, I'm getting ready for next time. She stealth boys are crazy. Uh, steamed red roach. We'll grab a couple of those. Those actually make you less thirsty, which is great. And that's it. Vodka, whiskey, and a wasteland hot dog. Yep, we're set. We are not over encumbered in the least. And this is good. Good, good, good. So, we got lots of food. I like how the Grognak the Barbarian comic goes in the refrigerator. It's fucking funny. Uh, but yeah, yeah. So, we're, we're, we're good. We're, we're set. We're, we're ready to adventure. Adventures question mark. Do we have a sink? Yeah, let's drink from the sink. Drink from the sink. Give me my rads. One, one more sip. One more sip. It's a wasteland hot dog. It's a very good question. Uh, wh wh how is the sausage made? Oh boy, what is a wasteland hot dog, and why does it give you two reds? Yes. Well, that's it for now. Our um, th this is the beginning of our amazing adventures in our amazing new wasteland home. We have in the first seven hours. Uh, so we've been playing for seven hours and twelve minutes, according to that. Um, it appears you've been wounded, sir. Don't May worry I about suggest it. you seek medical okay, attention? In, in that first amount of time, possible? we have successfully, uh, we, we've done it. We, we've made our wasteland home. So this is good. This is very good. TM. Uh, menu's off. It didn't work. Uh, okay. Hold on. I want to. I want to hit a button to kind of do that. There we go. Okay. Good. Now I got a screenshot, so uh, that should do it. We now have our own home, and we have a nice screenshot there. Progress has been made. I hope so, things are going. I'll be back uh, at some point in time, probably not tonight. But uh, according to this, according to this, tomorrow I should be able to stream a lot. So, um, <laughs> my goodness. Um, thank you all for watching this this fun fun thing again um, when, when this has been converted into its own um, what do you call it a video because it'll, it'll take a bit for YouTube to auto process it 
uh, w when I come back later tonight, I will go ahead and add the, the mod list to the uh, video description. Um, and not a whole lot to say. This is Fallout New Vegas and uh, Fallout 3 combined into a single video game. So the same character will go between the Capital Wasteland and the uh, and the Mojave. It'll be a, it'll be a fun little transition. Um, if you are interested, again, like my website, uh, will have the mod list. But I'm gonna take off. Now. So I will see y'all later. I'm gonna have dinner, and uh, I, I suspect very much that I will be unable. Um, uh, unable to uh, stream later tonight. If I can, I will, but um, I think I'll be busy. Bye, everybody.